Slam that like button if you love cookies. I love cookies. I'll slam the like button. Mmm, delicious. In this video, we're going on a special field trip today. If everybody will read the board, I've written where we're going on the board right here. <gasps> the White House? Are you kidding me? This is going to be amazing. Uh, what if the president will be there? Uh, what if I could get his autograph? Uh, what if I could get a picture? I uh, wonder if I... Um, could you quit being so annoying? Look at this. <laughs> Somebody made the president blueberry muffins. Mm, they're delicious. Molly Hooey, Mrs. A is coming. Okay, gotta eat this cupcake really fast. Mm, nom, 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 nom. Well, hello there. Ah, Mr. President. Wow, this is such an honor. Oh, <laughs> yeah, this is coming down for a muffin. I saved one last one. Uh, I wouldn't think you'd want to. It has so much bran in it, you'd be running to the bathroom every five seconds. Uh, wait. What? Good morning, everybody. Please settle in. Settle into your seats, please. And read the board. Today is a field trip surprise. I have the biggest surprise for you guys. And I'm expecting you all to be on your best behavior on the field trip. Ugh, oh, I bet this field trip is gonna be so lame. I know, right, Sarah? I totally agree. I don't know what you guys are talking about. I think the field trip's gonna be amazing and I don't even know what it is yet. Hey, guys, have you seen Molly? Oh, yeah, she's probably late. Again. One thing she's never late for is lunch. <laughs> Especially if we're having pizza and ice cream. Oh, man. I'm late. I'm late. I'm late. Oh, I hope I don't get detention. Well, well, well. Look who it is. Ah, thanks for finally joining us, Molly. <laughs> you're welcome. Molly, she wasn't meaning that for real. She's annoyed that you're late. Oh, um, uh, sorry. Please don't give me detention. Please, 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 please. Okay, Molly, no need to beg. You're not going to get detention. We're going on a special field trip today. If everybody will read the board, I've written where we're going on the board right here. The White House? Are you kidding me? This is going to be amazing. Uh, what if the president will be there? Uh, what if I could get his autograph? Uh, what if I could get a picture? I uh, wonder if I... Um, could you quit being so annoying? Um, she's just really excited, Sarah. You don't have to be rude. Well, she's really making my ears want to bleed. Ow! I have a question! I have a question! I have a question! Yes, Molly, what is it? Are they gonna have snacks there? <laughs> Cause I don't wanna go unless they have snacks. Lots and lots of snacks. I really do hope they have snacks. I love snacks on field trips. It's my favorite. Molly, all you ever think about is snacks, snacks, snacks. Who doesn't think about snacks? They're the most amazing, delicious, happiest thing ever. Okay, Molly. Let's talk about something else. Like, what about the fact that the president uh -huh. might be here? Whatever. Ugh, I just want to hang out with my friends and Snapchat. I love field trips. Mostly because that day we don't have any homework. And that's pretty much the happiest day of my life. Whoa, look at that! Whoa, the White House is gigantic! Okay, class, everybody out. I want to give you some rules, please. Rules, rules, schmools, rules. Make me want to rules, rules. Now, we are very privileged to be invited here today as a class. Did you know only two classes a year are invited to the White House? Wow. Which means no wandering. Stay with the group. I don't care if you have to go to the bathroom. I don't care if you need a snack. I don't care if the White House is, well, well on fire. You cannot leave from the group, okay? You'll get in trouble and we could maybe go to jail. Whoa, sounds serious. Exactly. The special permission was given to us for this field trip, so don't ruin it. Molly! Me? Ruin the field trip? <laughs> Why are you pointing at me? I wouldn't do that. Uh huh, sure you wouldn't, Molly. Sure you wouldn't. The president is very busy. You can see in his Oval Office that he has much work to do. Molly, would you like to come into the door, please? Ow! Ow! This, this door is broken! It keeps hitting me in the face! Ow! 
Ay, 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 Molly. I swear, I can't take my sister anywhere, especially not the White House. Okay, guys, let's go and take a look to the left. This is normally where the secretary is for the president. Wow. Whoa. His dining room. Whoa. Kitchen. Wow, I wish my kitchen was like this. Holy guacamole. Hmm, that looks so good. Molly, you're not supposed to eat the president's snacks. But I'm really hungry. When's lunch? I'm going to look in his fridge. Molly, you're going to get in so much trouble. <gasps> when Mrs. A comes, she's definitely going to get mad at you. But look at this. <laughs> Somebody made the president blueberry muffins. Mm, they're delicious. Molly, hurry. Mrs. A is coming. Okay, got to eat this cupcake really fast. I mean this muffin. Or whatever it is. It's just so tasty. Mm, 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 mm. Mm, delicious. What are you girls doing in here? I told you, you need to stay with the group. Molly, are you eating something? Oh, me? Nah, I'm not eating anything. <laughs> I was just chewing on my tongue. Yeah, that's it. <laughs> chewing on my tongue. Holy guacamole, Molly. Ay, ay, ay. Ugh, I shouldn't have ate that muffin. Because I ate it too quick, and now my stomach's kind of like gurgly, and ugh, I don't feel so good. Well, Molly, the teacher said there's no public restroom here. It's the president's house, so you can't use his potty. Hopefully, your tummy gets better soon. Yeah, Molly, it's a long way back to the school. Well, hello there. Ah, Mr. President. Wow, this is such an honor. Oh, <laughs> Yeah, I was just coming down for a muffin. I saved one last one. Uh -oh. Um, yeah, um, well, we don't know anything about your muffin in the refrigerator. Nobody ate it in our group. Oh, uh, I wouldn't think you'd want to. It has so much bran in it, you'd be running to the bathroom every five seconds. Uh, wait, what? Yeah, <laughs> once you get older like me, you need to eat a lot of fiber. You kids have a great time looking around the White House. Now, where did I put that muffin? <laughs> Bye, Mr. President. Nice to meet you. Oh, my God. I can't believe I ate the president's last muffin. Ah! Oh, my stomach is really hurting. Oh, boy, Molly. This isn't going to be good. But sorry. <laughs> I can't help but laugh. Because <laughs> only you would get yourself into this predicament, Molly. Oh, oh, my stomach. Uh-oh. Ew, Molly, did you literally just fart at the president's house? <gasps> um, better out than in? Molly, ew, somebody get some Febreze up in here. Ugh, this is lame. Ugh, what's that smell? Um, I think the pre- Um, <laughs> Sarah's laying on the floor. Uh, it's terrible. I'm dying. You're a bit dramatic. What's that smell? I think the president has a little bit of gas. Yeah, nice, Molly. Blame your problem on the president. Oh, I gotta find a potty. Gotta find one. Wait a minute. Is this a potty? Oh, MG! Yes, okay, I just gotta, just gotta go in here real quick. My teacher won't even notice. Molly, what are you doing in there, you silly goose? You're not supposed to go in the president's bathrooms. Get out here. Uh-oh. Bathroom breaks will happen when we get back to the school. Along with lunch. Oh, no. This isn't good. This isn't good at all. Okay, class, let's go take a look at the Oval Office. That's on the upstairs floor. Oh, oh. Whoa! Yeah. Molly, wow. I feel sorry that the president has to live here after you visited. <laughs> Molly, you farted the whole way up the stairs. Um, oopsie. Hold it right there. You have to make sure you are clear to go into the Oval Office. Um, okay. I heard that. Sorry, um, ate something funny for breakfast. Yeah, that's it. Try not to fart while you're in the Oval Office. The president doesn't like that. None of us like it, but we have to deal with her all the time at school. <laughs> oh, very funny, Sarah. Okay, I'll be the first one to go in. Whoa. OMG. Look at this. President Brookhaven. Holy 
Guacamole! This is amazing. Oh, my life is made. This is so cool. I want to go sit at the desk and pretend I'm president. Uh -oh. People of Brookhaven! I now decree that there will be no more homework, and every single night you shall eat pizza! Uh, Marty, good thing you're not president. What are you talking about? <gasps> Daisy, oh my god. Daisy, what did you do? I don't know, I didn't mean to push it, but whoa, there's some serious stuff going on in here. I'm out of here, you two are totally gonna get arrested. Whoa, what do you think this is about? I don't know, Molly. Should we push some of the buttons? I'd love to stay and see what it does, but... But I got a poo-poo! <laughs> What's wrong with you, kid? Nothing! Um, do you have a public restroom? No, this is the president's house. Of course we don't. Okay, class! Everybody back to the school bus! Hooray! Oh! Molly, we're not all in the bus! What are you doing? Why are you driving the bus? Because this is an emergency! Go to the bathroom really bad. Wait for me! Get on, Brookie! Come on! But you're terrible at driving. Let the bus drive or drive. Can't this bus go any faster? Um, Molly, no, it's a school bus. They're very slow. Oh, ah! I can't go poo poo. I can't go poo poo. Oh, uh, Molly, um, maybe you shouldn't have ate the president's brand muffin. No kidding! Oh, my stomach. We're almost there, Molly. Hold on. You can do this. No, I can't. No, I can't. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Molly, you're going to be fine. Everything's going to be okay. Okay. Oh, stomach hurts so bad. Gotta go, gotta go, gotta go. Oh, I've never been so happy to see Brookhaven School in my entire life. Sorry, bathroom's closed. Cleaning. What? No, get out. I have to go to the bathroom. Sorry, no can do. <laughs> no students allowed in the bathroom while the janitor's cleaning. Oh, what am I gonna do? Oh. Going crazy. <laughs> Going crazy. Gotta go, potty. Gotta go. Molly, are you okay? <laughs> Molly, what was that sound? Oh. M. G. Uh, Molly? Uh, I think you better go to the school nurse. Uh, I am humiliated right now. OMG, gotta Snapchat this. Molly's wearing the accident pants. <laughs> What'd you do? You're poo poo in your pants, Molly? Ew, what's in the bag? Your old poo poo pants? Yeah. Uh, Sarah, it wasn't her fault. She ate the president's muffin and um, had bran in it. Oh, I'm humiliated. Oh. This has literally been the worst day of my life. Oh no. Oh no, not again! Not again! Oh! Ew. Okay, can I go home? Cause Molly has got like a serious problem. Oh! <laughs> why did I eat that muffin? Oh! And this is why we follow the rules on field trips. You ate the president's brand muffin? Molly! Okay, well, let's go call your mom. It looks like you're going home. Ow. Come on, Daisy, let's play some soccer. Oh. Molly, where did you get that shirt? Isn't it adorable? <laughs> I love SpongeBob. Yeah. It is pretty cute, I have to say. Where did you get it? I might rot one. Uh, Daisy, get out of the road. Here comes a car. Oh, look. It's two losers. Hey, you ran over a soccer ball. Woo! O-M-G. That was so rude. Whatever, losers. <laughs> You'll never be a baddie like me. Um, uh, why would we want to be bad? That's that's not very nice. Being good is nice. Oh, uh, whatever with your stupid SpongeBob t-shirt <gasps> and your silly clothes and your silly faces. Ooh. Whoa, she's rude. See you later, losers. Bye! Oh my god. Daisy, what are we gonna 
too. I don't want to be a loser. We are going to become baddies. Well, I don't know about that. You know I'm not really into fashion and all that. Maddie, just try, okay? We need to fit in in Brookhaven, all right? All right, um, okay, um, yeah, all of my nerd shirts are pretty much not gonna work then. But look how adorable it is. Maddie, enough of the nerd shirts. Okay, let me type in baddie. I wanna see what comes up. No results found? Yeah, Maddie, being a baddie means you have to figure it out for yourself. All right, maybe I should start with a face because, um, I feel like the face is better than look at my shirt though i look so cute as a as a nerd buddy we're trying to be a baddies heel ah! guys i literally just put mean girl into the search and um everything i was looking for just came up so what's that say about being a baddie guys um that they're mean all right look at this face guys oh i have, do I have to buy it i think i have to buy it 65 dollars to be a baddie okay worth it totally worth it here we go guys now I'm gonna have the bad face. Oh my gosh! Buddy! It looks so different. Jesus, what's going on with your hair right there? That's really weird. You should usually get rid of that hair for sure. Alright, guys. Now I'm gonna go in and get some baddie hair. Let's get, oh, first I have to remove my other hair. Do not laugh at me, guys. Okay, don't laugh at me! <laughs> um, okay. Can I put in like mean girl hair? I'm gonna try it. Mean girl hair. Oh, we came up with stuff, guys. Like, look at this one. Oh, that is so awesome. Okay, I know for a fact that um, baddies definitely have to have giant eyelashes. I know because I've seen the girls in my school wearing these giant eyelashes. They're very important. Oh, God. Why did I say I was going to be a baddie with mommy? This is, like, such a bad idea. Um, It's a great idea. And look at my eyelashes. They're going to be amazing. Wow. All right, guys, let's try these ones. They're like giant. What? Why are they coming out of my eyebrows? Okay, that is weird. Let's try again. They're all coming out of my eyebrows. I may have to not have the eyelashes just because I don't know why, but they just look like really weird. <laughs> this isn't even over my eyes. Weird. Ooh, let's try this one. No, none of them work. Okay. Eyelashes are beautiful, just as they are, so whatever. I'm a good enough baddie. And if you don't think so, well, then you're not cool, and I am. All right, let's put in, like, mean girl outfits. Mean girl outfits and see what comes up. Good thing you can cheat at this and, like, put in mean girl outfits. You don't have to, like, know yourself. Like, some of these are ridiculous. This is, like, the Grinch. Like, look at this. <laughs> you're mean one, Mr. Grinch. Anyway... Um, why is that not clicking off? Oh, God, now I'm stuck wearing the Grinch outfit. Ooh. Seriously? No. No, no, and no. I need a baddie outfit. What's this one say? So fetch. <laughs> Old school. Um, all right, so I'm still looking for the best baddie outfit ever. Dizzy, I don't think that's the best baddie outfit. What do you know about being a baddie? Um, I'm pretty bad every time I don't do my homework, and that's, like, always, so, I don't know. I think I look adorable, though. Um, but what about, like, oh, my God, look, there's a book, there's a shirt that has burn book on it. Oh, that is so cool. Still not what I'm going to wear, though. Buddy, you take it forever. Okay, everybody, we're going to speed this up. <laughs> How's this, Molly? Uh, you look like a goth girl, but I guess that's okay. I mean, you look kind of bad. <gasps> but also, baddie is just, like, my look. I look amazing. I'm just saying. Whoa, Molly is all of a sudden, like, totally full of herself. She thinks she looks amazing. <laughs> uh, I do. So the first thing we need to do is have a car. Well, Molly, we don't have a car, just bicycles. Then I suggest that we borrow mom or dad's because, uh, yeah, we need a car. Let's go ask dad. Hey, who are you? And where's my pizza? Uh, if you're from DoorDash, then you forgot my pizza. Uh, Dad, no, it's me, Molly. And to be Daisy. What? But, but you're my little girls. Where are my little girls at? Dad, we're dressed up as baddies. Wow. Dad. 
dad. Oh my god, that made him disappear. It freaked him out so much. No, I'm right here, spasming on the floor. You used to be little babies just yesterday. <sighs> I have a good idea. Let's make dad up like a baddie. What? No, that's weird. No, it's not. Let's do it. Dad, you want a baddie makeover? Um. <laughs> dad, no choice. You're doing it. Oh, no. This is going to go badly. Ow. <laughs> dad, that's so you. Um. Ah! Dad, would now be a good time to ask you if we can borrow the car? If it means I can get out of these tight shorts, sure, and wipe this makeup off my face. Okay, Dad, fine. Um, ah! The washcloths are in the bathroom. There's some makeup remover in there. See you later. Come on, Betty Kitty. I'm in. Let's go. What are we going to do first? Well, the first thing we're going to do is go shopping because isn't that what baddies do? Yeah, but we have no money. What are we going to do about that? Um, we're going to go to the bank and rob it. We're baddies. Turn around. Marty! What? It's just Roblox. Come on. Live a little. OMG! Molly is about to go rob a bank. Molly? No. Molly and Daisy are about to go rob a bank. Now let's go. Daisy, put the pedal to the metal. This is a sports car, not a granny car. Sorry, Molly. She was your bossy as a baddie. <laughs> Let's go blow up the safe. Now, where is that explosive that I was going to use to open this door? Why did I forget my backpack? I guess baddies don't carry backpacks. Molly, we could just use the key card to open the door. Where'd you get that? I stole it out of the desk. Hey, you didn't let me in. There you go, cheapos. All right, can we use that to actually open this? Uh, I'm not really sure. I've never robbed a bank before. Let's try it. Nah, we're going to have to blow this part up. Kaboom! Uh, Molly, I think we should probably stand back. Holy guacamole! We're going to blow up the safe. This is going to be amazing. <laughs> stacks of cash! Stacks of cash! I just robbed stacks of cash! Molly, get in before the police get here. I'm such a baddie, they can't even catch me. Daisy, what are you doing? You're the driver. Hurry up before we get caught. Hi, Daisy, Molly. You are a crazy baddie. We're so bad that we're going to drive on the wrong side of the road. <laughs> oh, wow. That's super great. We'll get in a car crash, and then we can't be baddies anymore. Oh, whatever, Molly. So, should we go shopping, or should we just be, like, rude to people? Isn't that what a baddie does? I say we try being rude to people, but I don't know. I'm pretty nice, so probably can. Let's go to the library and pick our nerds. <gasps> yeah, that's what baddies do. Look at all my money. Look at, look at my lipstick. Look how rude I am. Nerd alert. Nerd alert. I don't actually know if I can, like, say that because normally I wear a SpongeBob t-shirt and, like, this feels so out of my personality. But here we go. <laughs> Hi, you want to read a book with me? Uh, want to, um, not be such a nerd? Was that a good insult? Yeah, Molly. Look at all the cash. We're rich baddies. <laughs> That's cool, but do you want to read a book with me? What are you, a robot? Is that all you know how to say? Sorry, you guys are just so pretty that I can't even think straight. <laughs> um, yeah, that's right. We are so pretty. Yeah. Molly? Sorry. <laughs> this baddie had a bean burrito for lunch. Molly, baddies don't fart. Um, correction. Everybody farts. Right, nerd? That's right. It's a human being thing. Everybody farts. <laughs> you seem like a dream girl to me. I like bean burritos. Ugh, you smell a little bad, though. <laughs> Not a chance. You couldn't get with me, nerd. I'm amazing. And I'm a baddie. I'm a baddie. Come on, Daisy. Leave the nerd alone. Come on, Daisy. Let's go get some Starbucks. Um, baddies always drink Starbucks. And um, they get an extra um, large latte. And it's so good because they get extra foam on the top. Yeah, that sounds delicious. We have so many stacks of cash. We could buy a thousand of these. Well, well, well. What do we have here? <gasps> what? Baddie competition? I don't think so. I'm the biggest baddie in Brookhaven. Not anymore, Steph. Now I'm the biggest baddie. Wait a minute. Am I a baddie too, Hugh, or not? Yeah, you could be a baddie, but 
Wait a minute. You, Molly and Daisy, the losers? You were wearing a SpongeBob t-shirt earlier today. Where did you get this makeover? It's called Roblox. You can be anybody you want. And right now, I'm a baddie. Look at my hair. Look at my face. Look at my eyelashes. Look at my lips. Look at my outfit. Look at my car. Look at my money. I'm way baddier than you. Uh, Molly, I don't think that's the way English. Stop sounding like a nerd there, nerdy baddie. <gasps> Molly, how dare you say that to me? Uh-oh, this is going to be a baddie fight. Oh, no, here he goes again. <laughs> Will you go out with me? I don't mind farts. Yes. <laughs> oh, yeah, you guys are real baddies. The school nerd is, like, wanting to date you. Well, Molly, he sounds like your soulmate. Oh. Daisy, be quiet. He doesn't sound like my soulmate. No, we're, we're, get out of here. We're not dating. You're so dreamy, baddie. Um, no, 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 and no. Ah! I don't think you're a baddie at all. Looks like all the nerds love you. Well, maybe we should have a competition to see who's the baddiest of all. <gasps> uh, Molly, I'm pretty sure that Steph's gonna win. We'll find out. We'll find out. Do you think I'm an awesome baddie? Let's see what they say. <laughs> I can't wait to see what they say. Hello? What do you think? Am I an awesome baddie or not? Ha ha ha. Uh, no. What? Uh, but I look amazing! <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> One point for me. What do you think? Do you think I'm an awesome baddie? Okay, she doesn't care. All right, let's go ask other people in Brickhaven if they think I look like an awesome baddie. Uh, I don't know what you got going on there, girl, but okay, here we go. Um, am I an awesome baddie? I mean, I know you got wings and stuff, so you're cooler than I am, but here we go. Am I an awesome baddie? Hey, where are you going? We're still talking. Okay, let me go ask them. Am I an awesome baddie? <laughs> Come on, answer me, please. Am I an awesome baddie? I need to prove to this um bully that I'm actually an awesome baddie. Anybody? Anybody answering? They think you're a loser. That's not what they're answering. Look at this girl. She looks like another baddie, so I'm going to go ring her doorbell. I'm going to ask her if she thinks I'm an awesome baddie. Hello? Is anybody home? I need you to prove that I'm an awesome baddie. Okay, I'm not sure anybody's home there. Um, Let's go down the street and see if there's anybody else home that I can ask them. I'm going to ask you one last time. Am I an awesome baddie? Come on, you better answer. There, whatever you are, fairy. Um, just answer. <laughs> she thinks you're a loser. She doesn't want to talk to you. Am I an awesome baddie? You better answer. If you don't, I'm just going to tell you, you smell. You smell! Okay, this is this is what this is what you would do if you were a baddie and they weren't saying what you wanted. Stinky. <coughs> Who farted? <laughs> He's not saying anything. Are you even in the game? Am I a baddie? Huh? Huh? You gonna talk to me? Huh? Are you gonna? Please, somebody talk to me! No, you're a fart. Okay, well, I guess I sort of deserve that since I've been talking about farts in the server like for the last 30 minutes. <laughs> hey, aren't I the best baddie ever? Like you've ever seen? What's a baddie? What, do you live under a rock? A baddie is me! Aren't I the best baddie ever? Just say yes, just say yes. Please say yes! Hey, I'm the bestest baddie ever, right? You can be anything you want. That's right! I'm the best baddie! Say, say I'm the best baddie! Say I'm the best baddie. Come on. I need to win this competition. I just need one person to say, I'm the best baddie. You're the best baddie! <laughs> I'm the best baddie! I'm the best baddie! Wait a minute. Dad? That's right, honey. You can be anything you want to be. Dad! <laughs> His opinion doesn't even count. Steph! Oh, man, Dad. This was supposed to be a competition. And, well... You don't count. What? Dear old dad can't tell you're the best baddie? I mean, I was just the best baddie, so you have to be the best baddie, too. Ay, ay, ay. Last one in the house is a rotten egg. Molly, I'm not a rotten egg. Well, if you're last one in the house, you are. <laughs> hey, Mom. Oh, hey, Molly. Hey, Daisy. How was school today? 
It was great. I got an A on my science exam. Good job, Daisy. How'd you do, Molly? I got a B plus. What? I'm so happy. That's amazing. Wait, Mom, why do you have a suitcase? What's going on? Um, well, your father and I decided we needed a little vacation. Wow. A vacation? Where are we going? I'm so excited. Are we going to Disney? That would be amazing. Ooh, could we go to Paris? I've never been to Paris. Uh, Molly, uh, duh. We are gonna go and, um, see London for the first time. I just know it because remember I did my school project about that? Molly, what are you doing? Do you have to go potty? No, I'm just so excited. I can't even stand still. I'm sorry, girls, but this is a trip for your dad and I, a couple's trip, for us to reconnect and spend a couple days together. You guys are staying with your grandma and going to school. So let me get this straight. You get to go on a vacation somewhere amazing, and Daisy and I still have to go to school? How is that fair? Well, your father and I work very hard to pay the bills around here. Don't you think we need a break every now and again? She does, does have a point, Miley. But, but we work really hard, too. Why can't we have a break? Molly, you're going to go to your grandma's. You're going to have so much fun. I did it, Molly. I love grandma's. Mom, where are you going? Where are you going? We're going to go to the beach for a couple of days. The beach? Oh, I want to go to the beach. Girls, go pack your bags. I'll drop you off at grandma's before dad and I go to the airport. Mom, did you forget something? No, baby Kira just got in the car. Don't worry, I'm not going to leave one of my kids home alone. That would just be crazy. I know you grab my house. Wah, 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 wah. Grab my house. Grab my house. Ma, you and Gwen go grab my house? No, I don't. I want to go to the beach. I don't want to go to school. Molly, it's not going to be that bad. Yes, it is, Daisy. Yes, it is. I ain't your boy, he ain't your boy. I go and grab my house. It gonna be fun. Yeah, Molly, listen to baby Kira. Your little sister's right. It is gonna be so fun. You love grandma. We're here. Ugh, grandma's house is so nice. Why are you saying it like that, Molly, if you think it's so nice? Because it's not as nice as the beach. We're not having to go to school. I did a cute place. I love it, it's a boy, it's a daddy, it's a papa. I love it too, baby Kira. Don't listen to Molly. She's just being a grump monster. Oh, girls, I'm so glad to see you. Hi, Daisy. Hi, Grandma. Hi, baby Kira. I did a papa to a fofo, Grandma. I love you too, dear. Oh my, who's this grumpy girl on my doorstep? Surely this cannot be my granddaughter, Molly. Don't worry, it's her. But she's so miserable because mom and dad are going to the beach and she can't. She has to stay here and go to school. But you get to spend the night with me, Molly, and I am so much fun. Now I'm going to cook some burgers in the backyard. Who wants to come with me? Molly, I made your favorite dessert. Molly, how can you be grumpy when Grandma made your favorite dessert? Well, yeah, you've kind of got a point. I'm not saying I'm happy about being home, left home without going on vacation, but Grandma, you are pretty awesome. Oh, thank you, dear. I love you all. And the apple pie is cooling in the kitchen window. We'll have it after we have some delicious cheeseburgers. Sounds good. I did a pie. I did your papa. Whoa, your pie got huge. I'm jumping in it. Molly, it's too cold to swim. I'm still swimming in it. Whoa, this is so cool. Grandma, um, are you gonna get some koi fish? I may eventually, dear. Or maybe some piranhas. Whoa, we couldn't swim in it then. Holy guacamole, they'd be chomp chomping us. <laughs> it would keep the burglars out, that's for sure. Yeah, it'd be like you lived in a castle. <laughs> you have like a moat around your house, Grandma. I'll be right back, Grandma. I want to see if there's any fun things on TV right now. Oh, dear. There's nothing on TV. The door's locked, Grandma. That's because you're not allowed to watch TV all day when you're... Oh, no! I'm burning the burgers! Oh, jeepers, she willikers. Don't worry, Grandma. I'll help you with that. Thank you, dear. What I was trying to say is you don't need to watch TV here. Tons of fun things to do. Now, come on. Let's eat. 
I get to buy the daddy to put for the Pretty good cheap burger, Grandma. I get to put for the Oh dear, you have ketchup all over your face. Yeah, mm. she usually is like that when she's eating. She's kind of messy. So what, uh, you, Molly? You have ketchup on your nose. What? I do? <laughs> yeah, you look ridiculous. Grandma, what are you doing? Oh, I just have to take my pills before I can eat. Pills for what? Oh, just about everything, Molly. Once you get old, well, your body just decides it's going to... I don't know, not work right, I guess. Whoa, I hope I never get old. Me too. Now, what time are your girls' bedtime? Uh, baby Kira's bedtime is at 8, ours is at midnight. Molly, that's a lie. Wow, your mom lets you stay up really late these days. Yeah, it's because we got good grades at school, right, Daisy? Molly! Daisy doesn't want to stay up to midnight because she gets really grumpy in the morning, which is totally fine, but I'm gonna. I mean, since I have to go to school and I'm not on vacation. All right, well, whatever you say, dear. But you do have to get out of bed in the morning for school, so don't forget. I won't, Grandma. I won't. Wait, where's my pajamas? Oh, my God. I forgot to pack them. Grandma! Grandma! Okay, where is Grandma? Are they still outside? I thought we were coming in to brush our teeth. Baby Kara, what are you doing out here? I got a side brought my pajamas. Good night, night. Okay, where's Grandma? Because I have to tell her I forgot my pajamas. Yeah, dear, I think I'm cleaning up the mess from dinner. I your papa, dear. Oh, no, dear. I'm up here just setting up the beds for you guys. Grandma, I forgot my pajamas. What are we going to do? What are we going to do? What are we going to do? Don't worry, dear. I have a pair of pajamas you can borrow. Go ahead and get in the dresser and get a pair out. Okay. Grandma, these are old lady pajamas. Well, duh. I am an old lady. But look at that adorable cat. Grumpy cat. Oh, boy. I'm so embarrassed right now. Good thing no one else see you in your sleep. Now, off to bed. No, Grandma, I get to stay up to midnight, remember? Are you sure that's what your mother said? Yeah, absolutely. She also said that I can eat three pieces of apple pie. Three? Oh my, you'll get a stomach ache. Yeah, and then you'll be puking all night long, Molly. Nope, that's what she said. I'm totally fine with eating three pieces of pie. I'll be fine. Okay, dear, I just don't want you to get the diarrheas. <laughs> That's such a funny word. Well, I'm just saying, that would be awful. Good night, dear. Now don't stay up too late. I won't, Grandma. Ugh, finally, everyone else is asleep. And I can go watch some TV and just chill. While eating apple pie and other desserts, by the way. <laughs> Look at that little chipmunk. That's just like me when I eat apple pie. Ugh, I've got to stuff it all in my mouth. Yes, yes I do. Well, I'm all full of apple pie, but I found this birthday cake in Grandma's refrigerator. I'm sure she won't mind if I eat it. <laughs> that was good. Ugh, I don't feel so good. My stomach hurts so bad. Oh, my stomach is gonna explode. Gotta get to the bathroom. Gotta get to the bathroom. Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. <laughs> wasn't so bad. Ugh. Ugh, I don't think I need to eat any more cake though. But I feel a lot better now. Ugh. Ugh. No! No, I don't! Oh my gosh, gotta get to the bathroom. The next the next morning. Oh, I had a lovely night's nice sleep. Now I think I'll make the girls waffles for breakfast. Mm -hmm, I sure will. Good morning, Grandma. Oh my, you scared me. I'm not used to having company. <laughs> oh, sorry, Grandma. Hey, have you seen Molly? What? N no, is she not up in bed? Uh, no, she never came to bed. And I thought maybe she fell asleep on the couch, but she's not there evil. Oh, dear. I wonder what could have happened to her. Let's look around the cottage and see if we can find her. <coughs> oh, my. Molly, why are you sleeping next to the toilet? Oh, poor thing. I... 
was so sick last night. Oh dear, you should have woken me up. What happened? I ate all the apple pie and then some of that birthday cake. What? That was for my friend's hundredth birthday. I'll help you bake another one, Grandma. Uh, but uh, it made me go pfft, pfft, and also pfft, and a little bit of pfft, and a lot of pfft, and my stomach hurt really bad. Well, dear, serves you right. I hope you learned your lesson eating my friend's birthday cake and you stayed up all night on the toilet, didn't you? Um, yeah. Ah, <sighs> well, let's get you cleaned up for school. I can't go to school. I hardly slept. Oh, dear. Well, here. You could take one of these Pepto-Bismols and you'll be right as rain. Oh, those Pepto-Bismols taste terrible. Well, dear, I think I should think about that before you eat so many treats and stay up so late. You know, Grandma, I used to think you're just old, but turns out you're pretty smart, too. It comes with being on this planet for so many years. You learn a lot. Like, don't eat too much pie and cake, or you'll poo poo all night long. <laughs> yeah, Ugh, that was the worst. Grandma, I made some waffles. Hey, Molly, you want a waffle? Huh, waffle? Oh, that sounds gross. Ugh. Something tells me Molly's going to be skipping breakfast today. Yeah, <laughs> she probably is. <laughs> Good morning, everyone. Today, we're going to be working on some fractions. I know you guys are a little bit scared. Whoa, I can't write today. <laughs> I spelled it wrong. I know you guys are a little afraid of fractions. They seem really hard, but don't worry. I'm going to help you through it. And everyone will know how to do fractions by the end of the school year, okay? Too many cricket. What was that? Was that thunder? It's probably some freak storm and, you know, we are going to all be doomed. Wow, Molly, could you be any more dramatic? Well, no, not really. But anyway, I'm just kidding because I saw the weather and it's supposed to be like blue skies and sunny today. Well, maybe the weather people were wrong. They seem to never know what the weather is going to be. Well, that's true. I don't know why that is lately. Are they letting every meteorologist past college or something? Must be. But well, maybe it's just hard to guess. I don't know. But they have equipment to help them. I'm gonna look outside and see if there's any storms going on. It looks like there's some dark clouds coming from over there, teacher. Maybe we should all have early dismissal. Nice try, Molly, but there's no early dismissal today. We're going to be learning about fractions. Now, the first thing you need to know um, I have a question. Um, it's starting to look really dark outside. I think we're gonna get a storm. Uh, and it looks like an angry one. What? Oh, I, I didn't think we were supposed to get the storm that's, that's hitting Blocksburg. They're getting a terrible, terrible hurricane. Oh my, this does look like the hurricane's actually going to hit us. Oh boy, I better get inside and check out the weather station and see what it says. Um, teacher, I, I really don't think it's a good idea we stay here. Well, if the hurricane's hitting, we can't leave either. It can be dangerous. The roads will be flooded for sure. Let me just tune into the weather station on my iPad. Breaking news, breaking news. The hurricane that hit Blocksburg is now hitting Brookhaven too. Stay put. I repeat, do not drive. Do not go outside your house. This hurricane is extremely dangerous. You should lock down exactly where you are. Oh my, this isn't good. Stuck in this school? Oh, we don't even have sleeping bags or pajamas or anything. Oh! Uh, anybody else notice our teacher is totally freaking out right now? Well, Molly, in her defense, hurricanes can be incredibly dangerous. Well, I guess we're not learning about fractions today. We're learning a lot about hurricanes, though. Um, uh, Molly, I'm kind of nervous. I don't like big storms. Well, then why are you smiling? Um, because I smile a lot when I'm nervous. It's sort of this thing I have where I just, I, 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 I also giggle a lot when I'm nervous. <laughs> Whoa, I never knew about this about you, Brookie. But that's because you've never seen her this nervous. <laughs> We're all gonna die in a hurricane! <laughs> oh, this is so lame. 
Rookie, are you okay? You have no face right now. <laughs> I can't stop laughing. That's why. O M G. Okay, Brookie's gone insane. Molly, maybe we should go outside and, you know, check and see if the weather's really bad. Okay, I'll be the one to do it because I'm the most brave. Here we go. Oh, the sky is red. Uh, I've never seen it do that before. Oh, my God, this is creepy. Oh, yeah, the rain is coming. And the, and the wind. What? Did I just see lightning? Oh, my gosh. I did just see lightning, and now the sky is purple. I better get back inside. Daisy, what are you doing? I'm taking measurements. I've never seen a storm like this in my life. Holy guacamole, Daisy. We better get inside. This is dangerous out here. Yeah, yeah. Wait a minute. Why are you so tall all of a sudden? I had a growth spurt. <laughs> Why are you going to catch up? You seem so short lately. Holy moly. Um, teacher, teacher. There's a lot of lightning, a lot of rain, a lot of wind, and the sky is purple and red. Oh, my God. <laughs> we really are gonna die nobody panic nobody panic i don't think it's safe for us to be near these windows though we're all gonna move into the gym since it's more centrally located inside the school and we'll start setting up to spend the night there um is there anything to eat because i'm starting to get hungry yes i'll go to the cafeteria and pick up some supplies you guys head to the gym and i'll meet you there on second thought Look at all these windows to the outside. This is probably more dangerous than I thought. Are you like trained at all for disasters? O-M-G. Yes, I'm just a little bit nervous, okay? This is my first year as a teacher and I didn't expect to be stuck in a hurricane. It's okay. Um, just, just, um, basically take us to the auditorium and everything will be okay because there's no windows in there. Oh, Daisy, what would I do without you? You're the best student ever. Come on, everyone, to the auditorium. Okay, everyone file in, please. Single file, no pushing. I'm just gonna pull up the weather channel again and see if there's any updates. Breaking news, breaking news. Everyone, panic. This is the worst hurricane Brookhaven has ever seen. Everything's flooded. Oh, make sure you get to high ground, but stay inside. Make sure you have enough food, but don't go to the grocery store. Make sure you get enough sleep and take care of yourself. But don't close your eyes. You never know what's going to happen next. Okay, we're turning off the iPad. That's just freaking me out. All right, everyone. I did find some uh, sleeping bags in the supply room. Must be they were there for emergencies. So I'm going to spread everyone's sleeping bag out up here on the stage. And this will be where we sleep tonight. And I also brought some snacks. Brittany, are you still freaking out? I'm... I'm sort of hyperventilating. Brookie, it's going to be okay. Everyone's safe. Just think of this as a really interesting sleepover. I mean, we had to invite, invite Sarah, but you know. Whatever. Like, I'd ever come to a loser sleepover anyway. Well, Sarah, we'd probably invite you even if you didn't want to come. Just because we're nice like that. Well, I'm not nice like that, and I probably wouldn't come. Oh my gosh, I can't believe it. Yeah, but we're also having an amazing sleepover. According to this little instrument that I found in the science room that's supposed to measure the weather, but I'm not a meteorologist, so I don't know what it's called. What? You don't know what it's called? Daisy, I can't even believe this right now. Ah, uh, yeah, I feel a little, um, sad in myself that I don't know what this meteorologist equipment is. I'll, I'll make notes and have to look this up when I get home. But anyway, according to that, the worst of the storm is happening right now. Uh, you could say that. There are actually some windows backstage and I did see some lightning. What? The teacher told us that, 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 that there was no windows in here. Well, it's the spot that's the least windows, Brookie, and the most protected. Don't worry. Everything's going to be okay. I don't believe you. I'm starting to freak out and now I really just want to cry. Brookie, I promise everything's going to be okay. Your best friend is right here. Okay, everybody, I brought some food. Bean burritos, tacos. Do you guys like Mexican food? Oh my gosh, I love Mexican food. Oh no, it's going to be terrible. What, the storm? No, you, after you eat that bean burrito. Oh yeah, we don't want to feed Molly a bean burrito. Too late. Mm, this is actually quite delicious. Mm, this is so good. Uh -huh. Oh my god, Molly's farting already! She just took the first bite of a bean burrito! Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. 
Ugh, I think I'd rather be out in a hurricane. What? It's not that bad. Uh -huh. Mother, you fought it ten times in the last five seconds. Uh -huh. Ew, Molly! That stinks so bad. Where's my gas mask? <laughs> I think there's an emergency in the gym. I mean, in the auditorium. Wait, where are we again? Brookie, you're still freaking out right now. It's gonna be okay, Brookie. I promise. And I have an extra bean burrito that I'm gonna eat. <coughs> Molly, please don't. <coughs> Molly! No more bean burritos for Molly. She's sworn to not eat anymore. Okay, class, I want everyone to get into their sleeping bags. Molly, no more bean burritos, seriously. We all have to actually sleep in here. <laughs> Can't believe we're sleeping in the auditorium at school. This is so weird. Yeah, but I think the storm is starting to pass now. I think you're right, class, but I think you should stay here for the night just to be safe. <sighs> I'm getting tired anyway. This was kind of stressful. I know what you mean. <laughs> this dress makes me laugh. Did I tell you that yet? Yes, like so many times. You're so annoying. I know. I'm sorry. I just can't help it. Sarah, she's not annoying. She's my best friend and she can't help it. She's just scared. Yeah, I think we all will. But in the morning, we'll go home and hopefully everything will be fine. Yeah, hopefully. <laughs>
school suspension. Bam, bam, bam him. We're calling this the pajama era. Whoa, Bucky, did you hear that? The pajama era. I don't even know if I have enough pajamas to wear to school every day. And they're not even cute, really. Oh, Daisy, leave it to you to have to be a fashionista and wear the cutest pajamas. Well, if I have to wear pajamas, they might as well be cute. I, I can't but help but thinking that was, sort of sounded like Molly's voice over the loudspeaker. Nah, she wouldn't dare go into the principal's office when the principal wasn't there. That's asking for a month of detention. Uh -oh. Molly, Daisy, come on, it's time to wake up. It's almost 6.30. Okay, Mom, I'm coming. I'm not. I'm going back to sleep until 7.45. Because today, we're in the pajama era, which means I don't even have to do anything but grab a donut on the way into school. <sighs> ah, the good life. <laughs> Look at me in my pajamas. Don't I look cute in my pajamas? Let's do the pajama dance. Let's do the pajama dance. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Gonna do the pajama dance. Now, where is that lazy breakfast? Um, ooh, cold pizza. Sounds good to me. Mm. We didn't have donuts, so... Leftover pizza it is. Time to get to school. Hmm. Right on time. I'm freezing in these pajamas. I wish I was wearing real clothes. <laughs> Why don't you wear your pajamas, winter pajamas? Well, because they have holes in the bottom, I really need some new pajamas. Yeah, especially since you're going to be wearing pajamas every single day. Do, 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 do. This is just weird. Well, I normally wear my running suit to bed. Um, So this is what I'm wearing today. Cute jammies, though. I like them, Molly. Thank you, they're very comfy. <laughs> Ew, what's that smell? Yeah, I sort of smell it too. What is that? Oh, I didn't take a shower today. Ew, Molly! What? <laughs> I just wore the pajamas I wore last night. Duh. Well, there's the bell. Better get into class. Good morning. Oh, I'm so tired. Ugh. Why? You're wearing your pajamas. You got to sleep in later. I know, but something about being in my pajamas just makes me think of bed. Oh, I know, I feel so sleepy and lazy. Oh, no test today. What? Are you serious? Did you guys hear that? Where's all the other students? Oh, they didn't even feel like getting out of bed. They just stayed in their pajamas and went back to sleep. I don't know if this was such a good idea. The pajama era just seems, well, lazy. Precisely. <laughs> no work? Uh, can we play on our phones then? Uh, I guess. Watch TikTok. Do whatever you want. Yay! Pajamas every single day was the best idea I've ever had. Oh, I'm so tired. I think I'll just like lay down here in front of the board. Are you okay? Are you sick? No, I'm just feeling so lazy. Not having to get up, take a shower, put on real clothes, it just makes me feel, well, out of sorts. Yeah, I like when you're out of sorts. No homework, no tests, no annoying things about school. Yes, lunchtime! Come on, guys, I'm starving. And I heard it's pizza day. Marty, you had pizza for breakfast. Yeah, but I don't care. Pizza for breakfast, pizza for lunch, pizza for dinner. Hey, Large Marge, I'll have three slices of pepperoni pizza, please. What? Pizza? <laughs> I didn't make pizza. Okay, can we have hoagies then? Didn't make that either. Um, did you make anything? No. What? But you're the lunch lady, why not? Too busy sitting down over here. Actually, I think I'm just going to lay down right here behind the, the counter. What are you talking about? It's pajama day, and I'm feeling kind of lazy. But Large March, we're hungry! So sad, too bad. Too busy laying down in my jammies. Molly, this is gonna end badly. Everybody's getting lazy and, and, and sleeping all the time. 
What if we fall asleep for a hundred years and never wake up? <laughs> That's a good one. <laughs> Don't make me laugh. The teacher is sleeping in a sleeping bag in our classroom. I know, isn't it great? No, Molly. This is going horribly wrong. You, you really need to stop this. Now, I know that the principal is out to lunch at Starbucks today. She just decided to take the day off because it's pajama day. You can fix this, Molly, by going in on the loudspeaker and telling everybody pajama era is over. Ugh, well, I guess I could. But I don't think I like this. Molly, please! I need to wear my wool sweaters again. I'm freezing. Okay, fine. But only because I miss Large March making the most delicious school lunch pizzas ever. Ahem. May I have your attention, please? Pajama Day era is over. O-V-E-R. We will now begin Halloween costume era. You must wear a Halloween costume every day or you get in school suspension. <laughs> Mrs. Um, Bernard, who are you supposed to be? I'm dressed like the lunch lady, Large Marge. Actually, I forgot my costume and she let me borrow this outfit because I didn't want to get in school suspension. Okay, class, everybody take out your homework, please. I'm still for sick. This cow costume is not very warm. Oh, quit complaining. Halloween every day is so much fun. Planning on trick-or-treating like every single night. Molly, where's your homework? Please take it out. Who's Molly? I'm Mr. Waterburger. <laughs> Mr. Waterburger doesn't do any homework. Molly, Waterburger is a place where you go for dinner. Well, that's all I can think of. <laughs> but I am Mr. Waterburger. You kind of look like Mr. KFC. <laughs> hey, who are you talking to, banana? I'm not sure this is any better than the pajama era. <laughs> <laughs> hey guys, don't forget to boop that like button if you want a delicious chocolate chip cookie. Why isn't Brookie answering her phone? She always answers when I call. So weird. All right, I'm going to try calling her one more time. Come on, Brookie, pick up, pick up, pick up. Buddy, who are you calling? I'm calling Brookie because I don't really understand that math homework. And I figured maybe she would. Maybe she'd come over and help me. I'll help you, Molly. Hello? No, Daisy, I don't want you to help me. Why? Because you think I'm so smart? Wait a minute. Did you guys just call me to argue over the phone and have me listen to it? Probably. That's the way Molly is. No, no it's not. How rude. Sorry, Brookie. My sister's just being really annoying right now. Don't listen to her. Guys, stop arguing when I'm on the phone. I'm going to hang up. I tried calling you like a bunch of times, Brookie, but you didn't answer. Oh, yeah, sorry. I was trying to figure out this math homework. Jiminy Cricket, so wasn't I. It was really difficult. Yeah, mm, I just can't figure out number 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, or 15. <laughs> That's pretty much all of it, Brookie. I know. Hey, do you want to come over for a sleepover? Maybe we can figure it out together. I could door dash a pizza. Sounds amazing. I'll be there soon. Okay, bye. I'm gonna go take a shower before Bookie gets here. Okay, fine, whatever. Do I look like I really cared what you were doing? Molly, woo! Ugh, sisters. Rookie, what, what is it? Do you need to know what pajamas to pack or something? I like the ones with strawberries on them. They're adorable. <laughs> I see you. Uh, Brookie? That's not very funny. Stop pranking me now. Do you like scary movies? Uh, not really. Who is this? <laughs> huh. Creepy prank caller. Goodbye. <phone rings> Buddy, I can't believe you pranked me like that. Wait, what? What are you talking about? I just got a prank call. What? No, it said you called me. Well, it said Brookie called me. Well, somebody definitely was Wilbo calling us then because it was creepy. Yeah, tell me about it. The person who called me said, I see you, and do you like scary movies? Uh, yeah, that's exactly what they said to me. Uh, that kind of creeps me out. Nah, 
It was probably just Sarah the bully or something being totally mean to us. Don't worry about a thing. Now, go take your shower before Brookie gets here. You don't want to be smelly, do you? <gasps> I'm never smelly. You're the one that doesn't ever take a shower, Maddie. I take a shower, like once a week, if I really need it. <laughs> oh, Brookie! <laughs> I'm so excited to see my best friend. Hey, Molly, are you ready for the sleepover? Sure am. Huh. It was a little bit crazy, though, before you got here. What were you talking about? Well, somebody, like, used your number to call me and prank me. Wait, what? Are you serious? Yeah, and they had a really creepy voice and stuff, but I'm just sure it's, like, Sarah the bully from school or something. Oh, that is creepy. Well, come on, let's go work on that math homework. Yeah, and then I have a new scary movie I want to watch. How about you? I don't know, a scary movie? Especially after a creepy call? It's gonna be fine, Brookie. I'm sure it was just somebody from school pranking us. Now come on, let's go work on that math homework so we can get it over with. Homework is not my favorite thing. Me either, Molly. So I think for number five, the answer should be 236. What do you think, Brookie? Well, uh, that's what I got too, so I'm thinking that must be the right answer. Okay, cool. Uh, so we just have, like, two more problems to go. Should I make some popcorn? I'm starting to get really hungry. Hey, guys! Um, are you guys ready to, um, watch a movie or something? Well, we do still have two more problems of our homework to go, but I suppose we could do it in study hall tomorrow before class. I really want to watch this scary movie. Me too. Really? You really do? Yeah, you convinced me, Molly. I'm sure that was just a prank call. Nothing creepy or anything like that. It did sound creepy. Wait, you got the prank call too? Yeah, I got it. Was it from my number? No, it was from Molly's number. Are you sure Molly wasn't pranking us the whole time? She could be. You just never know with Molly sometimes. Make the popcorn, guys. It looks super delicious. Oh, man, you made it extra buttery. My favorite. I'm just going to sit over here and uh, eat the whole thing. Molly, give us some. <laughs> All right, I'll get you guys a bowl so you can have some too. Whoa, Molly, don't enter the house at midnight. This new movie looks so scary. Yeah, it totally does. I'm going to take a Snapchat of us um, watching this scary movie. Okay, everybody get behind Brookie so we can do a Snapchat. Uh, Daisy, are you coming? Yeah, I was just still eating some of my popcorn and I didn't want popcorn corners in my teeth. <laughs> All right, everybody, um, tell us, tell everybody what you're doing. I'm eating delicious buttery popcorn with my best friend and my annoying sister, and we're about to watch a new movie. Mandy, it's a scary movie, and um, we're pretty excited about it, especially since we got a prank call tonight. Yeah, you guys, that was so crazy and creepy. All right, well, that's the end of our snap. Okay, let's watch the movie. Actually, first I'm gonna go upstairs and go to the bathroom, okay? Um, Because I drank way too much soda. Oh, I got our snap. Oh, look at us. We look adorable. I love it. Oh my gosh, my phone is buzzing. Well, maybe Bookie's out of toilet paper or something. You don't ever change the toilet paper roll, Molly. <laughs> yeah, that's probably what it is. What? It's a Snapchat from outside our house. It just says, he, 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 he. Like, it's in the backyard. What? That's creepy, Molly. Our backyard is completely fenced with like an eight foot tall fence. Who could that be? Um, I don't know. Stay away from the windows, Molly. I don't want you to see something creepy. Well, I don't know if I should call 911 or what. What? What's going on, guys? I just got a snap just sent specifically to me and it said like ha 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 and it was from our backyard and it was a picture of like a snap of like me and Daisy from outside. What? That's so creepy. Do you think this has anything to do with it with the phone call you got earlier? Um, I, I don't know. I, I don't think so. How'd they get in our backyard? It's totally creepy. Well, I mean, if you called the police, you couldn't really say anything because I don't see anyone in your backyard. Let's just ignore it happened and watch the movie. What? Whoa. I just got another snap, Molly, and you're not going to like it. What? Why? What is it? Do you like scary movies? Ha! Ah, that's exactly what the person on the phone said. 
And it looks like they took a picture of us from the front of the house. O-M-G. Oh my gosh, my phone is ringing. Should I answer it? Um, maybe it's your mom. That would be a good thing if it was your mom. Yeah, answer it, Bucky. You definitely should. Okay. Um, hello? Do you like scary movies? Oh my god, guys. It's him. Um, who are you and why are you pranking us? Yeah, good question, Bricky. Good question. <laughs> I see you. Ah, uh, I, uh, uh, where do you see us? Ask him that. Where do you see us? I'm right outside your house. <laughs> now tell me, what's your favorite scary movie? I don't like scary movies. I changed my mind. Tell him we only like to watch Coco Ballet or Blippi or, um, you know, something like that. Something really fun. No scary movies here. Nope, nope, nope. We don't like scary <sighs> movies. You don't? <laughs> I think you're watching one right now. Um, well, then you're not looking good because we turned the TV off like five minutes ago there, genius. Who's that? Put her on the phone. Oh, uh, no, I'm good. I'm good. <laughs> You got nowhere to go. I'm outside your house. Rookie, hang up the phone. Hang it up. Um, goodbye. You're being really rude. What are we gonna do? Um, we're gonna go upstairs and lock the door. Come on! Alright, guys, which room would be the safest? Probably the one with the least amount of windows. This one seems the safest. Okay, okay, okay. Molly, don't lock me out. What are you doing? Sorry about that. Okay. Um, see if we can see him down below. I, I don't see him anywhere. <laughs> Dizzy, quit closing the curtains. I can't see anything. I don't want him to see us either, Molly. Okay, well, so far I don't see him anywhere. So I think that's probably a good thing. Huh. <sighs> are we safe? I don't know who that guy is, but... Maybe we should call 911. Good idea. I'm calling the police. Are they answering, Molly? It's still ringing. 911, what's your emergency? There's this creepy guy. He's outside our windows. Or outside our house, I mean. And and he Frank called us and then he was taking pictures on Snapchat outside our house. And 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 I I I'm just freaking out because I think he might be a crazy psycho. And can you send a police officer over like right away? It's me, my sister, and my friend that are here. So you need a police officer? Uh, yeah. Right away. I have a question for you before I send a police officer out. Okay. W -w 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 what is it? Do you like scary movies? Ah! Oh my god! How did you get- How did you get on this phone line? <laughs> I hacked it. I know which room you're in. <laughs> oh, you're all trouble now okay i have a plan my mom has an ipad in the other room i bet he doesn't have any hacked access to that yeah molly it is a super old ipad he wouldn't even know about it well one of us needs to be brave enough to go in there uh huh i'll do it guys uh, I, it's the least i can do i mean because you guys are my best friends brookie no I have to, guys. It's, it's for the good of us all. Okay, Brookie. We'll just get the iPad and run right back here, okay? Good luck, Brookie. Stay safe. What? I got another Snapchat? Oh, no. This can't be good. Wait. What is that? It's, it's, it's a picture of us from the, 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 the room that we're in. What? Where's that iPad? I need to find it really fast and then go back and be with Molly and Daisy. I'm afraid to be in here by myself. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Okay, think. Where would I put an old iPad and a charger for it, too? Maybe it's in the nightstand. I don't know. I mean... <laughs> what? Who, what? Who, who are you? Ah! Ah, oh, my God. I tried to hide in the crib, but he still sees me. <laughs> Why does Laura have a baseball bat next to her bed? Oh, well. I don't care. It's time to, well, meet your doom, you evil thing, whatever. Who, what are you, a monster, like a demon? <laughs> you can't take me down. 
I can't be killed. Well, I wasn't planning on that, but I'm pretty sure this baseball bat upside your kneecap's gonna feel pretty good. You can't take me. Oh, that hurt! Yeah, right. I can't take you down. Try messing with Brookie Cookie ever again. <laughs> Daisy, what was that sound? I don't know. It sounded like a fight in the other room. Do you think that that guy got in and, and, and got Brookie? Our best friend? What would we do if something ever happened to her? I don't know, Molly, but we have to go try to rescue her. Okay, we have to be brave. What? There's the killer. Brookie, what are you doing? Well, I totally hit him with a baseball bat. <laughs> he didn't like that very much. And now I'm taking a Snapchat to show everybody this creepy guy who is obviously going to prison now. I just wanted to... I... I... I wanted to know if you liked scary movies. Um, well, uh, <laughs> Brookie, that snap is awesome. Okay, let's read some text. Some, I'm going to text it on it. Wait, I want to take a Snapchat and send it. <laughs> Look at this, guys. We captured this guy. And we're going to call the police. Oh, let's, like, let's give him a funny face. <laughs> Look at that, guys. Well, that's too funny. Let's give him a rainbow face. La 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 la! <laughs> Ghostface, what do you think of that, huh? Ah, oh, yeah, look at that, guys. Let's send this to everybody. <laughs> I can't believe you kids are such brats. Do, 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 do. So, Ghostface, this is the end of you. Here's some daisies for you. I wonder if this ever happens to Jason, Freddy, Chucky. Baby Kira, baby Kira, it's time to wake up. No, I'm too early, I am by you. Baby Kira, come on. I have to go to school and mom left me in charge, so you have to get up and have your breakfast. Come on, I know you must be hungry. I die hungry, I don't want you. Come on, baby Kira, it's time you need to get up because you're gonna have a babysitter today. I'm not gonna have a babysitter. I'll play with my unicorn. We fly into the air. She's never gonna get up. I know, Cupcake. She's just being kind of a brat today. Baby Kira, it's time for you to put down your toy and get downstairs for breakfast. Come on. I want baby Zero. I'm gonna get out of bed. Not doing it. Ugh. You are the most challenging little sister ever. Get out of bed. Before I put you in time out. Okay, okay, I get out of my bed. You're so grumpy in the morning. So what do you want for breakfast, baby Kira? I want mom to make it. Mom can't make it. She's not here right now. She's at work. She left me in charge, remember? I want mom to make it. I want mom to make it. Baby Kira, oh my gosh. Ugh, you're getting a babysitter soon, so you have to just listen to what I'm saying. I want, I want to go uh, to to this place and you at McDonald's. Baby Kira, you're gonna have a babysitter. No, don't want baby diddle. You'll be super happy because it's grandma. <laughs> Wait, grandma coming? Yep, grandma's coming. Ooh, I did, I'm hungry. Uh, that's some salad. Are you sure you wanna eat that? I, I super hungry, I eat it. Okay, I'm pretty sure you're not gonna like that though. Gross! I told you, salad's kind of yucky first thing in the morning. How about I make something delicious instead? I need a bath. <sniffs> Baby Kira, did you just poo poo your pants? You're supposed to be potty training. Oopsie, I poo poo my pants. Here, have some cereal. How about open a couple and eat something else? Oh, Baby Kira, you are not going to eat it all. Oh, like, it's just chocolate in there and stuff. You can't eat that. Okay, I eat cereal then. Mm. Let's play good. Take my. Oh, would you hear that? I bet it's Grandma at the door. Oh, Grandma. I can have fun with Grandma. Yep, you better eat your breakfast though. You guys will probably have a very special day. Let in. I want to hang out with my Grandma. 
Wow, your little sister is so bossy. I know, right, Cupcake? Oh, she's even bossier than you. Hello there, my sweet little granddaughter. Grandma! I'm so happy to see you. Oh, oh my. You smell like you have a dirty diaper. I'm trying to be pie twin, Grandma. I, I like your little sister. She's also trying to talk like a big girl, but things don't always work as planned. All right, baby Kara, I have to go to school now. Have a great day with Grandma. Come on, Cupcake. <sighs> Taking care of my sister is harder than attention. Oh, she makes such a big deal out of taking care of you. I mean, you do have stinky diapers, but other than that, I think it's very fun to take care of you, baby Kira. Take good grandma, I love you too. Okay, dear, hold still. Hi, old Duke is a tickle tickle. Oh, you're so cute. Ooh, that diaper was super stinky, but you're all clean now. Did you eat breakfast, my sweet little granddaughter? Uh, my name is Juliana A. All up. Well then, maybe we should go for a walk or something. I want my cartoons. Okay, we can watch cartoons first, and then we'll take a nice long walk. Okay, so good, Grandma. I like Peppa Pig. Can we watch Peppa Pig? Oh dear, I haven't watched cartoons in quite a while. Peppa Pig sounds like a great thing to watch, but let's see if it's on right now. Oh look, I just saw the news and a cooking channel. No, 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 we don't want to watch that. I, I, I don't want to watch it. I want to watch Peppa Pig and play with my octopus. Oh, that's octopus. Octopus. Well, good try, baby Kira. All that's on right now is the brightly colored unicorn. I watch this, I guess. I love cats. I love every type of cat. All right, honey, I'm going to go whip up something delicious like some cookies. You have fun watching your cartoon. Okay, Grandma. Talk about your cookie, okay? Oh, of course. <laughs> I have an idea. I just don't want you to talk to me. I just want you to talk to me. I just want you to talk to me. Are you doing okay in there, baby Kira? Oh, wait, can I go back? Grandma talking to me. Ah, uh, okay, Grandma. Okay, dear. Okay, now, now I can um, lick the spoon that Grandma has because it is yummy like cookies. Hey, what are you doing? <gasps> are you trying to lick the spoon? Ah, uh, ah. Uh, it's okay, honey. Every child wants to lick the spoon after you make cookies. I'll give it to you. Grandma, I like when you stay with me. Well, the cookies are going to be done in about 30 minutes. Then we'll have ourselves a nice little walk and a cookie with some milk. Yay! Thank you, Grandma! I can play high seek with Grandma. You never find me. Oh, baby Kira, where, where are you, dear? I hide, you not find me ever. I, I could hide and watch this. Uh, I can't find a good spot. Oh, I want to crawl under here. <laughs> you never find me, not ever. Baby Kira, where are you? Oh no, I lost her. I had to be responsible and I lost my granddaughter. I play hide and seek so good, you can't find me ever. Is that a little baby that I see under the desk right there? You scared me. Hi, but I seek with you, Grandma. Oh, well, you might have wanted to tell me you were actually playing hide and seek, so I knew. Sorry, I'll tell you next time. Could go for a walk now? Sure. For that matter, I ran out of chocolate chips. We probably need to go to the grocery store. Come on, sweetheart. Uh, I like going to the store because I get um, some trees where I go. I like grapes. Oh, you do? Well, maybe we'll have to pick up some. Okay, dear, let's just get a cart and then you can sit in it, okay? Like a good girl, don't be taking anything off the shelves. 
Oh, I wouldn't do that. Oh, chips, I want those. No, dear. We we can get some grapes, though. A bananas, too. No, just some apples. And okay, we can get bananas. I spoil you rotten. That really fruit is good for you, Grandma. Yeah, fruit is good for you. I'll get some cheese while I'm here. Oh my gosh, I'm spending way more money than I thought. Now, where's the chocolate chips? Oh, boy, get potato chips. No, dear, I need chocolate chips for the cookies I'm making back home. I, I, I love chocolate chip cookies. Oh, maybe we should stop somewhere at the park or something before we go home for your nap. Grandma, I can go with the fair as well and look for fun. Yes, baby Kira, I brought you to this Ferris wheel. I haven't ridden one in so long. Grandma, wait for fair, I can't get out, I said small, Grandma. It's okay, dear, see, I lifted you up. Oh, wow, I love it, you guys see, I have book from here. That's right, dear, oh, I had such a wonderful day with my littlest granddaughter. I want for day two, Grandma, and I, I, I want to stay on the fair with real forever. Oh, no, dear, we have to get off the Ferris wheel in about two minutes because you have to take a nap. Well, no, I don't take a nap. Yes, dear, you have to. No, I am going to go. I never go home. I want to stay here. Whee! If you can't behave and go home and take your nap, I won't come over to play again. Really? I'll never go over again? Well, I would probably come over, but I wouldn't take you to go on the Ferris wheel. Okay, Grandma. i go home and take my nap. Good girl, sweetie. Oh, someone's a sleepy little girl. I doubt you're even going to be awake by the time we get home. Ah, Grandma, I'm so sleepy. I love you, Grandma. I love you too, sweetheart. <laughs> Ah, ah, that was a long night, and I didn't get much sleep. Ah, I have to go into the kitchen and get something delicious. I'm so excited, Molly! Oh, hey, baby Kara, what you doing? Oh, coffee, lots of coffee needed. I'm excited because today I am my first day of daycare. Your first day of daycare, huh? Wow, pretty exciting. Well, unless you're, uh, me. Well, what do you mean, yes, I'm you? When you have all that stuff packed in your backpack for, you're not going to need all that. I need it because I will need it. What, what is that, another suitcase? Baby Kara, ugh, they're going to have everything you need there. Trust me. Snacks? Yep. Diapers? Yep. Everything. Well, except for maybe friends. What, what are you talking about? Um, uh, uh. Are you saying they can be bad? Well, no, not necessarily, but I remember when I first went to daycare. Oh boy, oh boy, my first day of daycare. I can't wait. I can play with all the toys and make all new friends. And it's going to be great. Good morning. Can I help you? I uh, yeah, I here for my first day of daycare. Name please. Molly, Molly, do 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 Molly. Okay, you're checked in. You can go play with the other kids. Hey, who are you? I'm Molly. What's your name? Freddy. And you're not allowed to play with any of the toys here. What? Yes, I am. I, I, I'm. I'm here to play with the toys. It's my first day of daycare. I own all the toys here. You can't play with any of them. Well, what about this hippo? No one seems to be playing with that. Mine. <laughs> See? Oh, okay. But how about I play with these blocks over here? Also mine. <laughs> I'm the only one allowed to play with anything. You can't play with anything ever. And by the way, you're kind of funny looking. Really? You... You don't want to be my friend? No, I'm not a friend. I'm a bully. 
<laughs> and your time at daycare is going to be your worst nightmare. <laughs> And, well, that's how my first day of daycare went. And pretty much the next few months. What? I don't want to go to daycare! Ah! Uh, baby Kara, that doesn't, that doesn't mean that... That doesn't mean that... Baby Kara, where, where are you going? That doesn't mean your daycare experience will be the same, but... Baby Kara? Oh my gosh! Did she just run away? Daisy! Uh, Daisy, we have a problem! Marley, I'm in my room! Doing my homework, of course, like the amazing student I am. Aww. Daisy, uh, 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 I might have done something wrong. Uh, like that's a big surprise. Wrong is your middle name. It is not, Daisy. Anyway, I'm time to fight with you. Baby Kira, she, she, she ran away. What? She ran away? Are you serious? Or is this some sort of weird prank? No, she ran away. What could possibly make her do that? Molly! Why always blaming me? Like, I'm the one that did something wrong. Well, Molly, if the shoe fits, you're probably Cinderella. <laughs> oh, I'm Cinderella? Where's my prince? And besides, Cinderella doesn't do homework. So, no more homework for me. Molly, you missed the point entirely. Ay, ay, ay. What did you say to baby Kira to make her run away? Um, I just sort of told her about my first day of daycare. Molly, that's a scary story. Of course she ran away. Now she's not going to want to go. Ugh, let's go find her. I'm sure she just went to town. I hope so. And I hope we can get her there before daycare actually starts. Baby Kara! Baby Kara, where are you? Molly, it's no use. She's gone. Oh, no. Baby Kara? Baby Kara, talk to me. I'm not going to to that daycare. I'm going to my What is it for me? Oh, she's talking baby talk. She's really stressed out. Baby Kira, get out from under that picnic table right now. I'm not going to go. You can't make me. Baby Kira, just because Molly had a bad first day at Dig Hill doesn't mean that you're going to. Yeah, baby Kira. And we could go in with you. I don't think so. Yeah, come on, baby Kira. You have to at least try. And if you don't like it, then you can come home. Really, Molly? Yeah, I mean, we can't make her stay if she doesn't like it. Okay, yes, we, we will let you go home if you don't like it. Okay, I come out, but I'm not going to like it. And you have to get buy my ice cream if I don't. Okay, fine. I'll use my allowance to buy you ice cream. Now, come on, let's go to the daycare center. Good morning, and who do I have here? Oh, good morning. I'm just helping my baby sister check into daycare. I'm not staying here. I'm not staying. Really? Why not, honey? Take care is very fun. I'm Megan, by the way. Hi, Megan. I'm Molly. I have baby Kira. Baby Kira, this looks like so much fun. Look at all the toys. Is this what you want to take care? Um, well, yeah. I'm not going! Yeah, but it was a long time ago. Megan wasn't here. I had some grump monster who just didn't even care if I was here or not. Oh, yeah, she got fired a long time ago. I took her place, though. I love kids, and I'm super nice, too. I think you'll have a lot of fun here, baby Kira. Why don't you at least try it? You can call me on my cell phone if you don't like it. I try, um, but I'm not sure I want to stay, Molly. I know, I know. But trust me, you have to just, I don't know, give it a chance. Oh, boy. I remember this like it was yesterday. Oh, look, a toy! Someone gonna try to take it? I don't think so. It doesn't look like it. Well, have fun, baby Kira. Bye! Bye, come back! You're gonna be okay, baby Kira. And just call me on my phone if you need anything. Hi, I'm Tommy. Hi, baby Kira. Are you mean? Oh, uh, no, I'm not mean. One time I got bullied. I didn't like it very much. So I decided not to be a bully myself. I know what you mean. I don't want to be a bully either. And I don't want I want to bully me. But maybe we could be friends. It's my first day at daycare. And my first day too. Wanna play with hippos? I love hippos. I love to play that. Wow, I'm having a good first day so far. Maybe not everybody has a bad day at daycare. Not us. Not because we're best friends. 
that you? Well, did I say that already? No, I'm Tommy. You said that already. Tommy, I like you. I like you too, Kira. you have a good day? I don't want to go home. I had to get my fun. You don't want to go home because you had so much fun? Oh, sweet girl. I'm so glad you like your new preschool. Well, like, I can't come in today. Uh, no, it's, uh, I, I, I can't work tonight because I have my twins. That's why I'm here picking them up from preschool. Uh, no, I don't want to lose my job. Okay. All right. I'll come in. If I can find a babysitter. Oh, hi. You must be a new mom too. Yeah, I'm Lorelai. Oh, well, I'm Laura. Our names are almost the same. <laughs> yeah, I'm having a really bad day because my boss wants me to work a shift because one of the other employees got sick and I don't have anyone to watch my twins. Well, I'm sure we could have a play date with my daughter and you could come pick him up at my house later. Does that work? Oh my gosh, you do that for me? Yeah, that would work great. I don't think so, Mom. Nope, nope, nope. What do you mean, baby Kira? You love playdates. No, 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 no. I think a bad idea. No. No, I want you. Baby Kira, what's got into you? I'm sorry, Lorelai. She probably just needs a diaper change or maybe a bottle. Yeah, I don't need anything. I, I don't want to have a play date with the twin. Baby Kira, don't be rude. Besides, I already told Lorelai, so just try to have fun, okay? All right, Lorelai, I'll text you my address and you can pick up the twins after you're done with your work shift. Thanks again so much, Laura. You really saved my life on this one, or at least my job. No problem. I don't know why I did that, Mom. Those twins are evil. What? They're evil? <laughs> They're just babies like you. Don't be ridiculous. Here, baby Kira, take your passy and try to be very sweet to the twins. See? Isn't everything all better now? I don't think so. Okay, Megan and Tegan, you guys can sit in the third row. Don't forget to buckle your seatbelts. I want to sit next to her because she smells bad. I don't smell bad. I smell like, um, uh, like my bath bubbles. Oh, yeah, she does smell really bad. Baby Kira smells like a piggy. <laughs> That's not funny. Quit teasing me, Megan and Tegan. Mommy! What, Baby Kira? What's going on back there? They're being made to be all ready. Oh, my goodness. You little kids are something else. Just try to get along, okay, everyone? We're going to go to a super fun diner for dinner. Then we'll go to the park. Oh, boy. We'll go to book Kevin Diner. Megan and Tegan, you're going to love it. I'm so glad I got this mom bus. Turns out I really need it. <laughs> La 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 Ew, her singing's bad. I know, Tegan, her singing is really bad. Hey, don't talk about my mommy that way. Okay, girls, each of you can get something from the menu for dinner, and then you can each have a dessert. Oh, boy, I love dessert, Mommy. Thank you. You're welcome, baby Kira. Megan, Tegan, what would you like from the menu? Mama, Mama! Wait a minute, baby Kira. I just asked Megan and Tegan what they're having. Okay, I'll wait then. I'm going to have an ice cream. And I'm going to have some pie. No, girls. You have to eat something for dinner first. Baby Kira, what are you going to have for dinner? Maybe the girls will have the same thing. I'm going to have uh, a cheap burger and... Um, and how about a vegetable? You want to pick a vegetable? A food salad. Yeah, you can have a cheeseburger and a fruit salad. Those are great choices. Okay, Megan and Tegan, what are you going to have? I'm going to have, like I said, an ice cream. I I'm going to have pie. I told you they were evil. You did this to me, though, Mom. Baby Kira, go sit in your chair, please. They aren't evil. They're just being a little naughty. Wow, that's the biggest cheeseburger I ever saw in my whole life. Oh, wow. And the fruit salad. 
Oh, it looks good too. I have to buy a little robot. She's so annoying. She still talks like a baby, Megan. I know Tegan, she does. No, what's this? I'm not eating this. Well, I ordered it for you since all you wanted to order was dessert. I got you some tacos and I got you some chicken and salad. Doesn't that look really good? No, I don't want to eat that. It looks gross. You're a bad babysitter. I told you they were evil, Mom. I told you. Baby Kira, sit down and eat your dinner. It's not nice to call Megan and Tegan evil. I think they are, though, Mom. I think they are. I'm not eating anything unless I have my apple pie. Um, okay, well, um, I guess you aren't eating anything then because you can't eat apple pie for dinner and you're going to get very hungry. Oh, thank you. You're rude. You're rude, lady. I want to go home. Now my mom can see how evil they really are. One hour later. Okay, girls, you only have about 30 minutes. It's starting to get dark, and then we're going to go back so your mom can pick you up. I'll get a swing on that swing. Oh, there's one for all of us. Whee! No, I want to swing on that swing. Get off of there. Don't push me. Ah, oh, Megan! You should have gotten off the swing. Oh my god, baby Kira, are you okay? Are you okay? I, I can't move my foot. I think I broke it. I need to Oh my gosh. Megan and Tegan, you guys are being extremely naughty. And now you pushed her off the swing and, and, and she's probably really hurt. Oh my gosh. You guys really are evil. <laughs> We are wondering if you are ever going to figure it out, lady. Okay, I need to call your mom. And then I need to take baby Kira to the hospital. Mom, it really hurts. I need to leave you out of you. Well, scratch that. I think I'll have to take these girls to the hospital and call their mom from there. She's not picking up. Megan, Tegan, don't let me see you doing anything else naughty today. For reals. You girls are going to make me crazy. Now, come on, baby Kira. Let's get you to the hospital and get that leg looked at. Megan, Tegan, keep up, please. We're coming. Jeepers. You're so bossy. <laughs> My leg really hurts. <laughs> oh, baby Kira, I'm so, so sorry, honey. I love my uh, Megan, why don't you go and get baby Kira some water? Here, here's some money. You can get it out of the vending machine. It's just around the corner. Do you think you can do that? Yeah, sure. I do it. <laughs> Tegan, I dare you to get in that x-ray machine. No, Megan, I dare you to get in it. <laughs> I can't wait to see what all your bones look like. I bet you won't even have a brain. Oh, uh, whatever, Megan. I will have a brain. <laughs> Look at you! You would say I dream machine and I'm a big doctor that says, um, hmm, nope, you have no brain. What? Yes, I do have a brain! Nope, see, you don't. I don't see a brain in there. Whatever, I definitely have one. Look at all these adorable little babies being so quiet, Megan. I know what you mean, Tegan. <laughs> Let's go some trouble. Let's have a rock concert. La 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 la. What are you girls doing? I sent you for a bottle of water and you're wrecking the entire hospital. Ah! Go get the bottle of water right now. We got your water and maybe now you can grow a new leg. Oh my gosh. You two really are the most evil identical twins ever. I need to call your mom and have her come pick you up right away. It just keeps ringing. Oh, wait, I think it's going to voicemail. 
Hi, you've reached Lorelei. I'm currently in Cancun and I'll be back next week. Can't believe I found someone to watch the kids. I needed this break so bad. Leave a message after the beep, but I probably won't check it till next week. Lorelei, you come get these evil twins right now! <laughs> Yes, baby Kira, we can go swimming, but eat your lunch first. Um, where's the hamburger that I packed you? I just up my dad. Mmm, yum, yum. Yep, it's super yummy, isn't it? I just up my dad, Papa. Okay, did you eat all of your lunch? Good girl. Come on, let's go build a sandcastle. Oh, I just up my dad. Mama, look. Yeah, it looks super nice today. Would you like to go in the water? Go, 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 go! Get the dope by you, Dad. Okay, be careful. You just learned how to swim. I didn't pack a bathing suit, but oh well. I'm still going to get in the water because I want to watch baby Kira. Ooh, boy! Aw, you're such a sweet baby. Well, most of the time, anyway. Once in a while, you have a tamper tantrum, but for the most part, you're a good kid. I did do my my dad, double do your double. Um, baby Kira, I have no idea what you just said. Apparently, it's pretty funny though. I just do my my water slide. You want to go down the water slide? Oh, I don't know. You're kind of small for that. Let me try it out first, and I'll find out if it's scary or not. I did do my yeah, do do my yeah. Okay, well, I'm gonna check it out first. Does anybody speak baby? Because I'm not quite sure what she said. Whoa! Ugh! Okay, yeah, that's way too grown up for you. Come on, let's go over on the swings for right now. Uh-oh, remember those temper tantrums I was telling you guys about? Yep, here's one. Hey, baby Kira, no, you're not allowed to go up the slide. No. Ugh. Do you want a timeout? I just don't mind you, but whoa, whoa, whoa! Baby Kira? Baby Kira? <laughs> okay, I guess you were grown up to go down it. Now let's go over to the, the play place. Come on, it'll be fun. Yeah, let's try out the swings. Oh, I haven't gone on a swing in so long. This is going to be fun. Whee! I did your papa mommy big kid. Yeah, I am like a big kid today, huh? Whoa, 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 whoa. Whee! <laughs> oh, that was fun. Don't jump though, baby Kira. Whee! Not so high, baby Kira. Oh my gosh, I don't want you to get hurt. Be careful. I did so time with you for Bobby. Good job, baby Kira. Let's see, what else is there to play on? Ooh, slide. Yeah, I don't see why you couldn't go down that slide. Watch, watch. Okay, I'm gonna watch. Baby Kira, what are you doing? No, get down from there. You're gonna get hurt, baby Kira. Gosh, baby Kira, what hurts? Are you okay? A boo boo, get do boo boo boo. Oh, can you stand on it? No. Da, 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 ba, ba, ba. Oh my gosh, I think you hurt your leg or your arm. I'm not sure. You're still a baby, so you can't tell me what hurts. Or maybe you can. I don't know. Can you tell me? Oh, poor baby. Okay, it's gonna be okay. I'm gonna go get the ambulance. You stay here. Oh my goodness. Crazy people work here. Wee -oo, wee -oo. Ah! What's happening? Why am I in the air? Oh my gosh. <laughs> I'm gonna need an ambulance next if I'm not careful. Wee -oo, wee -oo, wee -oo, wee -oo, wee -oo. Oh really Mama, really Oh no, she's not even smiling anymore. Things are really bad. Okay, come with me, baby Kara. Come on. Bye. 
<laughs> oh. Okay. Let me just pick you up. Okay. Okay, can you can you just come over? Where's the Wait, where Someone stole that. Oh my god, someone stole the ambulance. Okay. <laughs> oh my gosh, this is the worst hospital ever. It's going to get one star on Yelp. Okay. Um, let me go get another another ambulance. Hold on, baby Kira. What a day. What a day. This is a flying one. This one should work better. Oh my gosh, baby Kira! Okay, get in the back of the ambulance, baby! Is she in the back of the ambulance? Okay, guys, she's in the ambulance. I'm gonna drive over to the hospital now. Where are all the paramedics? Oh, they're over at the ice cream store. How convenient. Okay, baby, right this way. Come on. Thank you, baby, baby. <laughs> Excuse me? Emergency! How can I help you? My my baby hurt her leg. She's sitting right over there. Okay, um I have to ho I have to go home right now though. What? No! I did that for you, Tava. Um yeah, my wife said that um she's making chili for dinner and I can't wait to eat it. What? No! All right, baby Kira, come over here and, and put on your patient's outfit. I don't know why to want to. Yeah, we're going to go wait in the exam room. Come on. Oop, wrong one. How about in here, baby Kira? Okay, here we go. This is the right room. Hello, I'm your doctor. I'm Dr. Angel. What? You're just a little kid. They were so handy, so they needed somebody to help. Now tell me what happened. Um, my baby hurt her leg. Or left, whatever. Maggie, da -da -ba -ba. well, I meant leg. Okay, I'll just take a look at the scans now. Um, let's get a good scan. Oh, it hurts. It's okay, baby Kara. Everything's gonna be okay. Right? Right, Dr. Angel? I have no idea. I'm just a little kid. Oh my gosh! Does anybody that's a grown-up work in this hospital? I think you broke it. Wait, where'd she go? I get to buy it, Papa Oh, baby Kira. Oh no. Oh, look. Um, maybe I can find a cast in here. Let's see. Pants. I don't know if there's any casts in here. This is the worst hospital ever! Don't worry. It's gonna be okay, baby Kira. I'm gonna go see if I can find a better doctor. One that's not a little kid. Excuse me! My baby needs a doctor! Is there a doctor in the house? Um, hello? Could you stop yelling and get in line, please? Everybody's wearing masks. That's good. Uh, yeah, that's protocol. Um, now how can I help you? Please type it in here. I can't type fast enough. I need a doctor. Uh, can't spell doctor. My baby broke her leg. Leg. She's in exam room two. Oh my! Um, well, I'm not sure we have any doctors here right now. Well, other than me, but I'm working the front desk. What? Why are you working the front desk? Sorry, uh, I'm just really busy. Okay, well, can you actually help my baby, or do you need to take her to another hospital? Oh, we'll get to your baby. Don't worry. All right, show me where she's at. Right this way. Baby Kira? I'm still here. Okay, go, go. Here she is, doctor. Okay, let me take a look. Thank you so much, finally. Someone who can actually help my baby. Good thing hospitals aren't like this in real life. Ugh. Well, it looks like we may need to do surgery. Don't worry, baby Kira. She said maybe. Hmm. 
Hmm, I'm looking at her chart now. Hmm, so... So what? What's gonna happen with my baby? What's gonna happen? I can't tell Baba Oh. I know, baby Kira. I know you want to go home. Okay, doctor. Are you ever gonna tell us what's wrong? Yes, it's just this mask. It's hard to talk in it. Let's see. Her stats look okay. Um, I think she maybe just sprained it. Does she need a cast then? Um, no, not really. Are you even a doctor? Um, yes. I don't believe you! That doesn't sound really like you are! Of course I'm a doctor. Pfft, I'm just kidding with you. Oh, this hospital. I go home now. Bye. Baby Kira! Oh, the patient just left! I feel bad. Oh, bye! Get the double bubble! What a day. What a day! Hey guys, thanks so much for watching our roleplay today. This crazy was this hospital was crazy, right? Don't forget to hit that subscribe button and you can check out our new store, starsquad.shop. You can get t-shirts with the Star Squad, piggy shirts, backpacks, and so much more. Wee! She has a real broken uh, leg. Her bone just crushed, crashed. What? Oh my gosh, guys. Um, you can check out the store in our um, description box below this video. Check, check the link down there. Right now, I think I have to take baby Kira to surgery. Woo! No! Get that baby! Oh my gosh, baby. Ah, I got turned into a baby myself! Worst day ever. Worst day ever! I love this TV show. It's seriously so hilarious. I did it by that. Molly. I did it by Molly. What is it, baby Kira? Oh, you look so adorable in your cupcake outfit. I did Okay, use your words. I I don't know what you need. I did bath. You need a bath? Okay, well, we'll go give you a bath. I did so I do it. I did it. Okay, I have no idea what you just said. Oh, I can't understand baby talk. Okay, get in the bathtub. Are you telling your boy? Yeah, it's usual for baby dad. Are you doing for baby dad? Sleepover. A sleepover? Well, I am in charge of you today since I'm babysitting you. Um, I don't see why you couldn't have a sleepover. Wait a minute. Have you ever had one before? I tell my dog, no, no, I never. I said you never. You never had a sleepover. Oh my gosh, you're in for the best day of your life. Now you're hungry. Oh my gosh, you have a lot of needs. I had to buy it stuffy. Okay, come on. We'll go to the kitchen and make you a sandwich. First she's dirty, then she needs a bath. Huh, babysitting's a lot of work. I did not make this sleepover. Yes, you can have your sleepover, but first let's feed you something so you're not hungry. Here's a sandwich. I'll just give it to you now. There you go. I eat a sandwich. Mmm, that's so yum. <laughs> yeah, it is good. Okay, well, the first thing we need to do is have you call your friends and ask if they want to come to the sleepover. Who do you want to invite? I saw a bookie and we to tip up a Katie. I figured those are the two you'd want to invite. Okay, well, go and find my cell phone and give them a call, okay? Okay, guys, you be right back. I can't believe it. Baby Kira is finally old enough to have her first sleepover. Hmm, what should we plan to do? Maybe we'll go swimming in the indoor pool. I'm sure her friends would think that was fun. And a movie. Oh, yeah, this is going to be so cool. I said yes. I said yes. They said yes. They said yes? Oh, that's awesome. Well, they should um come over as soon as possible then so you can have the most amount of time for your sleepover. I told you to get by the way. They're on their way now? Okay. Well, let's go meet them at the door. Baby Kira, they're at the door. I think that means she's excited. <laughs> Katie, Brookie, hi. We're so glad you're here for the sleepover. Hi, I'm really excited. Me too. I am Brookie. So much baby talk. 
Okay, um, after you get done eating another sandwich, holy guacamole, baby Kira's having a girl spurt. Let's go get in the pool, guys. Come on. Yeah, the water feels great. Okay, I'm gonna see if I can swim to the bottom. <laughs> whoa, whoa, whoa. Totally did it. Oh, yeah. But those guys are babies, so they probably can't. Wait, do you guys all know how to swim? Uh, yeah, I swim. I know how to swim. Oh, that's awesome. How about you, Katie? Yeah, I know how to swim, too. Good job. Okay, well, I'm going to sit outside the pool and watch you guys. Make sure you're doing okay and you're safe and everything. And then maybe we can watch a movie. What do you guys think about that? It's a no nap, no nap. Um, we'll see about the nap. We'll have to see if you guys need one or not. I do have to. I have to go to the bathroom. Okay, Katie. Well, after you get done having your sandwich, I mean, <laughs> how many sandwiches do you guys need to eat? Good grief. Okay, the bathroom's right in here. Okay, Katie. Thank you. You're welcome, Katie. Come down when you're done. Oh no, more babies are hungry. <laughs> I'm hungry all the time. Oh, you're hungry all the time. I know, Kira. I'm hungry too all the time. <laughs> you guys are so cute on your first sleepover. I can't even believe it. I can watch a movie. You want to watch a movie? Okay, well, everybody follow me. We have our own theater here. It's pretty amazing, actually. All right. Um, I'm not sure what's showing right now. I have to look. But uh, I think we could watch a movie. Woo! We take a ship of Luffy. Yeah, we could watch any movie you want. You want to watch the unicorn movie? I can watch unicorn movie. Let's wait for the others to get here. I can watch a movie about unicorn. Okay, we'll watch the movie about the unicorn. I can watch the unicorn. Come on, Katie. Let's watch the movie. I can't show you why you did that. I do why you that. Uh huh, I love this movie too. <laughs> oh no, baby Kira, you're yawning. I think it's time for bed. I don't know, but I said thank you. No, no. I know, you want to stay up really late, but 9 o'clock is really late. Come on, guys, I'll show you where it's time for you to go to bed. No, we stay up for forever. No, you can't stay up forever. Come on. Oh, no. I only have two cribs. Uh-oh. I better buy one really quick. <laughs> okay, let's see. I need to buy a crib. Let's look it up. Crib. Oh, thank goodness. Here we go. I'm just going to put this um, basic crib in here. So that I have a crib for everybody. Okay, there's the last crib. Phew! Just in time. Okay, who, who's in bed so far? Brookie, Katie, Baby Kira, it's time for bed. Don't be that going to bed. Baby Kira, you have to go to bed. Come on. I sleep in this room, and then I go in the pool. Baby Kira, don't you dare. Don't you dare. <laughs> Bye! Baby Kira! Oh my gosh, Baby Kira. That was very naughty. Go to your room. No, I stay up forever. I sleep over. Look how dark it's getting outside. You have to go to bed. Let's go camping. Camping? Are you crazy? We're not going camping. Come here. No! <laughs> Baby Kira, if you can't be better than this, you can't have any more sleepovers. So you want to be a good girl so you can have more, right? No! I can pay the pay to do my diet. Okay, well, too bad you're still going to bed. Night night. Go. Yeah, she didn't want to go to bed, and as soon as her head hit the pillow, she was out. <laughs> wow, three babies at their very first sleepover. Aw, so cute. <laughs> No, Daisy, I get the pink unicorn. You can have the blue one. Molly, it's time to wake up. You slept right through your alarm. Oh, no. 
No, I can't go to school today, Mom. I, I, uh... I've got bird flu! Molly, no you don't. You don't look sick at all. I can't go because I've got chicken pox! Molly, you don't even have a single spot. Get out of bed and come downstairs for breakfast right away. <sighs> okay. Uh, who would have thought that school would have been every single day, Monday through Friday, for so many months? <sighs> who came up with that idea anyway? <laughs> Molly, what's wrong? Did you fall down the stairs or something? What's happening? Oh, ma, I'm so sad, but I just got a call from the school. School is canceled. What? I didn't get a text to a call from the school. That's because they only send one call out per family. Otherwise, it just takes forever to call every student. Maddie, they would just text all the students in one mass text. They wouldn't call. Your lies are ridiculous. Molly, are you lying to me right now? No, I mean, I'm so sad school is canceled. She's lying. Molly, get your breakfast and get ready to get on the bus. Or else. Fine, cheapers. Mmm, breakfast pizza. Uh, Molly, I didn't make any breakfast pizza. Nah, this is just a leftover pizza from last week, but if you eat it for breakfast, then it becomes breakfast pizza. <laughs> oh, boy. I go go today with my and Daisy. Um, baby Kara, you're too little. You can't go to school. What? I went go go. Oh boy, this again. Mmm, this pizza's delicious. Mm. I gotta go get dressed though. Bye. I went go go. I go go. I got backpack. I go go do. Um, baby Kara, you can't go to school yet. You're not old enough, honey. You're still just a little toddler. Yeah, baby Kara, besides, there's a lot of big kid stuff that happens like homework, math and science, riding the school bus. I want go go. Oh, boy, it's going to be a long day. Okay, baby Kara, come on. Let's go change your diaper. Daisy, the bus is here. Molly, I'm standing right behind you. Oh, <laughs> I didn't even hear you. You were like a sneaky ninja. Yeah, that's definitely me. Sneaky ninja. Um, well, you're more like a nerdy ninja, but you know. <laughs> you know what I mean. Ugh, I can't even get on the bus. What's wrong with me right now? Ugh, ugh, ugh. Brookhaven bus, why are you so hard to get on to? Good morning, students. Now, remember, keep our hands to ourselves, all that stuff. I go to school. Hey, what's a little kid doing on the bus? D this isn't for babies. I'm not baby. I toddler. I, I go to school like a big girl. Well, I don't. I can't believe there are any babies on this bus. This is total. Whoa! You that bad word. You said. Oh my gosh! A toddler just swore. <laughs> Oh man, I think it might be a bad influence. Wait a minute, why, why is my baby sister here? Good question, why are you here? I don't go to school like my big sisters. Um, you can't go to school because you're not five yet. And then you start kindergarten, you're not in middle school. Well this is total be Oh my gosh, did you just say what I think you said? I think she did. Baby Kira, where'd you hear that word? I think it's a total. Oh my gosh, go to the principal's office right now. She'll call your mother and, and work this all out. Daisy, where's the rest of the class? They're still getting off the school bus. Oh my goodness, Baby Kira, you're going to be grounded for life. Ah, oh, there's a student in my office already? School just started. Wait, I can't even see the student. Who is that? It's a... Baby? I am baby! I toddle! Why everybody call me a baby when I toddle? This is b Oh my gosh! Wait a minute, aren't you Laura Acker's daughter? I am not uh, Acker's daughter. Oh my gosh, I better call her on the phone right now. Mmm, this coffee's delicious. Finally, a moment of peace just to myself. Oh. My phone's ringing. Oh no, I wonder who that could be. 
Hello, Miss Ackers. Is this you? Yes, this is Mrs. Acker. How can I help you? Well, um, this is the school calling. Uh, this is the principal. Oh, great. What did Molly do now? No, no, Molly didn't do anything. Well, yet yeah, anyway, the day is young. Well, what are you calling me for then? Did Daisy get another amazing grade in science class? No, it's about your other daughter. My other daughter? I don't have another daughter in school. You must be calling the wrong person. No, your littlest daughter, Kira. Oh, <laughs> what are you calling about her for? She's in my office. She's been saying, what? She didn't say that. She's right here. I, I just put her down for a nap. I'm just going to run into the room and look and make sure. Oh my gosh, she's not here. Oh, I am so sorry. She wanted to follow her big sisters to school today and apparently she succeeded. I feel like a terrible mom right now. Don't worry, Mrs. Acker. It happens more often to you than you think. I'll keep her here in my office until you can come pick her up. And you might want to tell her that she can't say uh, in school. All right, I don't know where she learned that word. It was, certainly wasn't from me. Maybe her father. Baby Kira, you still have a few years left to go before you, um, you know, come to school. Baby Kira, there you are. Oh my goodness, you're in so much trouble. I am one good girl like a big girl like I go to school. Because, honey, you're not five years old yet. What, what this is? <laughs> oh my gosh, you are not allowed to say that, baby Kira. Where did you hear that? I like find this boy on your bus. He said it a lot. Oh my goodness, I can't believe it. My daughter was so naughty today. Oh, I was hoping you'd be more like Daisy instead of Molly. Well, I can see my work here is done, so, um, well, good luck. Thank you, Principal. Come on, baby Kira, it's time to go home. I'm not going to stay here forever. Oh, I can tell that you're definitely going to be more like Molly. Oh. <laughs> Yeah, Mom, what are we doing here? Well, I thought it'd be super fun to bring baby Kira on her first trip to the zoo. The zoo? Oh my gosh, I love the zoo! Me too, Molly, me too, I love the zoo. Whoa, <laughs> do they just let like hippos and stuff wander around outside the zoo? Um, I'm not really sure why all these animals are roaming around. Um, maybe they're trying to clean their cages. Ooh, venomous, yay! Yay! I love going to the zoo. Aww, baby Kira is super excited about coming to the zoo. Okay, everybody, come on. Let's teleport. Oh, yeah. Whoa, Mom. Look at it. It says um, six and under get in free so baby Kira can get in. But Daisy and I are $12 a piece and you're 15 Whoa, the prices at the zoo have really gone up. Oh, no, Mom. Don't tell me we can't afford to go to the zoo now. Oh, that would be terrible. Don't you girls worry. I brought enough money so that all of us could go to the zoo. <laughs> yeah, except for Dad. <laughs> He's not here. He had to stay home. Oh, Molly, don't be silly. Don't tell the Toy Hero fans that we left Dad at home. That's not true. Okay. Dad had to work today, so we decided to come to the zoo without him. Well, not without him. He suggested that we should come here. Yeah, Dad's cool like that. All right, everybody, come on. Whoa, they have a hot dog shop here? That is amazing! I definitely want a hot dog. Molly, you just had a snack. You don't need a hot dog yet, do you? Okay, no, I don't need a hot dog. Um, But I want to see all of the animals. Wait a minute. Why is there pictures of snakes? <gasps> this must be where the snakes are. Oh, look at that little snail. He's so cute. Ew, spiders! Spiders, yuck, yuck, yuck! Okay, where's the rest of my family? I'm going to sit here I don't like spiders. There's no spiders in there, Daisy. Trust me. Molly, you lie, you lie, you pants on fire. I know that there's snakes in there because I heard you. Um, and spiders because I know I heard you screaming. Ah, there's spiders in here. I heard it. Yeah, well, not snakes. Molly, I heard you talking about the snakes on the outside. Yeah, but I didn't actually see snakes. I took out the bye bye. Ooh, snakes. Baby Kira, no! 
Do not go in with the snakes. Baby Kira! Daisy, baby Kira just went in with the snakes! Oh my gosh. Okay, wait. I think this is just butterflies. Okay. You are safe in here, baby Kira, but do not go where the snakes are, okay? I did so bye. I can't go bye bye. What are these? I don't even know what those are supposed to be. Lizards or something? <laughs> okay, they're kind of weird looking. Oh, wait. Here's some frogs over here. You want to see the frogs, baby Kira? Ooh, fuck, fuck, fuck. Yeah, that's how you say frog. Frog, fuck, fuck. <laughs> He's so cute, baby Kira. Oh, these are like, I think these are poisonous frogs because I remember the last time I came to the zoo, they were, oh my gosh, there's a tiger in here. Everybody run. I think you to do Baba. Hey Daisy, uh, it's good to see you this summer. Um, how, how are you having? Uh, are you having a fun summer vacation? <laughs> ah, that guy goes to school with us. Hey, what's up? Oh, your friends are here. That's awesome. Um, yeah, everybody wants to come to the zoo because the zoo is the coolest place. Mom, are you gonna come in? Um, no, I don't really like spiders. Oh, you're just like Daisy. I mean, I don't like spiders or snakes really that much, but. I'm still gonna go in and see them, cause hello, it's part of the zoo. Hey, what's in here, and where's my baby sister, baby Hira? Oh, I think that might be a turtle or something. I don't know what that is. Some of these animals I don't even recognize. Baby Kira, you're not supposed to get in there. Get out of there right now, I'm telling mom. I'm not trying to be mean to you, I'm trying to keep you safe. Okay, those um, little turtles are not mean, but if... Baby Kira, what are you doing in there? Get out of there this instant or we're not going to stay at the zoo. Sorry. Yeah, that's what I was trying to tell her, Mom. It's dangerous in there. Okay, there was a sign for snakes, but there was no snakes in there. It's a winter wonderland! There's Olaf. Okay, what's in here? Tundra exhibit. Woo! This is your bag, you go to Baba. Yep. Look, it looks like there's some Arctic wolves in there or something. Cool, huh, baby Kira? To go to Baba, cool. You said all that stuff to say cool. That's totally baby talk. What's up here? I don't know where the rest of my family went. Oh, that's still the tundra exhibit. You can look at it from above too if you want. Aquatic mammals. <gasps> it's a dolphin! Daisy! Whoa! Molly, I love dolphins! Eek, 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 eek. <laughs> Daisy, what is that? That's the sound that the dolphin makes. Eek, 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 eek. <laughs> That's so cute. Oh, look! There might be a dolphin show coming up. That's why these bleachers are here. Okay, um, jump through a ring or something, Mr. Dolphin. Molly, I don't think it's time for a, sh a dolphin show. I want to swim with the dolphins. Molly, you want to pay extra for that? No, you don't. Look, Daisy. Oh, hi, Mr. Dolphin. I'm going to swim with the dolphin on it on his back. Daisy, maybe he doesn't want you to. Yes, Molly, he spoke dolphin to me and told me he did. <laughs> Daisy, you speak dolphin? I didn't know that. Yeah, I took a, a class last summer from Rosetta Stone. Rosetta Stone? What's that? Well, you can learn a bunch of different languages. They don't offer dolphin. Girls, get out of the dolphin tank. Ay, 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 you girls. You're going to get grounded. Grounded? No way. I didn't do anything wrong. OMG. Where's Nemo? Where is Nemo? You mean a clownfish, Molly. What's a clownfish? It's the type of fish that Nemo was. Oh. These ones are blue and white. Is that a clownfish? I don't know, Molly. I only know the orange and white ones. Oh, okay. Um, why is there a fox in the pool? I think that's a deer, Molly. Oh, yeah, it's a deer. <laughs> Whee! The fun! The fun petting zoo! Petting zoo! Okay, of course the baby's gonna be most excited about the petting zoo. Babies always are, so we're gonna take my baby sister to the petting zoo. Baby Kara, where are you? Bunny! Bunny, bunny! Bunny drink water. Oh, that's a cute bunny. 
Home, take Bunny home. No, baby Kira. Bunny lives at the zoo. Ah! Lion! Ah! Lion! Ah! Okay, I'm not really sure why there's a lion in here with the bunnies, but... Look, it's a little Bubba Bunny house. Aw, look. Let me take a picture of baby Kira. She looks so adorable. Okay, Mom. Here comes the million pictures of my sisters and I. <laughs> oh, now I see why you guys were in with the deer. Hi, Mr. Deer. Um, Molly, that's a Mrs. Deer. The ones with antlers are Mr. Deers. Oh, I see. Hi, Mr. Deer. Hi, Mrs. Deer. Where's your baby deers? No, no. They don't have any baby deers. Whoa, this one's huge. Look how big they are. They seem super friendly, though. Splashing in the water. Molly, get out of there. Oh, my goodness. You're being kind of crazy right now. Sorry, I'm excited about the zoo. Um, not as crazy as Baby Kira riding the horse. Baby Kira? Whee! Horses love horses! Hmm, maybe I'll have to get Baby Kira some horseback riding lessons. I want to go too, Mom. I want to go. I don't know where Daisy is. She just, like, left or something. Um, I think she was at the last exhibit. All right, girls. Leave the horses alone. These aren't riding horses. Look, this is, like, where the all the barnyard animals are. There's a sheep. Bah. 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 That's my best way of speaking sheep. Cluck, 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 cluck. <laughs> That's right, baby Kira. Chicken goes cluck, 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 cluck. Okay, which ones haven't we seen yet? Ooh, Blakewam! Blakewam! We haven't seen all the animals yet, baby Kira. Come on. There's still more animals over here. Savannah exhibit. Jeez, baby Kira, you pushed me. A zebra! Oh, I love zebras. They're so cool. What else is there? More deer. They have a lot of deer in this one. Whoa, the street lights are coming on. That means the zoo's gonna close soon. Oh, you can never see all of the animals in one day. That's the only thing. The zoo is so big, you can't even see them all. <gasps> Look at that tiger. It is beautiful. I know, right? I've been standing here for like 10 minutes staring at that tiger. I'm gonna go over here and see if there's any other tigers. I just see one. The other ones are probably sleeping, Molly. Mom, what are you doing? Ah, I accidentally fell, fell in the tiger cage. Oh my gosh. Somebody call 911. My mom fell in the tiger cage. <laughs> mom, what are you doing? Hiding. Mom, I think the tiger might actually be taking a nap. You can probably get out of there and be okay. Are you sure, Molly? Um, do you have eyes on the tiger? Yeah. I have the eye of the tiger. Just kidding. <laughs> I'm not going to sing that song. <laughs> it was just like the perfect joke. All right, let's see. Um, I think we only have time for about one more exhibit. Okay, well, I'm glad that I get to see this giant elephant. Why is there an elephant here? I don't know. It's like some of the animals got out of their cages. Holy moly. Okay, I already... Oh, this is a different Savannah exhibit. Mom, we have a little problem. What is it, Molly? This sheep is following me everywhere I go. <laughs> Maybe that sheep just really likes you. Daisy, where have you been? I was just um actually looking at all the exhibits. Okay, girls. Well, it's time to go home. Oh, already? Can we come back to the zoo tomorrow and see more? I think we totally can, girls. Hooray! Hey, two-year-old fans. Thanks so much for coming along when we take my um little baby Kira to the zoo for the first time. Oh my gosh, the sheep is following me everywhere. Guys, thanks so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe to the Toy Heroes channels. And we love you guys. You're the best fans in the world. We'll see you guys next time. Bye! <music> baby Kira, are you super excited that it's your first birthday? I don't go so excited I'm a couple of seconds days. That's right, baby Kira, we're at Chuck E. Cheese. Oh, I just love it here. Sometimes I even want to work here part-time. Mom, you want to work at Chuck E. Cheese? Yeah, it's great. You get to make pizzas and... Molly, why do you look so buff? Oh, you know, I've just been working out at the gym and stuff. 
I have red money. I think it's just Chuck E. Cheese making you look that way. Sure it is. Sure it is, Daisy. I bet that I can lift up the heaviest thing in the whole world. Uh-huh, so Molly. I could not buy the baba so I can't say such a baba. Yeah, you want to go to Chuck E. Cheese? Come on, baby Kira. Dad? Dad? Oh, wait a minute. You look just like my dad, but you're not my dad. No, it's not daddy. He's at work today. He will celebrate with you when he gets home from work. Then he'll probably give you a birthday present and stuff, baby Kira. Ooh, see here, see here. Rat E blocks. Sort of like Chuck E. Cheese, but the Roblox version. Can I stay with you, baby Kira? Maybe. Maybe? But aren't I your favorite person in the whole world? I so Daisy. Daisy is your favorite person in the world? No, she's not. <laughs> Molly. <laughs> Daisy. I got to Daisy. Okay, girls, what do you think? Some pizza? Hello, I'm Breezy. Hi, Breezy. Uh, you're dressed like a bunny. Uh huh. I like bunnies. They're super adorable. They really are adorable. Um, what would you like today? Mm, let's see. I'll help my children order. Um, baby Kira's gonna have a slice of pizza. And Molly's gonna have a slice of pizza. And Daisy's gonna have a slice of pizza. And so am I. We're all gonna have pepperoni. Um, Mom, do we have to have salad? Yes, you have to have salad. But it's a party! Why do we have to have salad when it's a party? Um, if you eat your salad, you can also have a soda. Woo! A soda! I love sodas. Daisy, where are you going? I'm just gonna go get my salad from the salad bar. Oh, a salad bar! Oh, yeah. Gotta love these salad bars. Uh-huh, this is actually pretty good, like... I don't know. Salads aren't my favorite, but this looks delicious. Oh, our pizza's here! I just love my pizza, Bubba. Oh, baby Kira, you're so adorable. You're so little that your head barely goes over the top of the table. Oh, I can't believe she's a year old already. She's growing up so fast. I know why that girl was dressed like a rabbit. Why, Molly? Because they feed your rabbit food here. Look at all this green lettuce. Ooh, I love green lettuce. Can I eat some? Um, no, it's my salad. Mmm. Ah, this pizza looks delicious. Nothing like Chuck E. Cheese pizza! It really make your day awesome! I need more pizza. What do you think, baby Kira? Do you like the pizza? Oh, she's got some sauce on her face. It's in my get black. Woo, yummy! Excuse me, do not sit on my sister, please. Ay, 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 rude. We were sitting here first. Oh, Molly, be nice. I'm sure she just didn't see baby Kira. She's really tiny. Ah, there's a baby under the table. Did you guys see that? Have a look at I gift for you today. Um, there's a baby waitress. <laughs> I think she's just pretending, Molly. Yeah, you're probably right, Mom. Mmm. Wow. Okay, who's got the last slice? Molly, why don't you let baby Kira eat one of the last slices? But mom, I'm so hungry! I need to have my energy for Chuck E. Cheese games. Ah, oh, that was delicious. Okay, why do I have a fishing pole? You can go fishing at Chuck E. Cheese? Never knew this. Ooh, now we can have a sausage pizza. Sausage pizza? No. No, 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 no. I want pepperoni. Well, it's half pepperoni, half sausage, Molly. Okay. I'll eat the pepperoni part then. Fu, me fu, me fu. You're full, baby Kira? Okay. Play, play, play. Mom, she wants to play. We can't debate with her on that one. It is her birthday. Besides, it's so much fun. Come on, baby Kira. I'll come with you while we're waiting for them. Oh, my gosh. It's... Why is there a monkey on me? Why was there just a monkey on my back? That was really crazy. <laughs> Oh my gosh, there's monkeys everywhere! I want a monkey. Here, hi, monkey. Oh, they're like disappearing. Oh, but now there's ducks everywhere. Okay, I'm so confused right now. Hey, Chucky, you're famous! Oh my gosh, I love your place so much. This is my little sister, baby Kira. She just turned one years old. She said that Chuck E. Cheese is the most fun. 
Okay, baby Kara, now that we've said hi to Chucky, let's go play a game. Look at this place! The sky is the limit, baby Kara! You're probably little enough to crawl through here. Whoa, I earned so many tickets. Ooh, Molly! Okay, I'm gonna wait for you at the other end, baby Kara. Wait a minute, I'm gonna look down the tube. Hold on! Woo-wee! Fun, fun, love, love! Yeah, I know. I know you love it here. Okay, how about in here? Oh, this is like a little a prison? A <laughs> jailbreak! Just kidding. I think it's supposed to be a bounce house. Baby Kara, come here. Try this one out. Okay. Bounce up and down. Fling, 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 fling. Good job. Oh, like it's a little town, see? Oh, I can go in this one. Ooh, cool. I diff you. I diff you. No, you can't live here. And the door is too small. I can't get back out. What? Okay, there. I fixed it. Okay, baby Kara, let's go over here. You want to ride in the truck? Or the car? I you real. <laughs> yeah, I'm real. Oh, my goodness. They're asking me if I'm real. Of course I'm real. Come on, baby Kara. Get in the car, baby. Come on. Excuse you. My little sister's here. Oh, my gosh. She's a famous YouTuber. She's on Chuck E. Cheese. I can't believe she's at the place where I work. This is amazing. <laughs> hey, giraffe girl. I'm just celebrating my baby sister's first birthday. I subscribe to you. I think you're amazing. Oh, thank you so much. That's nice of you to say. Okay, I'm going to say thank you. Thank you. Okay, baby Kara. Let's go over and try something else because, I don't know, let's play some skee ball or something. Oh, yeah, here we go. Play. Oh, I love skee ball. I don't know if I'm going to be good at the Chuck E. Cheese skee ball. I keep trying, but. Come on, go! Sometimes it doesn't work. This one might be broken. Okay, everything I'm trying doesn't work. Go! There we go. Okay, sure. Then when it get, I wasn't ready for that. Okay, why? Why won't you go? Okay. Maybe if I just pull this back like this. See, the, the blue line is going, but nothing's happening. Yeah, there we go. Oh, I totally failed. Oh, come on, come on, come on. Oh, at least I got like 10 points. That was cool. I'm going to have to play this again because I think you have to double click. I didn't know that. Oh, this is like impossible. Oh, that one was so close. I almost got it in like the 100 point one. I did terrible on that one. Oh, oh! Okay, I won some tickets. Let's let's try this one more time. Oh, come on! I want a big one. Come on! I want to let win lots of tickets. I literally don't think you can make it into anything but the bottom one. Did you guys see that? That was awesome. I'm going to try for another one. Here we go. Nope. We need the power of the unicorn right now. Okay, here we go. Ah! Okay, I got some tickets though. Molly, where's our sister? I'm um, climbing all over the skee ball machine. Come on, baby Kira. What do you want to do? Oh, you want to go on that? Okay. Oh my gosh, you're so cute. Are you having fun on your birthday? Guys, love, love, suckle, go, 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 I love when she talks, baby talk. It's so adorable. Don't get any bigger. I want you to stay little forever. You're so adorable. I tell about you. Bye, go, 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 Come on, baby Kira. Um, we better go find mom, because I think we might need to leave soon. No! Stay forever! Ooh, Dance Dance Revolution. 
feel like I could be good at this. Green, red. <laughs> this could be so cool. Wait, babe, where's baby Kira? She's over here, Molly. I don't think she ever wants to leave. Remember what it was like the first time you went to Chuck E. Cheese? Yeah, I wanted to live here. Pretty much wanted to live here. Mom! What are you doing? I'm just eating more pizza. Whoa, Mom, you're going to be so full of pizza. Molly, get off the table, please. Sorry, Mom. Manners, manners, Molly. Mom, do we have to go home? Um, well, soon. But I want to play some more games. Molly, it looks like we have a bunch of fans in here. Yeah, they, they love us and, and they're playing a Chuck E. Cheese, too. Mom, can we stay a little bit longer? I want to stay. Yeah, you girls can stay another half an hour. Yeah! Come on, baby Kira. Your birthday party isn't over yet. Ooh, yeah, yeah. We're gonna party down. Ooh, yeah, yeah. We're gonna party down. Hey, Toy Hero fans. Thanks so much for watching today. Don't forget to subscribe to the Toy Heroes channel. Where we put out awesome videos just like this one every single day. Let us know in the comment section below what you thought of baby Kira's Chuck E. Cheese birthday party. And the party's just getting started, guys. Wait a minute. I want to go up on stage and sing a little song. Hello, Toy Hero fans! I'd like to sing you a little song. Is everybody good with that? Woohoo! I can't wait to hear you sing! Okay, here we go. I love Roblox, yes I do! I love Roblox, how about you? Whoa, I've got a whole band going here right now. I'm gonna play the drums! I'll play the keyboard. I love Roblox, yes I do! I love Roblox, how about you? If you love Roblox, slam that like button! Okay guys, I'll see you next time, bye! I can't believe that I finally get to babysit baby Kira! This is gonna be like the best day ever because my baby cousin is so adorable and I'm getting paid to babysit her. <gasps> now I can go buy that LOL doll that I want. Anyway, I'm super excited that I get to watch my baby cousin today. I'm outside her house and isn't her house like super nice? Her parents have a beautiful house. Anyway, I'm wearing my Power of the Unicorn scarf because it's super chilly out because it's, you know, getting close to Thanksgiving and it starts getting cold. So I made sure that I wore my scarf in case I wanted to take baby Kira for a walk in her stroller. Look, guys, I even got a stroller just so I could walk baby Kira outside. Oh, my gosh, it's so cute. Oh, I love baby Kira. Okay, I should go knock on the door now. Knock, knock! Anybody home? Baby Kira, your babysitter's here to babysit you! The door's locked! Okay, well, her mom gave me the key, so I just gotta unlock it. Molly, Molly, yay, yay! Aw, hi, baby Kira, how are you? Aw, you look so cute. Are you playing with your toys? Molly, yeah! Aw, you're so sweet. Uh, I love toys. Aw, you love toys? That's awesome. I saw you house. I saw you house. Okay, well, you can show me the house. Come on, let's see it. To heal. Oh, this is the bathroom. Wow, you have a huge bathroom. The potty, potty. Yeah, you still wear diapers, though. You don't need that yet. No, no. Wow, Baby Kira has an awesome house. Baby Kira, why did you throw that pizza on the floor? Baby Kira, don't do that. That's naughty. A pizza floor. Yeah, no, don't throw the pizza on the floor. <laughs> kitchen, kitchen. That's right, Baby Kira. This is the kitchen. Wow, it's really nice, huh? Don't stand on the counter, Baby Kira. Baby Kira, Baby Kira, come. Oh, my gosh. Baby Kira, don't be naughty. Come on. Oh, wow. You got a nice little living room. Look, your house is right across the street from the police. Please, please. That's right, please. Okay. Still, still's hard. I know. You're still learning how to walk. Crawl, crawl. No, you don't want to crawl forever. Whoa, more places to play. Wow, you're a lucky little girl. 
Wee! Wee! <laughs> You're so cute, baby Kira. Oh, look, lots of kids' books I can read to you, huh? Yeah, yeah. What else is in here? Ouch, I fell! Oh, baby Kira, are you okay? Yeah. That's good. Is this your bed, baby Kira? Yeah. He's, he's not time for night night. No, it's not time for night night yet. We got bunk beds in here, too. What's in this room? Mama's room. Mama and Dada's room. Boing, 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 boing. Baby Kara, no jumping on the bed. Baby Kara. Wee. No, bad baby. <laughs> Don't throw a temper tantrum. You're not supposed to do that. You know that. Now, come on. Show me the rest of the house. Okay. <laughs> she got off her that temper tantrum fast. Where'd she go? She's quick, that little baby. Oh, an exercise room. Whoa, your house is pretty awesome. Baby Kira, can you do that? <laughs> baby Kira. Baby Kira's running on the treadmill. <laughs> oh, that looks so funny. You're so cute, baby Kira. Uh, uh. No, those are too big for you. They're too big. Do you want to go for a walk, baby Kira? You want to go for a walk? Uh, yeah, yeah. Uh, baby Kira? Where'd you go? Oh my gosh, baby Kira went missing. Oh no. Oh no, this is so bad. Don't tell me I lost baby Kira. Oh my gosh, this is so bad. Hey, who are you? You don't you don't live here. What? Get out of here. Okay, I'm going to have to lock my house. Okay, I locked it. Now I have to go find baby Kira. Who disappeared? Okay, she's not in the garage. The FBI are here. Okay, good thing. Because I accidentally lost my little cousin, baby Kira, when I was supposed to be babysitting her. Hey, FBI person, come back. Why are you... Are you investigating where my little cousin is? Come back here. She disappeared. Everybody comes into this house. Oh, no, she didn't disappear. <laughs> Liv, can you help me find my little baby cousin? When was the last time you saw her? Um, about five minutes ago. Where was the last place you saw her? In the exercise room. Can you stop running through my house now? Ugh, this FBI agent is just... She's not helping at all. Good, baby Kira? Molly, Molly. Is baby Kira outside? Baby Kira, how did you get out here? Walk, walk. Oh, baby Kira, you scared me half to death. All right, get in the stroller, baby Kira. Now, hold on. I've got to lock my house because that FBI agent's been, like, running around in there. <laughs> Where should we go, baby Kira? Let's go for a little walk. Look at, there's the Black Sea Diner. Whoa, look at that fancy couple in there. They have wings. Wings, wings. Oh, baby Kara, you look so cute in your stroller. Okay, let's go over here and see what's what there is to do in this town. Lots of places to eat. Oh, there's an adoption center. Lots of people waiting to adopt. Oh, here's a playground. You want to go there, baby Kara? Gaga, yeah! Gaga, yeah. Okay, I think that means yes. No going in the pool, okay? It's too cold. It's November now, so it's cold out. You can't go in the pool, okay? Uh-huh. Okay, baby Kira. Have fun. Wee! Wee! Want to get on this big slide? Come on, follow me, baby Kira. Do, 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 ba, 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 do, do. Babysitting baby Kira is a lot of work, but so far it's pretty fun. Except for the part where I lost her. That part wasn't fun. Here I go! Ready? Wow! Oh, it's Molly! Oh, baby Kara, why did you try climbing up the slide, silly baby? <laughs> That's right, go up the slide. Okay, I'll wait down here for you, okay, at the end? Okay, Molly. Silly baby. Are you coming down the slide ever? 
Is it just me or does that baby over there look like a zombie? Wee! Oh, baby Kira. That looks like a zombie baby chasing a cat. You stay over here, baby Kira. Zombie, zombie. No, you can't play with the zombie baby. Boing, 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 boing. Wee, Molly, wee. Oh, you're so cute. Okay, what else is there to do? Oh my gosh, you can climb up this thing. Can you climb up that baby, Kira? I don't know, I don't know. Go ahead, you can try, come on. Uh, uh, too little, too little. Okay, baby Kira, don't worry, I'll be right down. I think. <laughs> okay, you're too little for that. Hey, let's go in the mall. Come on, baby Kira, get in your stroller. Good girl. I'm really surprised she didn't go in the pool. I was really afraid she was going to try that. Whoa, look at all those cute outfits. I like the one with the reindeer horns. That'll be perfect for Christmas. Huh. Wow, they've got a lot of cool clothes in here. I'm going to try some stuff on. Okay, baby Kara, be good. I'm going to try on some clothes, okay? Kudos! Oh, look at that little unicorn toddler. She's so cute. What do you think, baby Kira? Uh-uh, uh-uh. Okay, okay. How about this one? Uh-uh, uh-uh. Baby Kara doesn't like anything I'm trying on. How about this one? uh -huh. Okay, you like this one. <gasps> a unicorn! Baby Kira, look! A unicorn! Burr, I'm freezing in this, though. Don't they have any with pants? It's, like, so cold out right now. Let me go see if I can find my pants. Okay, this is pretty cute. Cute, cute. Aw, you're so sweet, baby Kara. Baby Kara, do you want to go to lunch, little girl? Hungry, hungry. Aw, you're so sweet. Okay, let's go to lunch. Dino, Dino. Oh my gosh, I can't believe how late it's gotten. Well, there's a police car over there. I thought I thought it was time for lunch, but it looks like it's actually time for dinner. It's going to be your night-night time soon. No, night, night. Yeah, you have to go night, night. Okay, let's go to the cafe and see what they have. Hi. Oh, you only have like You only have like sweets. I I don't want to feed the baby stuff like that for dinner. Yeah, ice cream. No, we can't have ice cream for dinner. That's not good for you, baby. Your mom would be very mad at me if I just fed you ice cream for dinner. No, I want it. Ew, a bat, a bat. Cute bat, cute bat. Yeah, you're the only person that thinks the bat is cute. I would not think that. Let's go to the Black Sea Diner. See what they have. Uh, nobody's working here. Oh, no. I guess, I guess, well, I guess we'll have some pizza. Come on. Let's sit down and have some pizza. I packed some of that. Pizza good. Pizza is good. Okay, baby Carrie, eat your pizza. Yum, 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 yum. Yum, 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 yum. Yum, 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 yum. Yum, yum, yum. Ah, I'm stuffed. How about you, baby Kira? Full, full. Oh, that's good. Okay, come on. Get in your stroller. It's time for night nights. No, night night. Run away. You will not run away, baby. Baby. Come. Baby Kira. Get. Oh, my gosh. The baby doesn't want to go to bed. And now she's running away. You're going to. Baby Kira. You stay in our yard. Baby Kira. Where did she go? Did she run around the back of the house? Baby Kira! Baby Kira! <laughs> you can't catch me super fast! Baby Kira, do you want a timeout? I mean it, Baby Kira! No timeout! No, no, no! Well then, you have to stay here. Come on. It's 
It's time for your bedtime. No! I know, no little baby likes to go to bed, but you have to. You have to get your rest because you're still growing. Oops, I gotta lock, unlock the house. Now I better lock the front door. We don't want that FBI agent coming back. <laughs> okay, time for night nights. This exercise. Oh my gosh, your house is so big. I can't remember which door it is. Is it this door? <laughs> okay, yep, here we go. In your crib, baby Kira. Night night. Night night. Love you. Oh, I love you too, baby Kira. She's so cute. See you in the morning. Well, actually, your mom will be back before then. Oh, that was a long day of babysitting. But I think I did pretty good, except for the one time that I lost baby Kira. Now I just have to sit here and wait till her mom gets home. Okay, Toy Hero fans, don't forget to subscribe to the Toy Heroes channel where we put out awesome videos just like this one. And give us a big thumbs up if you love baby Kira as much as we do. We'll see you guys next time. Bye! Hey, Toy Hero fans, it's me, Molly. And as you guys probably know, my family just adopted baby Kira. Oh my gosh, she's so adorable. I can't believe I have a new little sister. It's going to be so amazing. Well, hopefully she's not as annoying as Daisy is sometimes. <laughs> Don't worry, I still love my sister Daisy though. So I'm going to show you guys baby Kira's um, nursery right now. Here's my bedroom. And right now I'm in the kitchen, so you can see my bedroom's off the kitchen. Then we have a little dining room. Out here is our backyard. And then over here is the new nursery, guys. OMG! I love that it's bright pink because I think baby Kara is going to love that. And look, she can look out her window and see the swimming pool. Isn't that so awesome? But as you can see, her nursery is completely empty. So we need to add some furniture, a bed for her. Um, and a bunch of toys and stuff. So, I thought you guys would think it was super fun if you came along with me as I decorated Baby Kira's nursery. So, let's get started! Guys, I'm in build mode right now. This is what I have to be in to um, make Baby Kira's nursery. So, I'm thinking that I want to put her bed right between these two windows because I think that'll look really good. I don't think that they have a crib in Blacksburg yet. I wish they would hurry up and get one because, hello, babies live here too. <laughs> okay, let's look for furniture, chairs, beds. There's beds. So, let's see if they have a crib yet. I don't think that they do. It's okay. I mean, I could just put her in one of these cute little canopy beds. That's sort of like a crib. I mean, not totally like a crib, but sort of. Whoa! <laughs> I almost put the bed on top of my head. That would have been so bad. So I'm just going to put it like right here. Because I think it'll look really good. I want to get like farther out so you can see. Okay, like right here. No, I don't need two beds. Just one. Oh no! I went out of build mode. Okay, let's go back into build mode. I always forget, don't click the X. Because if you click that, then it just takes you out of it. Okay, obviously she does not want this boring... Um, comforter. That thing's really boring. And actually, why doesn't her bed go up against the wall? Okay, there. Now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to make her comforter a different color. Um, let's see. Oh, there's all these patterns. That's cute. Okay, does it have like... Whoa! <laughs> that's like really bright. Oh, that's adorable! Oh, they have new patterns too. Now, okay, sort of cute. Whoa, weird, no. Elephants, no. How about brick? a brick blanket? <laughs> just kidding, just kidding, guys. I think baby Kira will probably love this polka dot one best, but I'm still trying to make it the perfect color. There, perfect. Okay, that'll be good. And then her pillow could be... Oh, no, I changed it. No, 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 no. Oh my gosh, it changed it back. No! Don't worry, I can fix it. 
Okay. That looks pretty good. I don't know why it's not letting me change the pillow. Oh, see? This part is a little annoying when you're building. That's okay, though. <laughs> okay, that is perfect. I'm just gonna leave that like that because I don't want to mess it up. Okay. Now I think she's gonna need, like... A little dresser or something because she's got some to put her clothes somewhere right guys so let's go in and see if we can find her a dresser storage Ooh, no that doesn't work this one looks like it would match her furniture really good so I'm just gonna um put it right here like that perfect oh her nursery is gonna be so adorable now she needs some, like, toys and stuff. Where would I find toys? Decorations. She probably needs to have a brightly colored unicorn. Let's turn him around. You don't want him facing the wall. <laughs> okay, she needs that toy. What are the toy guys? She needs toys, right? Oh, look at that little sun. That's cute. Maybe I could put that sun, like, right here. Oh, this nursery is turning out so cute so far. Okay, let's see what else. Um, no. I'm looking for like baby stuff. Oh, this cute little cat is cute. I think she'd love this. Look how adorable it is! Oh, that is so cute. It's a little stuffed animal. And a dancing banana? No, just kidding. No dancing bananas. <laughs> I think that's pretty good for over here. Now what I want to do is put like a desk or something over here. Because, you know, she might want to like play or something at that. So let's see what they have. Um, It would probably be on our tables. And let's see. Oh, this one's nice. That's a bit crazy though for a baby. <laughs> I don't think she needs that, right, guys? I don't know. What do you guys think? What else is there? Well, they just have this, like, huge one, but... Maybe, like, this one? And then make it, like, pink or something? I think so. I think that's pretty cool. For, like, a baby's room, you know? Oh, no. Don't want to sell anything. Just want to change the color! To... No. Ooh, that purple's pretty. That blends in with the wall. <laughs> you can almost not even see it. That looks too bright, I think. Maybe we should make it, like, just, like, white or something. And then make it... No. 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 <laughs> I can't decide, guys. I can't decide. That looks kind of cute. No, no, no. It's so hard to select the colors because it's like so tiny. You know what I mean? When you guys are building in here. Okay, there. Now we need a chair. Go back to decorate. Go to chairs. What kind of chair would she need? This one looks pretty good. Stylish chair. It doesn't want to go into the desk. I don't know why. Okay, there we go. Cute! What should we put on our desk? What would we put? Like, they need to get, like, baby bottles and stuff in here. Ugh, they don't really have, like, a ton of nursery stuff. Well, I don't think she's gonna read math books. She's a baby. <laughs> but we could put, like, a little photo frame on our desk of her new family, which would be us. Like that. Aw, cute. And then, maybe some pizza. Just kidding. She can't have pizza. She can have pizza, but not in her room. Uh, and then, maybe we could put... What else should we put on there, guys? Mm, oh, look at this cute little octopus. She would love that toy. I'm just putting a lot of toys in her room because I know that she'll love that. Because she's a baby, so... <laughs> Those are the types of things that babies like. Toys. Bottles. Cribs. All that kind of stuff. No, nothing else in here. She definitely needs a nightstand, though. Look at this robot. I wonder if she'd like this. <laughs> That's funny. Okay, let's go over here and give her a nightstand. 
Uh, under tables. And then, let's see if we can find a good one. TV stand? No! Do you guys like building your house in Blacksburg? This is one of my favorite parts of Blacksburg is decorating and building my house. It really is. It's like one of my absolute favorite things to do. Okay, here's here's like a nightstand. Perfect. Now I just have to change the color because ugh. I do not like that color at all. Whoa! I accidentally sold it! No! It's okay. There's a back button. Okay, now I have to go back to color. And I'm gonna make it... Um, probably like, like white so it matches. Um, but I need to make it there. Perfect. Just like that. Now, she probably needs a lamp or something. Uh, da -da 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 -da. okay. Let's see. Um, this lamp, this lamp, this lava lamp. <laughs> That's kind of cool, actually. I kind of like the lava lamp. I might have to put that in my room. Okay, I'll put that little lamp there. And her room is looking pretty cute, I think, guys. What else can we put in here? I mean, she's got, like, her bed. She's got a little nightstand. She's got a little desk with um, some toys. A dresser with some toys. Can you guys think of anything else our room would need? Oh, maybe she needs some, like, posters or something. Right? Like, okay, where can we put a poster? Put the sun there. Maybe like a poster back here, but I don't know. It might be, might be too crowded. I'll look though. Okay, decorations. Let's see, where is like the big, big, big painting? Okay, speed sign? No. <laughs> Definitely don't need a speed sign in your room. Framed mirror. Plain huge painting. Whoa. Okay, that is a huge painting. Obviously, I'm going to change what it has on it because she doesn't want a giant, like, thing of mushrooms in her room. That's just weird, but you can't change it in here. You have to change it once you're out of build mode. I also think this balloon is super cute, so I'm going to put that in her room. I'm just going to put it, like, over here. Aww, that's so sweet. Okay, is there anything else in here that we could decorate her room with? Look at more decorations. A plunger! <laughs> plunge, plunge, plunge! Just kidding, guys. <laughs> that was funny, though, wasn't it? A bowl of fruit? No. Stacked towels? No. What else? What else? What else? What else? I wish they had more toys. I mean, they have this flamingo, but... <laughs> Mrs. Flamingo. They have this little dancing banana. I don't know. I think he's kind of cute, but... I don't know. Baby Kira might be like, Ah! What's that? Maybe we should put another poster or, like, a painting over on that wall. Because it looks a little empty over there. It looks like we need to put something over there. Like, I want a medium one. I don't want this big one. That one's too big. Where is the medium ones? I know it must be here somewhere. Toilet paper? No. Medium painting. Here we go. We can put one, like, right... I want it to go in the middle, and it won't, like, go in the middle. Do you hate that when you're building something in here, and it's, like, won't go in the middle? Okay, maybe one there. And one there. Okay. Now, I'm gonna leave build mode. Whoa, it's, like, dark out! <laughs> I worked on this a long time. Okay, now I'm gonna go in my house. And I'm gonna go to baby Kara's room. I'm going to change your posters out because, you know, that doesn't look very good to have that. <laughs> we definitely want a different painting. Let's see if we can change it to something cute. Alright, here are our choices. No, no, no. She loves My Little Pony, so maybe I'll do like a My Little Pony or something. If I can find one. There's a lot of stuff here. Holy moly, there's a ton of stuff here. No, 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 no. Maybe I can type it in, like, unicorn or my little pony or something. <gasps> Look at this. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> That's so cute. Okay, wait. I want to see what my other options are. Unicorn. 
Oh my gosh, these are so cute! Oh my gosh, are you kidding me right now? These are adorable. Baby Kira is going to be so excited when she sees these. Okay, guys, do you see any good, really good ones? I think they're also adorable. But that one's my favorite. Oh, that is so cute. Okay, now we got to go change these posters. Maybe we should just do, like, I don't know, a unicorn theme. What else do we have? Let's see. Um, I would just put, like, baby. What comes up? Oh my gosh, look at this little tiny. Oh, the heart's cute. Oh, this all this stuff is so cute. Oh, look at this little baby. Oh, so adorable. Okay, a baby dinosaur? That's weird. Look at the cat. I like the cat. This is for baby Kara's room though, so I have to make it stuff baby Kara would like. Okay, I'm going back to Unicorn. Because they had a bunch of stuff that I liked. Unicorn. Yeah, like this one is so cute. And then I saw another one that I liked too. And I know baby Kira's gonna love this. This one is adorable. Guys, what do you think of baby Kira's room? Uh-oh, I'm stinking it up. <laughs> I have to go take a bath. Okay, I'm going to give you guys the little tour here of what we built today. This is so adorable. It's all unicorn themed. And I might put something else over here. Like, I think it definitely might need a light because it's kind of dark over there. But I think if this turned out so cute, I think she's going to love it. And I hope you guys enjoyed watching me build it for my new baby sister. Okay, guys, I'll see you in our next video. Bye! Molly, do you think that mom and dad will let us, um, just adopt baby Kira? Yeah, adopt, adopt, doodle, yeah, She's so cute! Um, I have no idea if they're gonna let me, th let us, though. Well, Molly, if they let us, she would be our third sister. Oh, my gosh! Another sister! I can't even believe it. Well, come on, baby Kira. You must be hungry. I'm going to make something delicious for her to eat. Good idea, Marty. If she's homeless, she definitely will want some food or whatever. Okay, how about a grilled cheese? I bet she'd love that. Do you like ba grilled cheese, baby Kira? Uh-huh, good tea, good tea. Yeah, grilled cheeses are delicious, aren't they? I like grilled cheese too, Marty. Could I have one? Daisy, you can make your own grilled cheese. Molly, don't be rude. You're already making one. <laughs> Daisy, what do I look like? Your servant? Well, you're making baby Kira one. Yeah, because she's a baby and she's homeless and she's probably starving. Okay, fine, Molly. Cheese. And make my own toasted cheese. Here you go, baby Kira. Try that toasted cheese. You're going to love it. Mmm, mmm, toast cheese, toast cheese. Molly, why are you calling it a toasted cheese? It's a grilled cheese. No, Dad always calls it toasted cheese. I don't, but Mom always tells him it's not toasted cheese, it's grilled. Well, actually, you could make a grilled cheese in the toaster, so it could be toasted. But you didn't, Molly. You made it on a stove. Okay, grilled cheese. Sorry. Hey, Toyo fans, do you guys call it a grilled cheese or a toasted cheese? Let me know in the comment section below. I think at least one of our Toy Hero fans is going to call it a toasted cheese. Baby Carol, why are you not eating that sandwich? I don't know. You don't know? Do you want a bottle? Uh-huh. Sorry, Baby Carol. We don't have any bottles here because, um, basically, we never had a baby around here for a really long time. Mmm, delicious. Mm. Oh, she ate it. Good job, baby Kira. Good job. Ooh, play, play, play. You want to play? Okay, you can play. Ooh, this is fun. We have a, a third sister and it's so cool. Ka, ka meow, ka meow. Yeah, the cat does meow, baby Kira. 
Girls, I'm home. Are you here? Oh my gosh, Daisy. Um, hide with baby Kira. I'll distract mom. Gotta close my door. Oh my gosh. I don't want her to know baby Kira's here because she might make her leave or something. What are you doing, Molly? Uh, nothing, mom. I was just making a grilled cheese and then cleaning the house. Cleaning the house? Hmm, something sounds really fishy here. <laughs> no, mom. Nothing to see behind me or anything. I don't know if I believe you, Molly. Yeah, mom, come here. I want to show you something. What is it, Molly? I gotta show you something right now. The news, Molly? You don't watch the news. No, no, no. Watch this on the brightly colored unicorn. Come here, Mom. Sit next to me. Hi, Mom. What's up? Nothing to see over here. Why are you girls acting so strangely? Because we're so excited to show you the brightly colored unicorn episode. Right, Daisy? Come on, Daisy. Come sit down. You're super excited. Oh, uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, there's nothing hiding in Molly's bedroom. Girls, you're being really weird. Is there something actually hiding in Molly's bedroom? No! <laughs> no, 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 Mom. Watch this. The brightly colored unicorn. The brightly colored unicorn. <laughs> what was that? Ah, it was Daisy. She's She's got a stomach ache. I don't know if I believe you girls. What is going on? Mom, come back here. No, 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 Mom. Come here. Come here, Mom. Ouch, ouch, my stomach! Molly, what is going on? Nothing. I was just saying my stomach really hurts. Well, come here. Why don't you sit down? Get into bed until you feel better. Mom, just sit with me forever. Molly, I have chores to do. I'm sure your tummy will feel better in a little bit. No, it feels better right now. Ah, uh, but just come over here, Mom. Okay, now I know you girls are hiding something from me. What is going on? Nothing, Mom. I promise. Right, Daisy? I just told you, Papa. I told Papa. Oh my gosh, uh, wh what was that? It was nothing! Don't go in your room. Uh-huh, don't go in my room. Because it sounded like a little baby's voice. <laughs> Mom, you're totally hearing things. Um, Daisy, keep Mom distracted. I have to use the bathroom. Okay, Molly, I'll try my best! Oh my gosh, if my mom finds out about baby Kira... Uh, she might make her leave her, or make her go to, I don't know, the adoption center or something. Oh, good. Mom's, Mom's not, like, yelling or anything, so now I can get a snack. What do I want to have? A yogurt sounds good. Molly, we've got a problem! We've got a problem, Molly! What? Mom's in the bedroom right now. Oh, my gosh! Um, girls? Who is this? I said you have a mommy. Mommy. Uh, no. I don't think that I'm your mommy. Um. She's so my sister, Daisy. Girls, why is she calling you her sister? Uh, because, um, we are going to adopt her? Molly, what on earth are you talking about? Adopt her. Where did this little girl come from? Okay, Mom, but it's a very long story, but she was crying outside our door, and she doesn't have a mom or a dad. Yeah, and she's adorable. Her name is Kira, and, well, we call her baby Kira, but she wants to be adopted by us because she loves us so much. Mom, please, please! Girls, oh my goodness. Are you telling the truth right now? This little baby doesn't have anywhere to live? No, she doesn't. She's homeless. Oh my gosh, that's the saddest thing I've ever heard. And she's super adorable and sweet. You girls really want to have another sister though? You two can't get along as it is. We don't care, Mom. We're going to take care of her and we're going to love her. And sometimes we're going to fight with her because she's our sister. But it doesn't matter. Family is family. You know from Lilo and Stitch when they say Ohana? Oh, I do, Molly. Yeah, nobody gets left behind, Mom. Nobody. Not even baby Kira. She's our family now. Wow, girls, I can't believe it. We're going to have another little girl in our family. Mom, you mean it? You mean it for real? Mom, are you kidding right now? Are you joking with us? No, girls, I'm not joking. But we still have to convince your father. But I think she's adorable, and there won't be much convincing to be done. Yay! Go to the house, house, house. 
That's right, baby Kira. This is your house. Aw, oh, it's so nice to meet you, baby Kira. I'm Toy Hero Laura. Mama, mama. She called you mama. Aw, oh, you can call me mommy or mama. Yeah, I call her mom. But you're a baby, so you probably say mama or mommy or something. Yeah, Oh, it smells like maybe you need a bath. Come with me, baby Kira. Okay, okay. Oh, she says okay. That's so cute. Mom, thanks so much for giving me a new baby sister. You're very welcome. Right this way, baby Kira. Now we're going to have to set up a nursery for you. Oh, that's going to be so much fun. Have a good bath, baby Kira. Yes, I do. I love Roblox about you. <laughs> Baby Carrie singing the I Love Roblox song. That's so sweet. Molly, we got a new baby sister. Yay! I know. I can hardly believe it. Mom said yes. Well, girls, just remember, we still have to convince Dad. Yeah, he he'll, he'll, he loves kids, though, so he'll be like, okay, we have another kid. <laughs> oh, my gosh. This is a cause for celebration. Which means I need to eat some cake. Molly! What? It is a celebration. We just adopted a baby. I'm going to eat this cake. It's going to be delicious. Mmm. Hopefully Dad says yes when he gets home from work. He will, Daisy. He will. Don't you worry. Hey, Toyo fans. Can you believe it? We just adopted a baby! Yay! We've added a new baby to our Roblox family, and we're super excited. Guys, if you think that's awesome, give this video a huge thumbs up. And guys, if you're buying Robux and Roblox, guys, use our star code to support us. It's Toy Heroes! That's right, guys, Toy Heroes. And we'll see you in our next video where we're going to set up Baby Kara's Nursery in Bloxburg. We'll see you next time. Bye! <laughs>
Ooh, look, there's roller coasters in it. I definitely want to play too. Shovel for Marley, I want a turn. When I die, you can have a turn, but until then, nope. Well, that shouldn't take too long. That's it, Daisy. You are so rude about my Roblox playing. I'm totally going to get you for that. No, you're not, Molly, because you are so slow. Daisy, get back here. Ooh, I might do fun things on computer because I'm big going. Ooh, shopping. Ooh, bank. I could get into bank, get money, and go shopping. Baby Kira, where are you? Baby Kira, you're putting a lot on the computer without supervision. I'm big girl, I can't. No, you can't. Oh my gosh. Ah, <sighs> get off the computer, please. I can't do anything. <laughs> okay, that's it. You need a nap. But my Daisy don't have to take a nap. That's because they're big girls. You're not a big girl. I don't like it. <laughs> Okay, into bed, please. You definitely need a nap. Fine. I hate my life. <laughs> oh my gosh, you hate your life and you're only two? Oh, you have a long way to go, baby Kira. I'll see you in a couple of hours. I don't see you ever. Because, because I'm running away forever. Baby Kira, it's been two and a half hours, you sleepyhead. Baby Kira? Where, where's Baby Kira? <gasps> Is that window broken? Oh my god! Baby Kira ran away! Molly, Daisy, I need your help! Mom, if you need my help doing more chores, I'm off duty. Oh, I'm so tired. Just need to watch this adorable puppy and relax. And maybe eat an extra piece of pizza. Mmm pizza molly help 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 what what are you freaking out about mom what's wrong baby kira she 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 she, she ran away what she she ran away yes I, I don't know what to do but i'm gonna call 911 and you and your sister should go look for her okay i'll get right on that as soon as i finish my pizza molly no okay i'll take my pizza to go baby kira baby kira where are you I don't need this. I need to do to jump I'm a big girl. Baby Kira, baby Kira, where are you? Baby Kira. Well, maybe she got a hotel room. Wait a minute, how would she do that? She, she doesn't have any money. <gasps> maybe she stole mom's credit card. I should go in and ask the person behind the desk. Hello? Is anybody here? Apparently, they're sleeping in one of the rooms because they're tired. <laughs> I'll just log in myself and see if she's checked in. Baby Kira. Okay, she didn't check into the motel. Hmm. She's sitting in the diner? <sighs> Good thing I ate that pizza because I'm doing a lot of running around. No, she's not in the diner. Baby Kira, where are you? We miss you so much. Wait a minute, if I was Baby Kira, where would I go? The ice cream shop. Although I think they're closed right now because it's already like 7.30 at night. No, no, baby Kira, but they left the doors open, so I think I need a mint chocolate chip ice cream. Mm. Huh, why is my phone ringing? Hello? <laughs> Molly, are you at the ice cream shop right now? Um, uh, uh, how did you know that, Mom? Because I just had an idea that you'd have to stop for a snack. Your sister is more important than mint chocolate chip, right? Uh, yeah, sure, Mom, totally. I've been looking around for her, though, and I don't see her. Keep looking, Molly. I'm so worried. Yeah, me too. But I'm sure everything's gonna be okay. I hope so. I really hope so. Baby Kira? What? What are you... What are you doing? You put up a tent? Ew, what's that smell? A sandwich I got from the dumpster. Ew, don't eat dumpster sandwiches. What's going on? Baby Kira? Oh my god, we found her. Baby Kira, you have to come home. I'm never gonna come. Back I don't want you. I stay here. Why? We're your family. Don't you love us? You don't love me. Baby Kira, that's not true. We love you more than anything. Why would you say that? Yeah, baby Kira, why would you say that? Because cause you guys are big girls said die, die. Oh, you're not a big girl? No, you're not. But you know what? Daisy and I were little girls like you once. You were? 
Yeah, we were, huh, Daisy? Yeah, we were toddlers and we pooped our pants and all sorts of stuff. <laughs> we didn't have to tell her that detail. You did? You wore diapers? And you were big girls? Of course we weren't big girls. <laughs> you don't just come out this way. I mean, you have to grow. Pretty soon, you'll grow up too. Really? Dad can do big girl stuff? Of course you can, baby Kira. It's only a matter of time before you grow up. Yeah, baby Kira. And then you'll be able to do all the big kid stuff just like us. Wow, Freddy. How long? Um, just a few more years. Then you'll be a big girl. But you should enjoy being a toddler right now because it's pretty amazing to be a baby. You get lots of snuggles from mom. You get bottles. You get someone to change your diaper. Oh. Molly! Seems like I need someone to change my diaper. <laughs> Ew, dinky. <laughs> So will you come home with us? Yeah, I miss you guys. Oh, we missed you too, baby Kira. No more running away. Yeah, no more running away. I big girl someday. That's right, someday you're gonna be a big girl. Hey Gaming with Molly fans, welcome to my new channel. All about me, me, me. <laughs> Guys, I'm so excited because today I'm playing Shark Bite. Baby Kira, what are you doing here? I used to do buy, play, I play. No, baby Kira, this is my channel. It's all about me, me, me. I did to do Okay, okay, you can be on my channel. Oh, I guess I'll invite baby Kira to be in my boat. I can't believe my sister is going to be in this video. Why can't I just have a channel all about me, me, me? <laughs> I just do about me, me, me. No, baby Kira. Gaming with Molly is about me, not you. Me, me, me. Ah! Hi, hi. Gaming with baby Kira. No, baby Kira. Gaming with Molly. Oh, my goodness. All of my sisters want to take away my... My channel's from me. I just want to buy gaming with Baby Kira. Okay, this is gaming with Molly, but it's guest starring Baby Kira today. Okay, is that good enough, Baby Kira? Yeah! Okay, are you driving? Oh my gosh, Baby Kira is driving. I have this giant rocket launcher, so we're looking for the shark, guys. Hopefully we can get the shark and just like capture the shark right off the bat. I only have two launch, like, rocket launcher bullets, though. <laughs> Look at her! Look at her unicorn boat! Whee! This is so cool! Hey, does anybody see the shark anywhere? Okay, it's nighttime here. I don't see the shark anywhere. I think the shark went to sleep. <laughs> here, sharky, 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 shark. Here, sharky, shark. Is it a double by Here, suck, suck, suck. Can't believe I'm letting my little baby sister drive a boat. This seems very dangerous. Shark friend. No, baby Kira, sharks are not friends. Not in this game, anyway. Wait, they're shooting at something. Baby Kira, they're definitely shooting at something. I bet the shark's over there. It's just a dead by shark, shark. Okay, well, hold on. I haven't, I haven't. Oh my gosh, what's going on? Rough water. Shark, shark. How can you see the shark? Oh my gosh, I think I just saw him. Okay, I don't want to shoot my rocket until I actually see the shark. The shark is super sneaky. Hello, shark, where are you? Okay, that's it. I'm going to stand up and get a better view. Baby Kara, slow down. You're going to dump me out of the boat. Okay, thank you. Um, that boat just went flying. I'm gonna guess that the sh Oh my gosh, that guy needs our help. Go over there. Go over there, we need our help. No, no, the other way. Where are you going, baby Kira? I just said, oh, Papa, helping, helping. Oh, okay, there's guys over here. Come on, guys. Get on my boat. You're gonna be fine. Nobody panic. Wolfman, do you wanna get on my boat? Come on. I think he wants to stay there. You wanna come on here? He doesn't know what he wants to do. <laughs> okay, well, I'm leaving you. Bye. Okay, everybody's on the unicorn boat. I hope I hope nobody ate too much for lunch and you're going to sink the boat because you're chubby. <laughs> oh, 
Okay, he's still shooting. I have not shot any of my rocket launcher bullets because literally I do not see a shark anywhere. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Baby Carrie, you just dumped me in the water! Oh my gosh. Now I'm... Okay, she's back. It is a dope of Molly. Sit down. Okay, I'm sitting down. Let's go! This shark is nowhere to be found. This is a boy shark friend. No, no, shark is not friend. Shark will try to eat us. Where is the shark? Okay, I definitely have to stand up again. Baby Kara, you just... Oh, my gosh. I'm in the water. Okay, I better take out my rubber ducky. Okay. Okay, I'm good. I'm good. I just up 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 Molly, Molly. <laughs> Baby Kara, get out of the boat. What are you doing? Oh, my gosh. That guy just stole our boat. I just up up I just up I stole boat. Oh, my God. Come back here with our boat. Oh, my gosh. Now we're like sitting ducks in the water. There's a shark. Oh, my gosh. Okay, I have to reload. Reloading. Uh, baby Kara, he's definitely coming towards us. Uh, he looks angry. Swimming. Swimming fast. Swimming really fast. Oh, my gosh. I'm totally going to get eaten by the shark. Baby Kara, run. I just said bye bye, bye, shark friend. No, the shark is not your friend, baby Kara. Not even a little bit. Wait, where'd he go? He's over there destroying a boat. He knows I have a rocket launcher, so he's like afraid of me, I think. Does anybody see the shark anywhere? If he tries to bite my leg, let me know, okay? And you guys can do me a huge favor by subscribing to my new channel, Gaming with Molly. Oh, yeah, guys. Oh, time's up. I think we won. I think we won because we're still alive. The shark has been killed! Yeah! I I feel like I feel like my rocket launcher did a little something there. Hooray! Yeah, baby Kara, hooray! I just hope up my shark not friend. Yeah, I told you! Shark is definitely not your friend. I love Roblox, yes I do. I love Roblox, how about you? Do 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 Whoa! Close up of my face! Close up of my face. <laughs> I love Roblox. Yes, I do. I love Roblox. How about you? If you love Roblox, slam that like button. Come on, guys. Give this video a huge thumbs up. Oh, oh. I shark. What? You're the shark? Are you serious right now? I told you it was a shark. Oh, my gosh. Baby Kara is the shark, guys. Okay, I picked a good boat, I think. My sister's gonna try to come after me. I just know it. <laughs> shark, not friend. Okay, no, I changed my mind. Shark is my friend, baby Kara. Shark is my friend. No, no, you say shark, not your friend. No, the shark's my friend. Ugh, mean shark. Oh my gosh. My sister has decided that she is going to be mean because she's a shark and I'm probably gonna get eaten. Dad and dad and put it away and double boy dad and dad and Okay, I have to admit, baby Kara is the cutest shark ever. Did you guys just hear her come out of the water? She's so adorable. Okay. Hopefully she doesn't chomp on me first. I don't know if I can shoot my rocket launcher from in here. I hope I can. Not really sure. Oh my gosh, she's after me already. Okay, this is this is not good. Oh no, she went over there. Oh, she doesn't know where I am. I mean, who would not know? Look at this giant siren on the top. Oh, there she is. Okay, guys, here she comes. Sorry to do this, but I have to shoot you with the rocket launcher. Shark, not your friend. I know, shark's not my friend. Where is she? Guys, do you see the shark anywhere? Baby Kira shark. I don't know where she is. Maybe it's her nap time or she needed a baba. <laughs> oh my gosh. I just, I feel like, I don't know. I'm, I'm going to get out of my boat. Like, I'm going to go back here. With my, I gotta, I gotta put my giant rocket launcher away because, literally, I do not 
want to get stuck in my boat. If she's coming. Okay, I'm going to jump up here on top of the roof of my boat. Hey, no! I don't want to sit down! My boat keeps moving. Okay, here. Now I feel, I feel extra safe now. Because I'm like on the very top of the boat. Now I just have to wait for baby Kira to come and shoot her with my rocket launcher. I hear her, guys. I hear baby shark. <laughs> baby shark. Baby shark. Baby shark. Baby shark. <laughs> baby Kira Shark do 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 baby Kira Shark do 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 Where is she? This isn't even cool right now. Cause you just like disappeared. Look, this guy's hiding next to me. I'm just gonna get on his boat. Let's go. Hey! Oh my gosh! As soon as I jumped on his boat, he like oh, that was so rude. Okay, now I need my floaty. I'm stuck under my boat, guys. Oh my gosh. Stuck under my boat. While I'm down here, let's see if we can see the shark anywhere. At first I thought that was a shark, and then I realized, nope, that's just my boat. <laughs> How rude of you! I was trying to help you out. Oh, I see the shark over there. Okay, I'm gonna shoot my rocket launcher at her, guys. Here I go. I don't think I hit her though. Oh my gosh, here she comes! Oh, okay, reloading, reloading. Uh, but not good, not good. Oh! oh! One shot from from baby shark Kira, and I totally died. Oh, baby Kira! Did you put that baby Kira shark? Not your friend. Yeah, you can say that again, guys. Isn't it crazy that baby Kira was a shark? Baby Kira Shark, do 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 do. <gasps> she is so good. Oh my gosh, she killed everybody. Baby Kira Shark. Oh my gosh. <laughs> hey, Toy Hero fans. Make sure you subscribe to our new channel. That's my channel, Gaming with Molly. Guys, this channel is going to be so much fun because it's all about me. 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 <laughs> all right, guys. I love you so much. You're the best fans in the world. I'll see you in my next video. Bye. Oh, finally, we're home with our new baby. I know, Kira is so sweet and adorable. The girls are just going to love her. Yeah, unfortunately, due to the virus, they couldn't even come to the hospital and meet their baby sister. Well, they get to meet her now. Okay, well, let's get going. Um, Dan? How am I supposed to go upstairs with a wheelchair? Oh, man, I didn't think about that. Oh, no, what are we going to do? Um, I'm okay, Dan. I can walk up the stairs. Are you sure? You just had a baby! Yeah, I'll be fine. Be very careful, Laura. You need to rest. Dan, I'm totally fine. You're such a worrywart. Daisy, here they come with baby Kira! I know, she's gonna be so adorable. I can't wait to meet her in person. A new sister! And maybe a better behaved one. Probably not. <laughs> not if she takes after me, that is. Hi, girls! I'm home! OMG! She's adorable, Mom! Meet your sister, Baby Kira. Isn't she the sweetest? She's got to be the sweetest kid I've ever seen. Well, besides me, right? No, I mean, she's probably the sweetest. Look at how cute her little face is. Yeah, but not cuter than mine, right, Dad? Oh, it is pretty cute. <laughs> yeah, she's adorable. Okay, girls, um... Could you go get your mom and I something to drink? We're very thirsty after all our time at the hospital. Sure, no problem. Come on, Daisy. We've got to get mom and dad something to drink. Oh, I love her. She's so adorable. Yeah, she really is. Mom would definitely like a Gatorade. Dad would probably like a Coca-Cola. Here you go, Mom. Oh, thank you so much. Okay, Molly. I'm going to try to put the baby to bed now. Okay, um, but... To bed? Like, already? It, it's not even bedtime. Well, I mean, she takes a lot of naps. And she's so cute when she sleeps. We love her so much. Okay, uh, well, I'm gonna go do my homework. 
Okay, have fun! Daisy, you don't think that mom and dad think the baby is cuter than me, do you? No, of course not, Molly. But the baby is adorable, but not cuter than me. Molly, just do your homework. Why do you think about such crazy things? I don't know. I'm just... I, I don't want mom and dad to forget about me. Of course they won't, Molly. Why would they ever forget about you? You're the biggest troublemaker ever. <laughs> you always have their attention. Yeah, I guess so. Daisy, how do you do homework every single day? That took forever. My brain feels scrambled. Molly, you start to get used to it after a while. Maybe. But boy, am I glad it's over. Oh, my sweet little baby girl. Oh, you're so cute. They're still sitting there with that baby? Molly, shh. Mom is sleeping, and so is a baby Kira for the first time in like three days. Well, I obviously can't be louder than Mom snoring in the baby's ear. Molly, I told you. Shh. But, Dad, I want to tell you, I, I actually did my homework. Well, that's nice, but now go away before you wake up the baby. But, Dad, I, I wasn't a naughty daughter. I I actually did my schoolwork. Well, that's great, Molly, but right now you're going to wake up your mom and the baby, and then you'll be naughty again. Okay, fine. I'm just going to go make a snack. Maybe then Mom will wake up and I can tell her all about how I did my homework. Glug, 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 glug. Mm, I am so thirsty. Glug, 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 glug. The baby's awake. I better make her a bottle. Hey, what happened to all the milk? Molly, did you drink all the milk? Um, uh, I was thirsty. Molly, that milk was for the baby. Ugh! Now I have to go all the way to the store. Um, but I thought the milk was for us, too. But, but that milk was especially for the baby. You guys could have had, um, I don't know, some water or Gatorade or something. Oh, man, now I've got to go all the way back to the store. I'm sorry, Dad, I didn't mean it. I thought I was allowed to drink milk because I was as important as the baby. The baby needs everything from us right now, and we have to be willing to give it to her. Oh, Molly, just... Oh, just try not to eat the baby's stuff. Okay, sorry. Mom, are you awake yet? Well, I am now. Ugh, what is it, Molly? Oh, I'm so tired. The baby's not sleeping at night. But she is adorable, aren't you, sweet little thing? Mom, I did all my homework, and I thought you guys would be proud of me. Ugh. I am, Molly, but right now I need to concentrate on baby Kira and try not to drink all the milk again. I need your dad here to help me, and he keeps having to run to the store. Last time we ran out of diapers. This baby sure does poop a lot. Yeah, I know. She smells super stinky, too. Oh, well, she can't help but she's just a baby. She's so sweet and cute. I'm cute, Mom. I'm cute, too. Oh, look at you, baby Kira. So sweet. Mom, I'm right here. I'm right here. Molly, stop jumping around. You're going to wake up the baby. I'm back and I have the milk. Okay, please tell me no more runs to the store. Molly, why don't you go over there and, and try to be quiet? I'm going to put the baby back to sleep. Yeah, okay. I guess I'm just invisible. I'll go over here. You know, it's not like I'm the first daughter you ever had or anything. But no, baby Kira is most important. Hey, Molly, what are you doing? Uh, nothing. Uh, I'll meet you downstairs in a few minutes. Okay, Molly. Finally, she's gone. All right, now I just pack a bag. I'm running away. They don't even love me here anymore. All they care about is baby Kira, baby Kira, baby Kira. Maybe I'll go somewhere where they actually love me and they care about me and they want to listen to me. Not here where everything's about the baby, baby, baby. I want to have parents that love me. I guess I've got to find new ones. Ma Molly? I was waiting for you downstairs. I thought we could get in the hot tub. What are you doing with your bag? Are you going to Hawaii without me? No, I can't afford to go to Hawaii. Although that does sound pretty nice. I'm, I'm running away. What? You're running away? Are you crazy? You can't run away. You have no money. You have no house. You're not even a grown-up. Well, I know, but why stay somewhere where nobody loves me? 
I love you in my own way. I mean, you are an annoying sister, but you're my sister. I know, I care about you too, Daisy, but Mom and Dad don't love me anymore. What? That's ridiculous. Of course they do. No, all they care about is baby Kira. Baby Kira, baby Kira, baby Kira. She's so cute. She's so sweet. Even when she poops, she's adorable. Ew, that's gross. Yeah, but trust me, they think she's cute no matter what. Molly, I think maybe you have this all wrong. I think maybe you should talk to mom and dad about how you're feeling. Why? They won't even listen. Well, if they don't listen this time, you could run away. But at least give them one more chance. Okay, fine. Mom? Oh, Molly, shh. The baby's about to fall asleep. I know! Everything has to do with the baby! Molly, what has gotten into you? Huh, what? What's happening? <laughs> Mom, why is Dad sleeping on the floor? He's exhausted, Molly. The baby's been keeping us up all hours of the night. We're both so tired. Oh, well, you probably don't care about me then. What? Don't care about you? Are you... Are you crazy? Of course I care about you. What is going on, Molly? Mom, I, I think the only one you care about is baby Kira. Oh, I was afraid this would happen. What? You'd stop loving me and only love baby Kira? No, Molly, that you might think that. See, she even has to talk over me. Molly, she's a baby. She doesn't know any better. And... The nature of babies is that they're very needy. They need everything. And they can't make themselves a peanut butter and jelly sandwich. And they can't change their own poopy diapers. And they want to be snuggled and loved and wake you up in the middle of the night and not let you get any sleep. Wow, Mom, you sound a little stressed out. No, no, I'm very happy. I have another baby. <laughs> but they're very, very needy. It doesn't mean that I don't love you, Molly. It just means I have to take care of this always wanting to eat, always pooping, always awake in the middle of the night baby. Oh, wow. Never thought about it that way. Sounds like you and Dad have a lot on your hands. We sure do, Molly. But you know what? You're very important. Yeah, you're very important. <laughs> Don't worry about your father. He's just exhausted. Anyway, what if we go on a girl's date? Just you and me. And we can get ice cream. You mean without the baby? Absolutely. And whenever you're feeling sad, you can come and talk to me, honey. And we'll spend some time together. It won't be like this forever. Baby Kira will eventually grow up just like you and Daisy. And then she can make her own peanut butter and jelly sandwiches? Exactly. Mom, can we go for ice cream like right now? Mm, well, let's see if your dad will wake up and watch the baby. Dan! Huh? What? Wait, wait, what's going on? Is the baby okay? Yeah, Dan, will you just watch the baby for like an hour? I'm going to take Molly and Daisy if you want. Yeah, she can come, I guess, to get some ice cream. Yeah, sure. <sighs> I want ice cream. Well, you can take them next time. You can have a daddy-daughter date. Okay, sounds fair. I'm your cute little girl. <laughs> I know, I am a cute little girl. Uh, Molly, I met your sister, baby Kira. Oh! <laughs> but of course, you are my cute little girl too. Now go have fun eating ice cream with mom. Okay. So girls, how's your ice cream? Mmm, my chocolate's delicious. Mine's delicious too. Mm. Thanks for taking us for ice cream, mom. Yeah, mom, thanks. So, um, what do you think about being big sisters? Do you love baby Kira? Well, she is an attention hog. She needs every bit of our parents' attention. But I do love her. Aww. She is pretty adorable. Even when she stinks like poo-poo. <laughs> I have to agree. But I like that you and Dad are still going to spend time with us because we miss you guys. Oh, I miss you girls too. And baby Kira is a part of our family now. And just like when you were babies and I had to take care of you, now I have to take care of her. But it won't be like this forever. Well, as long as you keep bringing us for ice cream, everything's okay with me. <laughs> okay, I'm going to just send a message to Luke and see if he wants to come over and play. Hey, Luke, it's me, Molly. Are you there? Hey, Molly. Let's video chat. Okay, um... 
Yeah, so I was wondering, do you want to come over and hang out with me and Daisy today? Sure, I'd love to. Um, what do you want to do? Do you want to go swimming or something? Yeah, that would be super fun if it's not too cold out now. I don't think it's cold out. It's it's still pretty hot outside. Okay, cool. Yeah, when do you want to come over? Mm, say, like, I don't know, a few minutes. Sounds good. See you then. Bye, Luke. Bye, Molly. Cool! My friend is coming over today. Did you hear that, brightly colored unicorn? My friend Luke is coming over today. It's gonna be so much fun. Why can I not pick up my unicorn? Unicorn, I want to play with you! Stop it! Okay, there we go. Sparkles, you are being so stubborn. <laughs> Good thing you didn't eat my homework today. Or I'd get detention. Then Luke couldn't come over. That would be awful! Do, 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 do. Molly, what are you so happy about? What? Can a girl just be happy? Huh? 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 Not if it's you, Molly. You've always got something to be grumpy about. Me? No, I don't. I'm not grumpy at all. I'm having a great day. I know. That's why I think it just can't be you, Molly. Hey, I'm not grumpy every day. Every day you have to do homework, you all. What are you reading, Daisy? I'm reading the Harry Potter series. Again, Daisy, that's all you ever read. Can't you pick a new book? No, I like this series a whole lot. Yeah, it is pretty good. Now you couldn't tell me why you're so happy, Molly? Okay, I'll tell you. Maybe, if you pay me $10. Molly, I'm not paying you my allowance to tell me why you're happy. Never mind, I don't care why you're happy. Hmm, what's that delicious smell? Never mind what it is, Daisy. Ooh, are you baking something delicious? Yeah, but it's not for you, it's for Luke. Luke? What? You're making him something to eat? Why? Because, Daisy, um, I, 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 well, uh, Molly, tell me right now what's going on. Okay, Daisy, I'll tell you. You're gonna get super happy, I'm sure. What, what is it? Ooh, those smell delicious. Luke is coming over to play. What? He is? Oh, boy. Luke's coming. Yeah, yeah, Daisy. Oh, you have a crush on him, I know. No, I don't, Molly. I don't have a crush on Luke. Stop it. Take that back. Yes, you do, Daisy. Seriously, yes, you do. No, I don't, Molly. Daisy, come back here. Yes, you do. Hello? Is anybody home? Hey, um, sorry. I can't play right now, uh, but... Maybe later, okay? Because my mom said I could only have one friend over. Oh, really? Yeah, but don't worry. Um, Later, maybe we can go to the park when she gets home. But I'm only allowed to have one friend when she's not here. Okay, Molly. Well, have a good day. I'll see you later at the park. Sounds awesome. Bye! Knock, knock, Daisy. Coming in. Molly, get out of my room! Where are you? Daisy? I'm in here, Molly, changing my outfit. Why, Daisy? Is it because Luke's coming over? No, Molly, that's not why. <laughs> that's exactly why. <laughs> Molly, what's that sound? Molly, are you on my computer? Uh, no. Nope, nope, nope. Not on your computer. Molly, what's that sound then? Nothing. I'm out in the living room. Oh, okay, Molly. It sounded like you were on my computer. Me? On your computer? Never! The Brightly Colored Unicorn, the Brightly Colored Unicorn. Do, 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 Wow! The bro this episode of the Brightly Colored Unicorn has got nine, like, billion, nine hundred, five hundred and ninety-seven million, three hundred and seventy-eight thousand hits. Wow. Now I see why everybody loves the Brightly Colored Unicorn, because it's amazing. They have so many fans. Molly! Are you on my computer for real? Molly, you are on my computer. Get out of here. What are you worried? I'm going to read your diary? Find out that you're in love with Luke? I'm not in love with Luke. Why are you wearing that fancy outfit, Daisy? Oh, this whole thing, this isn't fancy. Yeah, it is. First comes love, then comes marriage. Daisy loves Luke. Daisy loves Luke. Where is Luke? Yeah, where is he, Molly? He must be here soon. Yeah, wouldn't you love that, Daisy? Molly, stop saying that. 
Dizzy, I don't even know where you are right now. <laughs> You're missing. Oh, where, oh, where is Luke? Molly, you're waiting at the door for me. You must be super excited about me coming over to your house to play. Yeah, I was seriously excited. Not as excited as Daisy, though. What do you mean? Molly! Uh, nothing. I don't mean anything. Hey, you want a blueberry muffin? Oh, wow. Did you make these for me? I sure did. They're delicious. I haven't had one yet. Oh, so you used me as the taste tester. What if they tasted bad? <laughs> exactly. Then you would have tasted a bad muffin and I wouldn't have. Oh, Molly. Hmm. <laughs> These are pretty good. Hmm. Yummy. I've got to wash my hands, though. They were kind of sticky and crumbly. Yeah, yeah. Well, I'm still learning how to make muffins. Hi, Luke. It's me, Daisy. Daisy, Luke knows who you are. Oh, <laughs> uh, uh, yeah, it's me, Daisy. Hey, Daisy, how are you? I like your outfit. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, brother. I can tell this is not going to be a fun day to play outside. Why is that, Marley? Because, Daisy, you're acting all crazy. I am not, Marley. I'm acting totally dumb. <laughs> Why are you randomly laughing, then? Oh, yeah, that's right. You have a crop. Marley, don't say anything. Just say another word. What are you guys talking about right now? She's not talking about anything. <laughs> I, I'm glad you like my new outfit. Yeah, it's pretty cool. I like your outfit too. Baby Kira, baby Kira. Okay, where's baby Kira? She went past you, Molly. Ooh, my face. Baby Kira, I'd like you to meet my friend. I don't think you've ever met him before. Baby Kira, don't eat all the muffins. Oh, it's okay. <laughs> Hi. I said, Okay, I think she likes you. Her her name is Baby Kira, and this is my good friend Luke. Oh, no, don't tell me. Not another sister. What? What's going on? Nothing, Luke. Come on, let's go outside. Oh, both of my sisters are so annoying with their crushes on Luke. Luke, we got a trampoline. It's super fun. Boing, boing, boing. Whoa, you got a trampoline? That's amazing. Yeah. Yeah. We had to do a lot of chores for it. <laughs> well, I guess it's not bad you had to work for it. Yeah, if you don't mind working but me, I'd rather just hang out and eat a cupcake. <laughs> Molly. I should talk over by Luke. Ooh. Baby Kira, are you just going to follow us around all day? No, no, Molly. Oh, my gosh. My sister is telling me what to do now. Okay, whatever, baby Kira. Whoa, this is so much fun. I can see the whole neighborhood from up here. Yeah, you can see Pizza Planet, my favorite restaurant ever, besides McDonald's. I love Pizza Planet. I did not know about that day. Baby Kira, you cannot go on a play date with Luke. <laughs> oh, Molly, you made baby Kira cry. It's okay, baby Kira, don't cry. Oh, no, this isn't going to be good. Yeah, I know you like Luke, baby Kira. Come on, baby Kira. Why don't you go inside with Daisy? That's where all the kids hang out who have crushes on Luke. What? Who has a crush on me? Oh, don't tell me it's Sarah from school. No, it's my baby sister. Oh, that's so cute. My sister's first crush is on my friend Luke. Ugh. Aw, she's so cute. Cute little baby. Baby Kira, come on. It's time for your bottle. Say bye-bye to Luke. Bye-bye, love you. Oh, she said she loved you. Bye-bye, baby Kira. Nice to meet you. Hi. Okay, baby Kira, come on. You can play in your room and drink your bottle. 
Don't keep following me and look around. Hi, yeah, yeah, guys. Can you believe it? Both of my sisters have a f crush on my friend Luke. Ah, oh, this is getting crazier and crazier. <laughs>
I'm standing on the table. I'm coming over there to sit next to you guys. No, you can't sit here. You're too big. What? No, I want to sit with you guys. What's taking our food so long? Hey, what are you doing up there? Oh, sorry. I forgot to put in your order because I got busy watching Coco Melon. You ever see this Halloween special? Hey, it's not even Halloween. Oh, my gosh. This baby waitress is annoying. Where are all the grown-ups? There weren't any, Molly. We're all babies. Oh, my stomach's really starting to growl. I'm going to start getting hangry. Ah. Here you go. Order's up. What? A bottle? Wait, why are we getting... Oh, fine. I guess I'll just drink this bottle. Sorry, the cook is a baby and he doesn't know how to make the kids meals. It's all right. I'm a baby, so I like baby bottles. Blech. Ew, Molly, gross. Yeah, Molly, see, excuse me. Nah, I'm a baby. I don't have to. That bottle was good, but I'm still hungry. Well, we could go to the grocery store and we could get um some food there. Oh, that's exactly what a parent would do. All right, let's go. We can get some. We can get some. Um, we can get some candy. We can get some popcorn. That doesn't sound very healthy, Molly. Of course it doesn't. We're babies. We want to eat anything we want. And a cheeseburger. And Molly, the grocery store doesn't have a made cheeseburger. Okay, well, they might. They might. I want to get in the car, Molly. Me too. I want to ride in the car too. Na, 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 na. Um, apparently we can't ride in the car because, hey, I wanted to ride in the car. Oh, you're too fat. I can't push you. I am fat, I'm just tiny baby, and you are too, and that's why you can't push me. Because you're not strong enough. Okay, fine, whatever. Just get out of the cart so I can put Doritos in there. Okay, I'll put Doritos in the cart. Okay, is, it's not letting me put Doritos in the cart. All right, I'll just, I'll put them in my hands. That, that'll that that'll work. Okay, I got some Doritos. You guys get, you guys get some soda and Daisy. You, you get, um, you get a candy bar. Boy, she's a boss, baby, if I ever saw one. Come on, guys. I'm hungry. I want to check out. Wait, there's there's no cashier. Yeah, there's a cashier. I'm just down here. What? A baby cashier? And it's a boy. What? It's a boy? <laughs> it's a boy. Um, you, you have to have money to buy that. Money? Is that how our parents get all this cool stuff? Glug, 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 glug. I don't know. I'm just drinking this Coca-Cola. I didn't know I had to pay for it. Oh, my gosh. I'm going to call the police. You're going to end up in jail. Okay, here you go. Here's your Doritos back. It's okay. We'll go get some money. We just got to go to the bank. All right, let's go to the bank, guys. Guys, come on. Daisy, don't steal the candy bar. What are you doing? I'll pay for it when we get back. No, leave it here. We're going to get arrested. And then we'll be in baby jail. I've heard horrible stories about baby jail. They don't even come in to change our diaper. Um, guys, what are we waiting for? We're not allowed to cross the street without a grown-up to hold our hands. Yeah, everybody knows that. That is so wrong when you're a baby to cross the street without your parents. You could get hit by a car. I don't see a car anywhere, guys. Well, we still can't cross the street without a grown-up. Then we're just going to be standing here forever. I nominate Molly to be the grown-up. Okay, Molly, you look both ways. No cars. Okay, we can go. Excuse me, cash machine. I would like to get some cash. Uh, Molly, I don't think that's how it works. I think you have to have, like, this card thing. Card thing? Well, I don't have one of those. I thought it was just, like, it could just, like, hear what we wanted and give us money. Molly, did you ever really pay attention when Mom came to the ATM? Not really, but... Where are we going to get one of these cards? We're not, Molly. Just face it. We're terrible as babies. Oh, baby Kira was right. Being a baby is harder than I thought. And squishier. What do you mean, squishier, Molly? What do you mean by that? Yeah, Molly, did you step in some slime or bubble gum on the way over here? No! I made a doo-doo in my diaper and it's super squishy! Ew, gross, Molly! Is that what that smell is? It smells like cow poo. Ew, Molly. Somebody changed my diaper. That me, I'm mad of you. Me too. Gross. Ooh. Hey, I thought you were my best friend. Well, you're my sister.
sister, you're gonna help me, right? Absolutely not! Goodbye, squishy butt! <laughs>
for our first day of high school. Okay, well, I'm just making sure that I have all of my homework done. Homework? Daisy, today's the first day. I know, but I have a feeling they're going to assign us this and... Daisy, quit being cray-cray. Come on, let's go. Girls, I can't believe it's your first day of high school. But baby Kira is still so tiny, like a little baby. She should be so much bigger now. Mom, I wouldn't worry about it. Maybe she just grows really slow. Well, I'm going to take her to the hospital today and have the doctor check her out. Well, um, we'll see you after school. Have a good first day, girls. I love you. We love you too, Mom. Come on, let's go. We don't want to be late. I know, high school. This is such an epic day. Let's see who I have on the schedule today. Oh, Laura's coming in with baby Kira. I haven't seen them in quite some time. I wonder what their concern is. Well, good morning, Laura, and hi. Whoa, baby Kira, you haven't grown since the day while I delivered you. That's why we're here, Dr. Smith. I don't know what's wrong with my baby. She's just not growing, and, and I thought if I just gave it some time, she'd be okay, but look at her. She's still a baby. All right, well, let me do some um, testing here. I'm going to have to take some blood. Oh boy, she won't like a needle. Well, baby Kira, I promise it's just a little pinch. Here we go. Oh, I'm so sorry, honey. It's okay though. Um, see, the needle's all gone. Okay, Laura, um, I'm gonna go run the test now. All right, thank you, Dr. Smith. Oh boy, this isn't good. This isn't good at all. Oh, it's as I thought. I really don't wanna give her this news, but well, it's my job as a doctor. Dr. Smith, you're back. Did you get the test results back already? I sure did. Laura, I, I, uh... Just spit it out, doctor. What's wrong with my baby? Baby Kira has forever baby syndrome. Say what? That's a real syndrome? It sure is. It looks like your baby is going to be a baby, well, forever. Is there a cure? Dr. Smith, say there's a cure. There's no known cure at this time, although scientists have been working around the clock to find a way to help these babies. Our baby forever! Yay! No! You'll, you'll never experience life as a grown-up. Well, think about it, Laura. That might not be so bad. I mean, life as a grown-up can be stressful, and it's not as fun, let's face it. Yeah, you're right, but who will take care of baby Kira when I get old? I don't know, Laura. I don't know. Daisy, I can't believe it. You're, you're, you're a scientist, just like you always thought you would be. And you're a famous star, just like we always knew you would be. Well, <laughs> yeah, I mean, yeah, I'm totally famous. I know, Molly, I know. Mom's going to be so excited when I tell her that I've come up with a, a medication for um, forever baby syndrome. Baby Kira can finally grow up and have her own life. Yeah, let's go tell her. She's going to be so excited. I haven't seen Mom in like 10 years. I guess famous, being famous just made me really busy. Mom? Girls, I can't believe it. You came home for a visit, finally. Whoa, Mom, you look a lot different than you do on FaceTime. Yeah, you look a lot older. Oh, I guess that's a compliment. Uh, sorry, Mom. <laughs> you look beautiful, though. Thank you, girls. I have a brother to hide this dude, hide this dude. Well, I see baby Kira's still a baby. Yes, they said for her entire hundred-year life or so, she'd be a baby. That forever baby syndrome is just, well taken her adult life from her. Well, not anymore. Mom, you know I'm a scientist now, and I've made it my mission to find a cure for forever baby syndrome. And did you? Lord knows I'm not gonna live forever. I sure did, Mom. All I have to do is go mix it in some juice. Oh my gosh, I can't believe it, baby Kira. You're gonna be a grown-up. No, I can't be grown-up, no! Oh, Daisy, dear, could you please get me a glass of juice? I'm thirsty. Sure, Mom, I'll grab the other thing of juice. Here you go, Mom. Some delicious juice for you. Oh, thank you, dear. That's so nice of you. Hmm, that's, well, tastes a little funny, but it's okay, I guess. Sorry, Mom. 
I just got you the juice that you had in the refrigerator. <laughs> Maybe next time you should buy like a different brand or something if it tastes weird. Wait, what? You, you gave her the wrong juice, Molly! That has the medication in it to cure baby Kayla! Say what? Well, um, it, it, wait, if it makes mom older, then she'll die! She can't get any older than she already is. No, Molly, it has the exact opposite effect on old people. It makes them turn into babies. What? Well, you surely must have another one for baby Kira, right? No, I only had enough for baby Kira. It was very expensive to make. A million dollars, actually. Molly, how could you mess this up? Hey, I'm not a scientist. I'm just famous. I mean, I do cute things like this. you making a TikTok video right now. Oh, I feel very strange. Mom, are you okay? Mom? Oh, I'm shrinking. Whoa, look at Mom's wrinkles. They're disappearing. And her gray hair, too. O-M-G. Mom, say something. I adore to take care of. Well, until you come up with a million dollars to make more potion. Ay, ay, ay. Marley, can you believe it? Today's the plum. I know, I'm so excited. Do you think what I'm wearing is okay? Uh, no, Molly. The problem is, like, when you dress up, you have to actually wear, like, a dress or, or a suit or something like that. What? I don't have any of that. No problem, Molly. Just step into my closet. I totally do. Oh, man. Are you going to try to dress me up? Of course I am, Molly. This is going to be so much fun. Okay, um, how about this? Molly, no, it's not Halloween. How about this? Molly, that's the circus. Are you kidding me right now? How about this? Molly, you a ladybug? Seriously? I like this. I think it's really adorable. This would be perfect for prom. Uh, no. Not even close, Molly. Not even close. Try again. Ugh, oh, I'm going to be here all night. I'm going to miss the prom. No, you're not, Molly. Just, you got to look something more like princessy and glam. Okay, princessy and glam. How about this? Now we're getting somewhere, Molly. How about this one? Uh, no. I think that you um should maybe wear this one. <laughs> that looks like a gymnastic outfit. How about this one? Uh, no, that's not really my style. How about this one? Uh, the one with bunnies? Ah, uh, no. No, I'm not wearing that. But I don't know, I guess you're just gonna miss prom then. No, I'm not. I'm gonna wear this one. Wow, you look like a royal princess, Molly. Are you gonna do your hair too? What's wrong with my hair? Well, nothing's wrong with it, but you could do it like this. Holy guacamole. I don't think so, Daisy. Oh my gosh, that's crazy. Take my hair out of this way. I don't like it. Okay, Molly, you could go back to something else. How about this one? No, that's not really your style. Oh, getting ready for the prom takes forever. Well, you just have to keep looking because you want to look your best. Okay, how about this one? Oh, Marty, that definitely looks like you. Oh, my gosh. Daisy, you look gorgeous. So do you, Marty. Totally beautiful. Even your pigtails look beautiful. What's baby Kira talking about? I think she's saying that she's going to the prom. So with baby killer, it's only for um teenagers, and you're not a teenager. Yeah, I'm sorry about that, baby Kira. <laughs> well, you know, if there's a prince charming who asked you to go to the prom, then you could probably go. Molly, that's not true. You could go by yourself if you want to. Okay, yeah, but I'm trying to tell her that so she doesn't feel so bad. Ooh, <laughs> Uh, translation, Daisy? I have no idea what she's talking about right now. Hmm, I need a snack before I go to prom. I'm going to be doing a lot of dancing, so I have to be really fueled up. 
Marty, come look at this. It's so adorable. What? Luke came over and he's talking to baby Kira. It's so cute. What? He's asking her prom? Okay, that's adorable. You guys are such cute babies. But the thing is, is you're too little to go to prom. She said that you said if um, she had someone ask her to the prom, she could go. Um, okay, yeah, but nobody asked you, right? Luke asked. Luke asked you? Um, no, uh, no, you must be mistaken. You guys are babies. prom. Oh, my gosh. That's adorable. They asked each other to go to the baby prom. Oh, that is super cute. But sorry, guys. The prom is for teenagers. Uh, you can't go. Um, but you're going to have so much fun here with your babysitter. <laughs> sorry, baby Kira. Sorry, Luke. We'll see you guys in a little bit. Come on, Dizzy. We don't want to be late for the prom. This is going to be awesome. Marty, I feel kind of bad for baby Kira. She just, she just really wants to go. I know, but she can't. She's a baby. Whoa! That was a fairy that just showed up for the ball. I do, and there's a wizard and another fairy. Oh my goodness! Everybody looks so beautiful. Who do you think is gonna be the prom queen? I have no idea. <gasps> it's a vampire dark fairy. Oh man! If she wins, we're all doomed. Sophia looks beautiful and popular like usual. Here I come, Molly. Hello, Lady Daisy. Hello, Princess Molly. <laughs> oh my gosh, the prom looks beautiful. Like, like, like a, a fairy princess belongs here. Well, you were introduced as a princess. Hi, Sophia. You look, you look amazing. I bet you're going to get... Okay, she doesn't want to talk to me right now. I was trying to tell her, but... Hey, what do you want? Oh, hey, Dark Fairy. Um, You're looking very much like a... Oh, sorry, I didn't mean to knock you over. Go away. Ugh. Sorry. Okay, I'm so not popular. <laughs> I, I wish I could be, but I'm not. All right, let's get our dance on. Oh, yeah. I know what you mean. <laughs> I'm breaking it down. Oh, brother Molly, your dance choices are pretty funny. What? I think I'm a great dancer. I think that's my dad. You just want to do for that. I must be hearing things. I thought I heard Baby Kira. I do. Me too. Uh, Molly, you did hear Baby Kira and Baby Luke. Seriously? What? What are you guys doing here? Oh. Um, gee, you guys are babies. You're not supposed to be here. Well, they're already here, Molly. Might as well let them book it out. Besides, look at those babies dancing together. They're so cute. Look at Luke in his little suit. And baby Q in her little dress. They look so adorable. Oh, um, gee, look at those babies at the prom. Excuse me, would anybody like some bread? Bread? Seriously, that's all that it is? We put some butter on it, too. Ooh, fancy bread and butter for our prom. <laughs> I can't believe our baby sister has a date for the prom and we don't. Well, Molly, that's just the way it is. But I'm having so much fun. <laughs> I love this song. Molly, what are you doing? A jig? Oh, my gosh. You're so not cool. I don't care. I, I don't care if I'm cool. I am just care. I care that I'm myself. Right now, I really feel like myself. <laughs> You're the prom queen? Oh, that's so cute, baby Kira, but I don't think so. Oh, <laughs> Daisy, they think they're prom king and prom queen. Oh, that's so cute. Baby prom king and baby prom queen. <laughs> huh, I don't think so, guys. Sophia always gets prom queen, but nice try.
is already in, like, right in the middle for everybody to vote. Who are you going to vote for, Molly? <laughs> I'm going to vote for baby Kira. Seriously? Yeah, why not? Sophia always wins everything. Boring. I think we should vote for baby Kira. I did too. OMG. Sophia will be so sad if she doesn't get prom queen. I know. Look at her. She's so perfect with the way she walks the runway and everything. And her wings are beautiful. Yeah, that's cool. But she's not going to win. Baby Kira is. <laughs> the results are in. Oh, baby Kira won prom queen. <laughs> A baby won prom queen. A baby won prom queen. Congratulations, baby Kira. All your dreams came true. <laughs> oh, my gosh. That's amazing. What do you think she'll say to her fans? Probably something like this. Go, 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 You probably won't, Molly. I did Now, here's your passy. <laughs> the baby went potty! Gross! Someone needs a diaper change. Wee! Wee! Oh, no! She's miserable again! Oh, boy. Huh, I don't like any of these other babies. I don't like it. I'm gonna keep whining. Wee! Wow, Molly, you're the bratiest baby ever. I can be a brat if I want to. <laughs> Molly, you're about to step on that other baby. Be careful. <laughs> Too many pop-ups. <laughs> wow, someone needs to put that big baby in timeout. Here, maybe if you have your teddy bear, you'll be happier. Finally, the big baby is happy. Now, maybe she'll try not to kill all of us. <laughs> hey, wait a minute. What's this baby food? Mm. This looks delicious. I definitely want some of this. No, don't eat that. You're going to get even bigger than you already are. Oh, no. This isn't going to be good. Whoa, look at this giant food. Holy guacamole. I definitely need that. Wait a minute. Why am I so small? <laughs> Molly, you must have shrank back. What? No, that can't be. No, I was a big baby. I want to be a big baby. Oh, trust me, Molly. You're a big baby, all right. <laughs> I'm back to being big baby. You can say that again, big baby. Be quiet. Baby wants what baby wants. Oh, brother. Watch out, my sister's gone psycho again. And she's a giant, whiny baby. I'm a big baby. Oh, yeah? <laughs> I'm a bigger baby. Whee! Ow! <laughs> Uh-oh, Molly. Looks like you're about to get in a brawl. Fight, 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 Molly. Get him. Oh, you shouldn't. Oh. <laughs> you shouldn't pick on other babies that are bigger than you. Look what happened. Oh, I can't believe you killed me. Oh, I'm going to drink my bottle. It was me. I know what 
I'll do. Hey, he's still hitting me. Rude. Okay, I'm. That's it. That's it. Ugh, take that. Take that. And that. And that. Oh God. Yeah, he killed me again. Do I want to enter area four? Not really. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna get one of these big baby foods and I'm gonna eat it and then I'm gonna be able to beat up anybody. Here I go. It was 149 Robux. Mmm. Well, that's delicious. <laughs> so good. Now guess what kind of baby I'm gonna be? Gigantic! <laughs> now I'm a bigger baby. Bigger than everyone. <laughs> everyone shall bow down to me. Ooh, a rumble. Yes, yes, yes. Uh-oh. This person's way bigger than me. Wait a minute. I thought I was the biggest baby of them all. No fair. <laughs> Marty, you're beating up your own sister. Uh-oh. Look at the brawl is against me. And this other little tiny baby. And this other little itty bitty 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 baby. Oh. The baby's a preemie. It's so cute. I'm sorry that I have to beat you guys up. It's a part of the brawl, but. Okay, bye guys. Oh, I can't even I can't even get that little baby because it's so small. Ow, what? who knocked me over? That little tiny preemie? It was crazy. Hey, don't pick up my sister, mister! Don't pick on my sister. That's right. That's right. No one gets to pick on my sister but me. Molly! <laughs> Ow! What are you doing? Daisy, I was defending you! Well, too bad, Molly. No, too bad for you. Uh-oh. Now it's me against this other big baby. No! No, you will not defeat me! No! Oh, Molly, are you going to cry some more? Yes! <laughs> that makes me sad. Ow! Someone just threw me! Ah, I need a bottle! Whee! <laughs> oh boy, you're the whiniest giant baby I've ever known! Whatever, Daisy. Daisy, don't do it. You're gonna come over here and beat me up. You're gonna be sorry. You're gonna be sorry! Told ya! Told ya, Daisy! What? I can't believe that! Well, believe it. I'm bigger than you. I'm also the older sister, and anybody that comes near me is gonna be a squished baby. I'm not even bothering you, Molly. Get away from me, Molly! Okay, fine. Here comes somebody else to be like so mean. I'm not gonna let him know. You're the only one that's being crazy around here, Molly. You need to sit in timeout. I don't wanna sit in timeout. Nobody understands why you're being so rude, Molly, and so whiny and mean. But you need to stop it right now, big baby. Okay. That's it. You need a nap. I knew it. You look so sleepy. Okay. I'll sing you a little lullaby. Go to sleep, big baby. Quit your whining. It's annoying when you try. To kill us all Go to sleep, Molly Go to sleep, Molly Oh, I think she's asleep Wait, why is she sleeping with her eyes open? Because I'm not really asleep! <laughs> Molly! How dare you try to take make me take a nap! <laughs> I'm coming for you all! That was so rude! <laughs> How much longer is this wait gonna be? Excuse me, my wife, she's she's in a lot of pain and 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 I need to know how much longer the wait's gonna be. Oh, sorry, sir. We have a lot of people ahead of you. Someone came in and had a heart attack and... I know, but my wife, she's she's pregnant and... Uh, how far along is she? Um, she's seven months. Oh, wow. She still has two months to go, though. Please! She's in pain. She needs help. Okay, let me see what I can do, sir. Hi, miss. I'm Nurse Judy. 
Can you please help me? My stomach hurts so bad. Okay, well, let's get you into exam room one. It just opened up and uh, we'll take a look. Now your husband says you're about seven months pregnant. Is that correct? Yeah, seven months. My sweet little baby, we've already picked out her name. Yeah, but I'm a little worried. I mean, my wife shouldn't be in this much pain, should she? We've had two other children and, and she didn't have this much pain with the other two. Well, it could indicate something wrong. Are you a doctor or a nurse? I'm just a nurse, but we're short-staffed today, so I'll be the one examining your wife. Okay, I, I hope everything's gonna be okay. Let me just get some gloves. All right, I'm going to fill your stomach. This shouldn't hurt. Okay, let's see. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. What's wrong? Is there something wrong? Well, it seems that you're in labor. Say what? She's got two months to go with her pregnancy, though. I know, but this is just something that happens sometimes. We need to move her into the um, regular hospital and out of the emergency room immediately. Okay, well, thanks for getting her seen. I mean, she might have had her baby right on the floor if you hadn't got her in this room. Oh, somebody get me a puke bucket. Oh my gosh, are you going to throw up? Here you go. Here's a puke bag in case you need it. Oh boy, this is going to be a long night. I can tell already. Okay, Miss Laura, just jump right into this bed over here. Well, not jump, because then your baby definitely would come out on the floor, probably. <laughs> um, go ahead and just get into this bed right here, and I will take you up into the maternity ward. I'm right behind you, honey. I'm right behind you. Oh, my stomach hurts so bad. I hope my baby's okay. Laura, we're going to take the best care of you ever. Everything's going to be A-OK, -okay, I promise. You can't make that promise, though. You don't really know. Well, I've seen a lot of babies born two months early, and usually they're just fine. Okay, Laura, we're just gonna take a little bit of an x-ray here and make sure that your baby is doing okay. You mean besides the fact, Nurse Judy, that the baby's coming two months early? Well, babies just decide to come when they want to come. All right, I'm gonna need you to step out of the room while I do this ultrasound, please. Really, why? Because you're super nervous and you're making me nervous, and I don't want you to make the patient nervous. I'm just so sad. Like, I thought I had two more months and, and the nursery isn't done yet. And Laura, everything's going to be A-OK. -okay. Oh, it looks like your baby hasn't turned yet. Well, it looks like you're going to be in labor a little bit longer. Let's take you to the labor room. OK, Laura, I'll be back to check on you soon. Um, Dan, I don't think you're allowed to play video games on the computers at the hospital. They use those to, like, check up on patients and stuff. Um, Laura, I think it's fine because you've been in labor already for like 12 hours and I need something to keep me awake. I've already drank like 40 cups of coffee. How do you think I feel? I'm the one having the baby. Oh. Everything's going to be okay, honey. Everything's going to be okay. Dan? Dan, where'd you go? Dan? Is he seriously sleeping in the baby crib? Ay, ay, ay. Oh, my stomach. Oh, Dan, go get the nurse, quick. Oh, what? Oh, is the baby coming? Okay, I'm on it. I'm on it, honey. Oh, my foot fell asleep. Oh, I was so crammed in there. Oh, my foot fell asleep. Oh. Okay, the patient in room two is doing well. The patient in room four needs her meds. Hurry, my wife, she's having her baby. Nurse Judy, get the doctor. Oh, unfortunately, there's no doctor on duty right now. We're really short-handed. Wait, what? Well, my wife, she's having her baby. Don't worry. I'm assisting the doctor every single day, so I'll be able to help you. Help me what? Deliver this baby? Yeah, exactly. Come on, let's go. Oh, my gosh. Nurse Judy, where's, where's my doctor? Um, well, your doctor's on vacation in Tahiti, and we're a little short-handed. Wait, what? Dr. Smith isn't here? Um, honey, try not to panic. All right, let's just check you. Everything's going to be fine. I'm a nurse that works with this doctor all the time. And um, basically, I've helped deliver just thousands of babies. So it's going to be fine. Oh, my. Your baby still hasn't turned. Okay, I hate to tell you this, Laura, but you're going to need to go to the OR. Wait, what? Why? Because you're going to have to have a C-section to have your baby. 
phone. M G. Today just keeps getting worse and worse. Dr. Brittany, I'm so glad you could make it here. Our our patient, she needs a C-section. Oh, I'd be happy to help. Um, she's really a doctor? Yes, it's Dr. Jansen. She's very, very good at delivering babies. Okay, I'm just glad a doctor was able to be here. I mean, I know you're short-handed. Yeah, but Dr. Jansen was able to come in on her day off so we can get this baby delivered. All right, Laura should already be asleep, so I'm just gonna give her a shot to make her extra comfortable. Oh, honey, don't worry. Everything's gonna be okay. All right, now we're just making sure that she's nice and comfortable, and then we're gonna deliver your daughter. Who's ready to be a parent? <laughs> well, Laura's asleep, so she won't hear anything, but Dan, are you ready? Um, I'm a little nervous about this. Oh, be careful. She's a doctor. Of course she's gonna be careful. Okay, Nurse Judy, but she's the love of my life right there, and, and she has my baby, and, and, and I want them to be okay. Okay, Dad, try not to freak out. Mm -hmm. Okay, everything's going as expected, all is well. Is there anything I can assist you with, Dr. Jansen? Um, no, I think I've got everything under control. I see the baby, and here she comes. Okay, Nurse Judy, get ready to catch that baby. She looks extra slippery this time. <laughs> Is that my daughter? Well, do you see anyone else delivering a baby in this room? Of course it's your daughter. <laughs> oh yeah, oh yeah, I just delivered a baby. Oh yeah, oh yeah, I'm super, super amazing. If I wasn't a doctor, I would totally be a famous dancer. Uh, Dr. Jansen, don't you think we should weigh the baby? Oh yeah, we should totally do that. Come on, let's weigh her. Whoa, she's barely four pounds. And she's breathing a little funny, Dr. Jansen. Oh, let me take a look. Uh, yeah, she definitely is gonna need a NICU stay. What? A NICU stay? But, but... Yeah, let's take her to NICU right now. I should get something for Laura for when she wakes up and baby Kira in NICU. I just can't believe my baby is only four pounds. I hope she's gonna be okay. I just... I want my baby to be okay. Where, where's my baby? Where's baby Kira? Baby Kira? Where, why did she, why did she, where is she? Honey, honey, calm down. I got you some beautiful flowers and... Where is my baby? She's, she's in the NICU. In the NICU? Why? Well, she was having a little trouble breathing and she was barely four pounds. Oh my gosh, because she was two months early. Oh, poor baby Kira. I want to go see her. Well, honey, you just did a C-section. That's an operation. I think you should rest. Take me to my baby right now! Okay, honey, okay. I'm so excited to meet our baby sister. I know. She's going to be so adorable. I know it. Hey, wait, there's Mom. Mom? Are you okay, Mom? Uh, girls, try to talk quietly. Your mom's a little upset right now. Wait, where, where's the baby? Why is she in this room and not a regular room? Yeah, what's going on, Mom? Are you okay? Girls, I had to have an operation. An operation? Mom, why? Um, well, you know, your sister came early, and that meant she was only four pounds, and she was having some trouble breathing. Oh, M G, Mom, are you all right? Is, is baby Kira all right? Um, we're both okay, honey. I'm just gathering up my strength now to go see her in the NICU. Can we go too, Mom? Yes, you girls can go, but you have to make sure you keep wearing your gloves. And wash your hands a lot. We will! We will, Dad! We will! I just want to meet my baby sister. O-M-G! Look at her! She's so adorable! Oh, Great Molly, you already made her cry. It's probably because she knows you're going to be your sister. Oh, I can't believe my baby is in NICU. Don't worry, Mom. She looks like she's doing amazing. I want to hold her. We should probably let Mom hold her first. Mom, do you want to hold her first? Yeah, of course I do. My sweet little baby. Hi, sweet little baby. I'm your mommy. And I'm your big sister. Oh, look at she's sucking on her pacifier. 
Oh, Molly, I think you're going to be a great big sister. And I think baby Kira is going to be just fine. Hi, baby. Welcome to the family. <laughs> You know it's going to be a wonderful day when you find an extra donut in your underwear drawer. Ew! Why was there a donut in your underwear drawer? I was keeping it there so you didn't steal it. Well, that's one place I would never look for a donut. Mom, don't have to make me breakfast. I have a leftover blueberry donut. The icing's delicious. Molly, we haven't had a donut in over a week. Where did you get that from? I've been saving it. Ew, Molly, gross. Mm, I don't think it's that bad. <laughs> well, I guess you'll have to explain to the dentist why you have icing and sugar all over your teeth. Wait, what? Why? Because we have dentist appointments today. What? No! Oh, the dentist! I don't want to go to the dentist. Mm, this is really good. Well, I guess we'll get our money's worth when she has to clean all that icing off of your teeth. Gross. Yeah, Molly, you should eat healthy like me and eat an apple. Girls, listen, I know you don't really like going to the dentist. It's kind of annoying to have to sit in the chair for a while and get a cleaning. But today is baby Kira's first dentist appointment. <coughs> Holy guacamole, poor kid. Girls, it's not that bad, and I would appreciate it if you didn't scare baby Kira by telling her, well, things that aren't true about the dentist. Like the fact that she makes you, um, get a new toothbrush? I like that part. Daisy, that's not scary. That's, well, in your case, that's, like, wonderful. I know I love getting new toothbrushes. Only you could get excited about a new toothbrush. Ay, ay, ay. Why don't they give out cupcakes at the dentist? Molly, I think you're missing the point of going to the dentist. You're supposed to eat healthy and take care of your teeth. Mmm. Nothing like coating them in blue icing. Mmm, delicious. Ah, my stomach is so full. I'm gonna go watch TV. I just got eye bye. Good morning. Good morning, baby Kira. Mm. Oh, so good. I hope we could go somewhere special today. <laughs> special, huh? <laughs> yeah, uh, I wouldn't call where we were going special, really. Molly, remember what we talked about. Okay. Did mom tell you where we're actually going, baby Kira? I don't know, but I think we we'll go to Disney World or Dwyer Park. No and no. We're going for ice cream? No, we're not eating ice cream. Oh no, then we're going to be special. You're going to the dent, 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 dentist. <laughs> uh, this really wasn't the reaction I was looking for. Molly, what's going on? Nothing! I, I didn't do anything! Oh, I knew I should have eaten another donut. <laughs> I would have kept my mouth full and shut. Molly, what did you tell baby Kira? She's very upset. <laughs> Molly, what did you tell her about the dentist? I didn't say anything. I just said we're going to the dentist. She started crying. I don't go to the dentist. I can't. Oh, baby Kira, there's nothing to be scared of. And besides, I give you a new toothbrush. I want to bite. To bite, stupid. What? Baby Kira, you shouldn't say the word stupid. That's very naughty. Well, I guess she gets out of jail free today, Mom, because she's going to the dentist. I guess so. Now, Molly, why don't you tell your sister how wonderful it is to go to the dentist? Uh, uh, well, Mom, I'm sort of drawing a blank here. Molly! I'm, I'm sorry, I'm just... All right, everybody in the car. Baby Kira, everything's going to be fine. Don't listen to your sister. She's such a nincompoop. Mom! Well, you are being a little bit of a nincompoop today, Molly. <laughs> nincompoop. <laughs> Poop emoji! Oh, boy. What am I going to do with you, Molly? Just love me, Mom. Just love me! Your oldest daughter. Your most specialist child. Oh, get in the car, Molly. Get in the car. Molly, you don't get to sit up front. Girls, all of you can sit in the back. But, Mom, it's cold out! Sorry, your dad took the car. I'm stuck with the truck today. Put on your seatbelts. Okay, fine. I'm excited about going to the dentist. You would be, Daisy. You would be. What's so bad about the dentist? Our dentist is so nice. Yeah, I can't imagine why I'd be, well, annoyed about going to the dentist. With a name like Dr. Payne? Yeah, no reason at all. Okay, girls. We're almost here. 
except for I sort of forgot where the dentist's office is. <laughs> they changed offices, you know. I heard it's very modern and nice. Oh, it's next to Starbucks? <laughs> you can get a cavity and then you can go to the dentist. Brilliant marketing. <laughs> Baby Kira, I promise it's really not that bad. Our dentist is so nice and, and, and well, it doesn't hurt or anything. She's freaking out. It's no use. Hello, who's next? Oh, Molly, Daisy, and a brand new patient, baby Kira. Yeah, my sister is freaking out. Well, come on, baby Kira. Let's see if we can turn that frown upside down. I got good dentist. No, I freak out. No, no, no. You won't freak out. Come on, I'll hold your hand. La, 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 my sister is freaking out. I'm going to sit here with her, though, because I'm a nice big sister like that. Okay, baby Kira, dry your eyes. Everything's going to be fine. Okay, I try. You know what always makes a lot of my patients feel better? A new little friend. I got a monkey. Whoa, I never got a monkey. I want a monkey. You're a big kid now, Molly, but baby Kira is, well, just little. How about this adorable monkey? Do you want to give him a squeeze? Maybe a little hug? I got him. I, I named him uh, Marvin. Wow. <laughs> That's a very interesting name. Marvin the monkey. Okay. What's his name for sure? Marv. Oh, okay. Marv the monkey. I got monkey. Go kill. All right. Now those tears are drying up real quick. Now we're going to tickle your teeth. That's right. Tickle, tickle. <laughs> I just realized that my dentist is a little cray-cray, but it's all right. She's super nice, right? I think. Am I going to have to have a real canal? I hope not, Molly. <laughs> and I'm crazy for teeth. I love teeth. I love teeth. I love teeth. Yes, I do. I love teeth. How about you? Brushing, flossing, make them shine. That's how I've kept my teeth of mine. Wow, Dr. Payne! Good thing you became a dentist because your singing voice is well. Oh, <laughs> I know I'm not the best singer, but I'm happy to be a dentist! Well, if that's your calling in life. I don't know your body label. Oh, I haven't even tickled your teeth yet! Okay, let's tickle, tickle! Tickle, tickle, tickling your teeth! Huh, well, I guess baby Kira isn't so sad anymore. Look at her face! And her teeth are super shiny and white! <laughs> I think that she's going to love the dentist from here on out. Okay, baby Kira, you're all done. Uh, and just for being a good girl, I'm going to give you a coupon for a free donut at Starbucks. I get donut, you hear that? I get donut. Oh, wow. <laughs> is it my turn next? Sure is, Molly. Okay, let me take a look. Hmm. Have you been brushing? Uh-huh. And flossing? Uh, well, um, uh... Molly, you haven't been flossing? That's disappointing. I know, I'm sorry, I'll try harder. What's this blue stuff in between your teeth? Uh, uh, uh blueberries, yeah. Um, more like blueberry icing from a blueberry donut. I'm very sorry, Molly, but you have a cavity. What? What? A cavity? Oh, no. Yep, I'll just need to give you a little bit of a shot. Nope, nope, I'm out of here. Ah, it's Daisy's turn! Daisy! Molly, it's your turn! Come on! Next time, maybe you'll floss and eat less donuts. Oh, man! So, Molly, are you telling the truth? Yeah, I am! Isn't that crazy? But don't tell anybody, okay? Molly, your secret is safe with me. Oh, good. <laughs> Not even my sister or anybody knows about this. Wow, just me? Yep. Oh, I gotta go. My sister Daisy's here. What are you keeping secrets about, Molly? Um, nothing. Nothing. You and Pookie Cookie have a secret, and you're not telling me. That's not nice, Molly. Well, it's just between her and I, okay? And it's not really a secret or anything, so don't worry about it. Just forget about it. Okay, Molly, but I don't think you're telling the truth. I am, Daisy, I am! Uh huh, sure, Molly. Oh, that was a close one. I can't let my sister know what's going on. Okay, I'm just gonna go out here and check on things, make sure everything's okay. 
What is Molly up to? I'm gonna follow her into the backyard. Is my sister following me right now? She is! Daisy, what do you want? Molly, you're hiding something, and I want to know what it is right now. Daisy, I'm not hiding anything. I swear, I'm just going for a walk. You're going for a walk in the backyard. Yeah, we have a big backyard. Yeah, not that big, Molly. What do you think? It's like an Olympic stadium or something? <laughs> no, but look at all the woods we have. I like walking to the trees and... Liar, Molly! You're lazy. You don't go for walks. That's not true. If there's a cupcake on the walk, I'll go. Oh, brother. Girls, do you want a snack? I can make you something. I'm getting a snack. Bye, Daisy. Molly, this isn't over. You have to tell me what you're hiding. Nope, not going to do it. Nope, nope, nope. Mom, will you make us a snack? Of course I will. What were you thinking you wanted? Um, can we have something delicious and like a treat? Mm, yeah, you girls ate really healthy today. I guess you can have a treat. <laughs> Woohoo! I'm ready for it, Mom. So, Molly, are you going to tell me what this little secret is? What secret? What are you girls talking about? There's no secret! Daisy, shh! Oh, you don't want Mom to know the secret. Um... If there was a secret to tell, then everyone could know what it is. But there's no secret! There's a secret. And I'm gonna find out what it is! So, anyway, Mom, what are you making us? Something really delicious! Okay, let's see. There's flour, milk, and a cupcake pan. <gasps> Mom, are you making me cupcakes? <laughs> Maybe. Oh, you're the best mom ever. I love you, mom. I seriously love you, love you, love you. Okay, girls, here's your delicious cupcakes. I don't have any frosting, sorry. That's okay, mom. Who needs frosting? Hmm. These are delicious. Hmm, hmm, hmm. Yum. Cheapest mom, are you going to save some cupcakes for the best of us? Uh-huh, sure. Hmm. So good. Ugh. Molly, take your time. You're going to get a stomach ache. Um, I'm gonna eat this last cupcake in the backyard. See you guys later. What? Why does she want to eat it outside? I don't know. Maybe she just wants some fresh air, Daisy. Everybody needs fresh air sometimes. Oh, okay. I've got to save this. Um, you know, I want to make sure she has enough to eat. Molly, what on earth are you doing? Daisy, what are you doing? Why are you following me? Molly, you better tell me what this secret is right now. Okay, fine, but you can't tell anybody. Do you promise? I promise, Molly. What is it? Daisy, why are you swimming so weird? I don't know. I'm just kind of stuck in the water. <laughs> you look really weird right now. Oh, because you have an expert swimmer. Um, okay, see you later, Daisy. Molly, you just tried to distract me. Tell me what the secret is, please, Molly. Please, please, please. Okay. I found a baby mermaid. What? No, you didn't. You're a liar. That's not true. It's true. I was on my way home from school one day, and you know how you just walk past that one part of the river? Yeah. Well, there was a baby mermaid in there. What? Yep. It's totally true. And she needed my help. So I brought her home, and I made her a nursery in our pool. I don't believe you, Molly. If you don't believe me, just follow me. Where are you going? Swim down! Swim down, Daisy! Molly, why are you swimming through the filter of the pool? Whoa! What is this place? I told you! I made a nursery for my baby mermaid. Molly, I don't know what's going on right now. This nursery is adorable, but I don't see a baby mermaid. What? There's a baby mermaid! <laughs> I told you there was a baby mermaid! Oh my god, she's beautiful. Thank you, I think she's adorable too. Oh, beautiful mermaid. So now you know why you gotta keep this baby mermaid a secret. Like, I'm pretty sure everyone would freak out if they knew there was a baby mermaid in town. Everyone would want to adopt her. No, I don't want everyone to adopt her. I want her to be a part of our family. I get to do so why I tell you. I get cocky, Papa. Wow, Molly, what's her name? Her name's Baby Kira. Wow, she's adorable. Thank you. And also, I just can't believe it. I can't believe I found a baby mermaid. This just doesn't happen every day. No, Molly, it really doesn't. 
Give me a tool around the nursery. And this is her little crib. And her cute little pictures are above. And there's a little chair that I can sit and rock her in if she needs that before she goes to sleep. Here's her changing table with her changing pad. And there's a box of diapers and wipes. Here's her little closet where she can get dressed. She is so cute. Some really cute outfits. Like, well, basically just tops because her bottoms, you know, she's got a tail. So, um, she can't wear, like, pants or anything. And then over here is a dresser where I just keep, like, extra toys and stuff. Wow, Molly, this is adorable. I love the pictures and the paintings and the walls. She even has a pet octopus doll. That's adorable. Yeah, I think so, too. <laughs> um, so, yeah. This is basically her room. Well, Molly, you can't keep her. What do you mean I can't keep her? Why not? Because, Molly, she has to go back in the ocean where she belongs. What? No! She's my baby mermaid. I found her, and, and I love her. She's like my sister. Molly, you can't keep her. Besides, Mom will find out. No, she won't. Nope, I'm going to keep her down here until she's 18. No one will ever know. Molly, you can't do that. Girls, where are you? Oh, baby Kira, my sweet little mermaid baby. You stay down here, okay? Um, And I'll bring you a bottle soon, okay? I'll be right back. Coming, Mom! Mom, we're coming! Now don't breathe the word of this to Mom! Okay, Molly. Don't tell me what. Are you girls keeping a secret? No, we don't have any kind of secret. Why would we be doing that? I mean, we were just in the pool because we wanted to go for a swim, not because we have a secret. Daisy! Wait, is the secret in the pool? Who said anything about a secret? I don't have a secret. There's not a secret under the pool. Daisy! Ugh, oh, my sister's terrible at keeping secrets. Okay, time to see what's underneath the pool. Nothing! Nothing! Don't go in the pool, Mom! There might be a sea monster in there. Molly, don't be ridiculous. Ah, this water's cold. Mom, don't go down there! Molly! Oh, great, Daisy. You spilled the beans! Well, not technically. What is going on down here? Um, nothing, Mom. Nothing at all. Oh, my gosh. Is that a baby mermaid? Um, nope. You're just seeing things. Molly, how long have you had this baby mermaid? Um, like a week. And you set up this nursery for her? Yeah, I, I didn't want her to be alone. Oh, Molly, that's so nice of you. Maybe we could adopt her. Really? She, she doesn't have to leave? Well, it's up, to, it's up to the baby mermaid. What's her name? Her name's Baby Kira. Little mermaid, do you want to go back to the ocean? I don't know. No mommy, no daddy. Oh my gosh, she has no mom and dad. Well, we'll be her mom and dad. Okay, baby, I've got to go pick up some milk and diapers. No, Mom, I did all that. I I've got it all. Come on, I'll show you. Molly, what happened? I was too afraid to go down there. I thought you were going to be grounded forever. No, Mom says we can adopt the baby mermaid. Really? Yes, girls, but you're not allowed to keep secrets from me, okay? Okay, Mom, I promise, no more secrets. I just think it was very terrible. What? When she gets out of the water, she has legs. What? Are you kidding me? No. She turns into a human, Mom. Um, that's unexpected. What's she doing? I don't know. What are you doing? I can't be out of my hungry. Oh, my gosh. The baby mermaid turned into a little human baby, and now she's eating watermelon out of the refrigerator. <laughs> I wasn't expecting that. Well, welcome to the family, baby mermaid. <laughs> Okay, girls, see you later. Molly, take good care of your sister. Don't worry, Mom, I will. Okay, baby Kara, what should we do first? Oh my god, don't tell me you're gonna go crazy already. <laughs> it's only been one second since Mom left. <laughs> oh my god, the dining room table is not a trampoline. Ay, ay, ay. Do you need a timeout already? <laughs> Get off the table or you can have a timeout. 
Okay, I'm starving. I need to make some like cupcakes or muffins or something. Let's see. Um, what do we have in the fridge that I could make? Cookies, blueberry muffins. <gasps> blueberry muffins. That sounds delicious. Bye-bye. All right, be good. Wherever you go, be good. Oh, I can't wait to eat these muffins. They're going to be so good. Put a little flour in. And then um, just stir, stir, stir. Got to add a little butter. Perfect. They're all ready to bake. Molly, Molly, what are you baking? It smells delicious. Hey, wait a minute. Where's Baby Kira? I don't know. She just went in the other room. Molly, you can't leave a toddler by yourself. She's going to be getting into trouble. What? No, she won't. Molly! Okay, fine. I'll go check on her. Baby Kira, baby Kira, what are you doing? Where are you? Did you make a splash, splash? Baby Kira! Ew, no! Don't play in the toilet! Oh, that is so gross. Okay, wash your hands right now. Wash them. I don't buy you. You have to wash them. Oh, gross. Molly, your muffins are gonna burn. Oh, man. Baby Kira, come out here when you're done. Molly, I think you burned your muffins. No, no, no. They're fine. Ouch, they're really hot, though. Super, super hot. Whoa, those look delicious. You better not be playing in that toilet. What? What are you doing? No, that game is too grown up for you. You can't play it. I play it. No, baby Kira, you're not allowed to play that game. I never play. No, you... Okay, I'm going to have to give you a timeout. <laughs> go go sit over here in the corner and in your timeout. I don't want you. I know you don't want to, but you have to for at least five minutes. I don't want you. You're me, baby, Zittle. I know, I'm so mean, but you're not listening. Oh, babysitting is so hard. Can we eat these muffins yet, Molly? No, you have to wait till they cool. Cheapers, what am I, babysitting you too? What? No, I'm not a baby. You don't even know that you need to let muffins cool? Ay, ay, ay. I should have been paid to babysit baby Kira and you. Molly, I'm not a baby. Take it back right now. Yeah, no, I'm not going to take it back. Molly, where's baby Kira? She's in timeout. Wow, you're a mean baby, Siddle. No, I'm not. I'm just trying to teach her she has to listen. Blink, blink, blink. I did such a boy. I did such a boy. Okay, baby girl, you, you're not listening. You have to go take a nap. You're getting really grumpy, and you're not being good. Ugh. <sighs> My little sister really wears me out. Baby Kira, I agree with Molly. You're being naughty, and you're being grumpy. You're supposed to be taking a nap, so you have to go take one. Stinks to be a toddler, but you are, so you have to take a nap. Okay, baby Kira, come on. Into your room and into your crib. I don't know why you are. Yeah, get in your crib, and I'll see you in about two hours. <laughs> two hours! Goodbye, baby Kira. Oh, Daisy. I know, Molly, that was crazy. I'm going to go play a game in my room. Yeah, me too. Finally, some peace and quiet. Hey, wait a minute. I forgot about the muffins I made. Ooh, they're going to be so delicious. And I don't hear anything from baby Kira's room. She must already be asleep. Hey, wh wh what happened to the muffins? Where are they? I know I put them right here. Oh, that's, that's my sister Daisy eating them all. Ugh. Daisy, Daisy. What? What's the problem, Molly? Why are you yelling? And in my room. Daisy, where are the muffins? Oh, yeah, I forgot about those. Let's go eat some. No, you already ate them all, you piggy. What? No, I didn't. Liar. Yes, you did. Molly, quit calling me a liar. I didn't even remember about the muffins. That's not true. They're not out there. Molly, I'm sure you just misplaced them. Come on, I'll find them. How can I misplace muffins? <laughs> you set them on the counter and they just sit right there. Whoa, where are they, Molly? Dizzy, I don't know. Where could they have gone? Well, maybe you stored them in the fridge. Let me look. Nope, they're not in the fridge. Dizzy, seriously, if you ate them, 
just tell me, and I'll buy. I'll make new ones or something, or I'll go to the store and buy some. Molly, I'm telling you the truth. I didn't eat the muffins. Well, but okay, maybe I put them in my room and I forgot. Okay, where was the last place I was when I saw the muffins? Maybe you put them in the toilet. What? Why would I put them in the toilet? Cause BBQ is playing in the toilet. I don't know. OMG! I can't believe it. I lost my muffins. Ah! Molly, don't cry like a baby. <laughs> hey, what's that sound? <laughs> he sounds like Baby Q was awake. What? No. She needs to sleep for another hour and 45 minutes. Wait. Daisy, where is she? I don't know, Molly. She's down in a woo. OMG. Baby Q. Baby Q. Oh my god, I lost the baby. This is so bad. This is so bad. She's not in the laundry room. She's not in Daisy's closet. She's not in Daisy's bathroom. Oh my god, where's the baby? Well, Molly, don't panic because obviously we can hear her laughing. Let's just listen for the sound of her laughing. Mmm, <laughs> yummy. Why is she saying yummy? Wait a minute, does she have my muffins? <laughs> Sounds like she's coming from out here. I know, Molly. <laughs> Maybe she's in the bottom of the pool. Molly, I doubt it. I'm going down to look. Molly, she's not in the bottom of the pool. She could be. Okay, yeah, no, she's not. Oh, gee, Molly. Jeepers. Where is my sister? Where is my sister? Molly, I'm starting to freak out. Yeah, me too. <laughs> Wait a minute. It sounds like it's coming from her nursery. Ooh, yummy. Sounds like it's coming from under her crib. I do, right, Molly? Wait, what? What is this? What's under that blanket? <laughs> Baby Kira? What? What? Ah! Ah! I fell down! What? What, what is under her crib? Oh, oopsie. I did do blah blah blah. Pretty colored unicorn. Pretty colored unicorn. Molly! She has, she has a bunker under her crib. And she stole all the muffins. What? You stole the muffins? You naughty baby! This is gonna be like you in time out forever! I can't even think right now. I'm so, I'm so astonished that you built this under your crib. You're only a toddler. I know, right, Molly? She's quite the genius, if you ask me. I know. Why didn't I think of this when I was a toddler and had to take a nap? <laughs> I could have been eating muffins and like seriously, I could have, I could have been watching TV. Mmm, these muffins are delicious. I said, goodbye, Am I gonna tell mom about your bunker under your crib? Um, well, uh, hmm. If I don't tell mom, maybe I can use the bunker. <laughs> oh, brother Molly. Brightly colored unicorn? Yeah, we'll watch the brightly colored unicorn. Girls, I'm home. Where are you? Oh, man, mom's here. Everybody out of the bunker. Molly, watch out! You're pushing! Ah! Daisy! <laughs> Baby Kira, get in your crib. I just don't put my up, okay? Girls, where are you? We're in here, Mom, and everything's totally normal. <laughs>
Not if you're playing hide and seek. You have to actually play mischief if you want to do that. Told you the babies in this game aren't normal. <laughs> Wait a minute. Daisy's a baby? Yeah, you better find me, buddy. Well, just remember that if you die, you lose. So don't go in the pool. Because you cannot swim. You have no arms in this game. Yeah, that does make the baby kind of weird, right? No arms and 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 basically you try to get into mischief. Oh my goodness. Um, okay, first of all, I kind of look like a boy. Second of all, um, I have no idea where Daisy went, but I'm going to get an idea pretty soon. But I hope you get an idea really soon. You're going to lose, Molly. Okay, there we go. All right, let's see if I can find her. Ugh, I'm too fat to fit where the babies always fit. Oh, Daisy! What's that? A little door. Hmm, I don't see Daisy in there. <laughs> You're never gonna find me. You're never gonna find me. Yes, I will. I'll find you. I will definitely find you. Okay, not in there. Not in there. God, how many places could she be? Well, let's see. This place is huge, so keep looking. Is this timed? Um, maybe a Molly. Oh, my gosh. I've got to hurry or I'm never going to find this baby. Why does the claw machine look like that? Okay, no, she's not in there. Daisy, where are you? I'm never going to tell you. <laughs> I want to win. Oh, Daisy, you're so good at being a brat. Hey! Well, it's true. Daisy's a brat. Daisy's a brat. Okay, obviously I can't fit in there, which is just not even fair. Ah, oh, Daisy, I found you! Daisy! You didn't catch me, though, Molly. <laughs> what? No, that's not fair. I'll, uh, I can't fit in there. I'm too big. I'm a grown-up. Exactly, Molly. Why do you think I hit you? <laughs> OMG. Okay, I'm just so sick of this baby right now. You're literally going to be grounded for your entire life, Daisy. Uh-huh, yeah, if you can catch me, slowpoke. Where does that trap door even go? Where's this garage anyway? You don't even know where you're going, Molly. It's pretty funny. Uh-huh. Oh, man! <laughs> I win twice in a row. Okay, I'm gonna win this next time. You're not gonna win. You're not gonna win. Uh-huh, sure. We'll see about that. Loser. Oh, my gosh, I'm the baby. All right, this is, this is good news because this means I can hide. She'll never find me. <laughs> oh my god, where am I gonna hide that she won't find me though? Like seriously. Where is the last place she would ever look? Hmm. Um, okay. This this is gonna work out for me. I just know it. Guys, do not tell my sister where I am right now. Please. <laughs> Please don't. Okay. Actually, guys, this is a good idea. Watch this. <laughs> she can't even get in now. And I cannot... Ah, you can't jump on anything! Molly, just just give up. I'm gonna win right now. No, you're not! No, you're not! Oh, man, she might. She might just win, guys, because... Like, oh, see what's happening when I try to hide here? Okay, maybe I can push this like this. There we go. Okay. You guys see what I'm doing, right? Comment below if you guys can see what I'm doing. I can't say it out loud because I don't want Daisy to know. <laughs> Molly, what are you doing? Um, nothing. I told you the babies in this game are really real. <laughs> Good luck ever finding me, Daisy. Where are you, Molly? I'm looking for you everywhere. Yeah, that's totally the point. <laughs> You're never gonna find me. Do -do -do. Oh, you will have 40 seconds, Daisy. Yes, it is time. I finally see the timer like down here in the corner. And I'm gonna win. I'm gonna win. I just wish as the baby you could totally like jump up on things easier because that would be awesome. I see you, Molly. How'd you open the door? No, no, no. <laughs> and now you're blocked in here with me. What? No! No! Uh, <laughs> I won three times in a row. Okay, barricading the door was brilliant. I don't know why this game is the way it is. I, I think that's ridiculous, but I'm going to play hide and seek again, and this time I'm really going to beat you. 
Uh, shoot, Molly. If you want to believe that, okay. Oh, yeah. I'm the parent. You know what that means. You're going down. Down, down, down into timeout forever. What, timeout's underground or something, Molly? <laughs> Why am I going down in timeout? Because, um, yeah. I set up timeout and it's underground. There's no windows. And there's no snacks for three weeks. Well, uh, Molly, actually, I don't think that would work out very well. I need to eat food in three weeks. Okay, yeah, I would bring you food, but you'd be in timeout for three weeks. I don't know what I'm saying right now. See, I told you this game was just totally weird. Where is Daisy? Where is Daisy? I don't know. I don't know. But when I find her, she's going to underground prison. Molly! <laughs> just kidding, but you can't have any ice cream. Oh, that's so sad. Uh-huh, so sad. I know where you're going to be hiding, Daisy. Babies never, ever pick new hiding spots. What? What are you talking about? Ugh, I can't go in that way. Seriously? Oh, my God. I only have one minute to buy my sister. Or I'm seriously going to be the loser forever. Okay. Oh, man. Okay, you're not in there. Daisy, where are you? Yeah, wait, right, Molly, like I'm gonna tell you. Do you want some strawberry ice cream, Daisy? Yeah, I'd love some strawberry ice cream, but you're still not gonna find out where I am. Are you in the laundry room? Are you hiding in the washing machine? That would be a really bad idea. Oh my God, it's really hard to find her. Daisy, are you in the car? No. Oh, look at this little baby stroller. That's cute. Okay, is she in here? I don't think you can open those doors. Okay, yeah, you can. Oh, my God. Where is Daisy? Maybe she's in here. Nope. Holy guacamole. I have 20 seconds, and I can't find her anywhere. <laughs> You're gonna lose. You're gonna lose. Are you in the bathtub? Please be in there. Okay, no. Guys, I don't know. I am terrible at finding my sister. I am also terrible... Uh, basically, um, being a baby, I... Wait, what's that moving right there? <gasps> Somebody just threw something at me. <laughs> it was me, Molly. Loser, loser. Oh, man. I am the champion of Where's the Baby, and you're definitely the loser. Oh. <laughs>
gotcha, I got you. You're not going under the water. This is a bubble. Okay, baby Kira, now just try to swim like this. Watch me. Don't cry, baby Kira. Just try it. You're fine. Okay, kick up, Papa. Okay. Um, you're kind of hopping, baby Kira. Don't hop. Just swim. Okay, kick up, Papa. Bye bye. No, baby Kira. Go. Don't go that far away, baby Kira. Baby Kira. Oh my gosh, she's swimming to the bottom. Baby Kira, come here. Okay, kick up, Papa. Okay, kick up, Papa. Silly baby. You want to try going down the slide? Okay, kick up, Papa. Okay, baby Carol, follow me. We'll go down the slide. This way, baby Kira. Okay, 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 Papa. Okay. Now this slide is really big. Are you sure you can do it? Okay, 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 Papa. Uh huh. Go. Okay, 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 Papa. Watch me first, baby Kira. Whoa, I fell! Ugh, man. Ouch, that kind of hurt. <laughs> I can't climb up, Molly. It's okay, baby Kira. Come on. Come on. I don't know, baby Kira. This slide is, like, really slippery. I can't climb up it. Take a go, Oh my gosh! Baby's crying a lot. Ugh. 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 Okay, well, I guess she's gonna go down the dining board. Wait for me, baby Kira! Jeez! Oh my gosh! Baby Kira is going out to that jet ski. Me, baby girl, I gotta test it out. Wee, 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 wee. Whoa, this is so much fun! Whoa, whoa. Oh my gosh, this is so much fun. I don't know if I can babysit anymore. <laughs> don't worry, baby girl, I'm just. Baby Kira, where are you going? Uh-oh. I think Baby Kira's mad at me. Baby Kira, come back! Baby Kira! Go, 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 Baba! Bye-bye! Oh, no. Baby Kira, stop running away! Come back here, Baby Kira! Oh, my gosh. I can't catch her. She's, like, really fast! I don't know where she's going. She's running really fast, though. Hey, Baby Kira, come back here! Baby Kira! I think she's going into that pet store. I'll catch her now. I'm gonna use a skateboard. I can't figure anything out! It's like, I try to use the skateboard and it doesn't work. I guess I just have to catch her by running. <laughs> Gotcha, baby Kira. <laughs> go, go, Papa. Do you want to go in the store? Go, 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 Papa. Daycare. Daycare? That's the best idea you've had yet. Come on, baby Kira. Okay, baby Kira, it's time for your nap. Go, go, Papa. No. Yes, baby Kira. Yeah, but you need a nap. You're like being a real little troublemaker today. Now, I'll be back in like 20 minutes when your nap is over, okay? Okay. Alright, see you later, baby Kira. Finally, I get a minute to myself. Wow, babysitting is hard work. Hmm, I wonder what else there is to do around here. My name is Mom. That's M O L L for Molly Molly. My name is Mom. That's M O L L for Molly Molly. Whoa! Look at 
at this. It's like a boat. I'm gonna go try that out. I think you can just sit on it. I don't know. Uh-oh. Can I move this thing? I'm not really sure how to drive a boat. I'm gonna try it, though. Come on, boat! Go! Go! Ah, this boat's broken. Huh. I'll try this one. This one's nicer. Oh, yeah, baby! Oh, yeah! Rip, rip. All right, I hope I don't run into that rock. Okay, yeah, I kind of want I want to see what happens. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Nothing happens. <laughs> this boat is really hard to move. I'm not sure if it's like, just cause I don't know how to use a boat, or what. I have to get back to shore though, cause I have to go pick up baby Kira from daycare. Swimming back to pick up baby Kira from daycare. There's daycare. I wonder if she had a good nap. Baby Kira. <gasps> baby Kira! She's missing! Where did she go? Oh my gosh. This is the worst daycare ever! You didn't take care of gosh, where is she? Wait a minute. Baby Kara's favorite game is hide and seek. So, I bet she's trying to play hide and seek. Here, Baby Kara. Here, Baby Kara. Where are you? Baby Kara. Hey. Well, she really likes pumpkins. Maybe she's around here somewhere. <laughs> hey, I hear her. Baby Kara. That was very naughty that you ran away. I was so worried about you. Get up, Papa. Oh, at least I found her. Oh yeah, oh yeah, I'm awesome. Come on, baby Kira. I need to take you back to your mom. You're kind of a troublemaker. Kaka papa! Kaka papa! Baby Kira, did you have fun today? Kaka papa! Uh huh. Kaka papa! Okay, baby Kira. Well. I think babysitting is a lot harder than I thought. Hey, there's some people here that are saying hi to me. Hi, unicorns. Um, hi, Lily. Hi, everybody. Nice to see you. Um, I I I'm so glad that you're a Toy Heroes fan. <laughs> um, I'll see you guys later, okay? Hi, hi, Cass. Oh my gosh, there's a lot of you. Everybody's coming to say hi. Hi, Galaxy Flower. <laughs> you guys are awesome. All right, guys. I'll see you next time. Bye.